up with a happy Roblox family. So happy, so, so, so happy. With mom, dad, Daisy, and Molly, and my baby. Kid, baby. <laughs> la, 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 la. Kid, baby. La, 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 la. We're the Star Squad smile. But I'm still hungry. Can I have some treats? Maybe some chocolate? A uh, candy bar? Something like that? No, your mom said no garbage food while I was on duty. Sorry. But, but Hannah, you have to let me eat some chocolate. Preferably, I would like to have a Hershey's bar or uh, maybe like something with peanut butter in the center. What are those called again? Reese cups. Yeah, Reese cups. Never those. <laughs> You're too funny, Molly, but no. Oh, okay, I guess I'll have to entertain myself a different way. Boing, 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 boing. Molly, are you seriously jumping on the couch? If I turn around and still see you jumping on the couch, you're going to be in so much trouble. I'm still jumping. You should probably give me some chocolate. Molly. Okay, you have five seconds to get down, Molly. One, two, three. Thank you, Molly. Four, five. We were just counting my jumps. Molly, seriously. Would you please do your chores? Please, Molly, do your chores. Okay, jeepers, Hannah, you've gotten kind of bossy. Well, uh, I'm not bossy, I'm a good babysitter. You're just driving me crazy. Okay, I'll do my chores. Mom always keeps some extra things in here, and I'm going to eat them. Da, 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 da. What, your mom doesn't keep cookies in the safe? Must be you don't like to eat cookies as much as I do. <laughs> Oh, good cookie. Mm. No wonder mom was hiding them from me. Mommy, are you eating sweets? I told you not to eat sweets. Yeah, and now I have way too much energy. Oh, no. Don't tell me you're going to bounce on the couch again. And you're eating a cookie. You're getting crumbs everywhere. Your mom's going to be so mad at me. Molly, that's it. I quit. Wait, Hannah. H Hannah? Uh-oh. Another one bites the dust. Yeah. The babysitter, that is, not the cookie. I can't believe I'm looking for a new babysitter again. Molly keeps making all of the babysitters quit, and I need to be able to get to my job every day. Uh, what am I going to do? I know, I'll Google it. Babysitter that can handle bratty, misbehaving children. <gasps> well, mostly just Molly, but anyway. Oh. Your kid will behave with my babysitting? Well, desperate times call for desperate measures. I guess I'll send her a message. Hi, I'm looking for a babysitter for my three kids. One is trouble. Don't worry, she'll behave with me. Well, you're hired. Molly, Daisy, time to wake up. Ugh. Ugh. Nah, Hannah usually lets us sleep in, Mom. Well, Hannah's not your babysitter today, Molly. Okay, baby Kira, I know you're hungry. Molly, get out of bed, seriously. What, why, what, what's going on? Where's Hannah? She quit, remember? Ow. Ah. Oh yeah, well I guess you get to stay home with us then, Mom. No, Molly, I have to work, and you have to be with the new babysitter. Now get out of bed so you can meet her. What, a new babysitter? <laughs> I'll have her quitting in less than 10 hours. <laughs> now girls, specifically Molly, 
I want you to be on your best behavior. This babysitter was the last resort and very expensive. So glue your mom, I'll behave as usual. Um, no promises. Uh-oh. Molly. Okay, fine, I'll try my best. I could jump on couch like Molly. No, baby Kira, do not act like Molly. Molly's very naughty. I don't want to be like Molly, I love her. Baby Kira, try to be like Daisy, please. Fine. Oh, she just texted me. Her name's Brooke, by the way. Brooke, like Brookie, like my best friend? Uh-huh, sure. She's probably awesome like Brookie then. Everyone named Brooke, Brookie, whatever, they're all awesome. Ooh, pancakes. Mama, you try to make Molly be nice so she behaves. Uh, yes, absolutely, Daisy. Mmm, those are good, Mom. Thanks. You're welcome. Baby Kira, what are you doing? You're not allowed to have my phone. I think Mom, but I want phone guy at five. No, no screen time this morning. Eat your baby food. I don't want you have a baby food. Oh, so I'm going to be the naughty one with the babysitter, huh? Not. One hour later. Mommy, the new babysitter's here. Try to behave yourself. As I said, no promises. Good morning. I'm Brooke. No television. But I'm a bunch of gymnastics. On my watch, there's no television and there's no fun. What? Oh, Kuwait! Mom, I owe the prison guard. Especially because of you, Molly. What? It's not my fault. I can't get by and get that from your fault, Molly. <gasps> I'm not a prison guard. I'm last chance babysitter. Let me tell you, I don't quit. You will behave. Now let's see. It's already pretty late. Time for those chores. Um, we don't really do chores on this day. Well, now you do chores every day I'm here. Starting with my laundry. Hop two. Your laundry. But, 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 but. Wow, this is a lot of laundry. Why are you bringing it here? You could have done it at home. I don't think so. Now, we will be going out for exercise in approximately 30 minutes. Uh-oh. So hurry up with that laundry. Oh, boy. Should have been nicer to Hannah, I guess. This is terrible. Maddie, don't complain. This lady seems crazy. Who knows what she'll do? Well, hopefully she she lets us go outside. Yeah, well, she already said we have to go out and exercise. Your favorite. Um, I don't exercise unless you count eating cookies. That's a lot of exercise for my mouth. Chew, 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 chew. Oh, boy. I, 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 looking up reviews on this babysitter. Everyone doesn't even know who she is. Where'd mom even find this lady? Hop, hop, hop to their little bunnies. Time to go outside and get some exercise. Um, I don't exercise. Wait, where's my stroller? Your stroller? You're not a baby. Well, I could probably squeeze in there with baby Kira. Wait, come back here. Uh, no, you are going to get some exercise. No lazy kids on my watch. Whoa, I, I don't even know what to say right now. Uh, you're kind of grumpy there, Brooke. I don't think you should be talking to me that way. Would you like a timeout for the rest of the day? Does the timeout include cookies, sitting down and watching TV? No, it includes an underground prison that I've made in your basement. Wait, what? When did you have time to do that? Probably while we were doing our laundry. Oh my gosh, look at your nails. Those are crazy. But anyway, could you help me? Excuse me, excuse me. Ooh, nice Louis Vuitton bag. Molly, quit getting distracted. Um, wait, come back. My babysitter, she's evil. I need help. Your babysitter seems super nice, kid. What are you talking about? Huh? Oh, Molly, there you are. Are you ready to have a fun day at the park? Brooke, you're wearing a smile? Who are you even? You were just a grumpy, miserable, mean babysitter. What? I have no idea what she's talking about. Don't listen to her. Um, do you, do you, seriously, listen to her. She's, she's just acting right now. Molly, I'm the nicest babysitter ever. What are you talking about? Now, come on. Okay, maybe I just misjudged her. Maybe she's not as evil as I thought. I just need to give her a chance. Glad you could join us, little brat. 
What? You were just so nice in front of that other lady. Yeah, but at last chance babysitting, I don't want to be nice. <gasps> I want you to behave. Whoa! Um, so you are actually mean? Ugh, no. I'm honest. You're a brat. Oh, that's not very nice. I'm gonna go jump on the trampoline. Not today, Molly. Get down. No fun for you, since you can't really behave yourself, ever. Oh my gosh, okay. I guess I'll just go stand over here then. Guys, I need to come up with a plan. Because this babysitter is super mean and grumpy. I'm going to expose her on Snapchat. Then, everyone in, in Roblox, they'll have to believe me. Okay, it's Molly here, guys. And I just want to make this little video because my mom hired this babysitter and she's so mean. So I'm about to show you guys so everybody will know. Did I say you could have any fun? I don't think so. I want to have fun because I'm at the park. I don't think so, kid. No fun. <coughs> See? She just made my little sister cry. Time to send this to everybody in Roblox. Hmm, what's this? I got a new snap. Wait, what? Is that babysitter being mean to you, honey? Yeah! And, and, and we need to call the cops! I think we just need to call your mom. Holy macaroni! There's an evil, mean babysitter in here! <gasps> Cute guy! That's right! Um, I, I don't know what to do! We're gonna call your mom, that's what! Oh, Molly! Everybody in all of Wilbur's got your snap! Including the babysitter. Maybe we should take baby Kiwa and run! What? <laughs> did the snap? That's it. You are going to have a timeout forever. I don't think so, lady. Molly, run! Oh, my God. This lady's crazy. Bacon hair. We need a ride. Get in, Molly. What's going on? Do you have room for my little sister? Do you have a car seat? Uh, we'll just ride here. We'll, we'll, we'll kind of good. You need to take us to the hospital. Why? Did someone lose an arm or something? No. Ew. Gross. Um, no. We... This, we have this really evil babysitter. And can you just drive the car while you sit here? Sorry. I didn't really get a really big uh, brain when I decided to be this bacon hair dude. Follow it, dude! Okay, I'm not very good at driving. Hey, man, can I have a ride? No, sorry, I gotta take these kids to the hospital. Something about losing an arm. Dude, bacon hair, we didn't lose an arm. Oh my god, this guy can't drive. Park it so I can drive it! Molly, we'd be faster off just running! Yeah, she's got a point. Let's go. Ah, and then I almost got run over by the free candy guy. Okay, um, when I see my mom, I am going to scream that she hired this babysitter. Daisy, the hospital is right here. Where are you going? Oh, yeah, I forgot about that. My brain was like in scared mode. Daisy, I'm confused. I don't know which one to go to. Imaging or emergency? I mean, I took an image with the Snapchat, but this is an emergency. Are you serious right now, Molly? Yeah, which one is it? Molly, imaging is for like an MRI or, or like x-ray. We have to go to an emergency. That's where mom works. Plus, this is an emergency, right? Ay, 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 Molly. I can't even with you. Mom! 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 Molly, I don't think you're supposed to run through the hospital like that. Oh, Molly! What's going on? Why are you here? Are you okay? Where's, where's my girls? Oh, okay. What's going on, girls? Mom, the babysitter's evil! What? No, you just don't like her because she makes you do your chores. Our chores? She made us do her laundry. Then she calls me a brat and she's really mean to me. What? What are you talking about? Mom, pull out your phone. Um, I sent you a chat, but you were a Snapchat, but you were just busy like with patients or something. Okay, well, let me look at my phone and see what you're talking about. <coughs> Wait, what? She was mean to my baby? <coughs> All three of them? That's it. She's fired and getting one star on Google. Yeah, um, last chance babysitting is not a very good business. Oh, I'm sorry, girls. But Molly, you were so naughty. I couldn't get any babysitter to not quit. Don't worry, Mom. I've learned my lesson. I've really learned it. I'm only going to eat one cookie and bounce on the couch once a day instead of more like a hundred. Molly. Molly. Okay, how about just one cookie and no bouncing on the couch? 
Molly. Mom, I can't live without my cookies. <laughs> dinner tonight. I was thinking about just doing DoorDash, but I do have this DiGiorno pizza. I think the girls would think that's delicious. Pizza's one of Molly and Daisy's favorites. <laughs> Set the oven to 350 for 20 minutes, and it should be all done when they get here. Daisy, did you hear what Sarah said at school today? Well, actually, they're a little bit early. <laughs> Hey girls, how was school today? Girls? Mom, I, 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 I'm so freaked out right now. Where's your sister? A boy here, we were standing outside talking about what Sarah told us at school today. Oh, Sarah's just a bully, don't pay any attention to her. No, Mom, I think what she said was actually true. Um, I'm not so sure about that, girls. What's that delicious smell? <gasps> it smells like we're having pizza for dinner. Are we having pizza for dinner? We sure are. Now tell me again what Sarah said at school today. Is she bullying you girls? <laughs> well, no, I don't think so. She told us that if we play three a a hide and seek at 3 a.m., something really creepy will happen. <laughs> you action, Molly. Not something. Lots of creepy things. <laughs> well... Here, girls, I'm just going to close the door because it's kind of chilly out right now. Um, but I'm just going to tell you that nothing creepy is going to happen if you play um, hide-and-seek at 3 a.m. But I will say this, you're not going to be awake at 3 a.m. to play it anyway. <laughs> You'll both be asleep because you have school tomorrow. I don't know, Mom. Part of me wants to test the theory just to see what happens. Don't be ridiculous, Molly. Girls, I'm telling you, Sarah was just making that up to be silly and to tease you or prank you or whatever. Whoa, Mom, DiGiorno pizza? Whose birthday is it? Nobody's. I just thought you girls would like something yummy after school. You're the best mom ever. Aww. Whoa, I'm home. Hey, honey. I still can't believe you grew that giant caterpillar on your face. Hey, I like my mustache. <laughs> How was everybody's day? Well, the girls had an interesting day with the school bully. Really? Who do I need to arrest? Honey, she's a kid. You can't arrest her, can you? Well, I don't know. Let me think about it. Dad, she told us she told us that that there's like there's um this crazy thing or things that happen if you play hide and say seek at 3 a.m. What? Well, that's probably just a myth. Come on, honey. Don't let the pizza get cold. Well, I don't know if it's a myth. It sounded really realistic. I mean, she said crazy, scary things happen. Well, trust me. I'm a police officer, and I haven't gotten any strange calls about 3 a.m. hide-and-seek games. That's because no one ever survives. <laughs> well, I'm just telling you that she's probably pranking you. That's what I said, honey. That's what I said. Mom, how many slices of pizza can I actually have? Um, well, as many as you want until you're full. Okay, you better make another DiGiorno. <laughs> I love pizza. Night-night, Daisy. Sweet dreams. If I can have sweet dreams thinking about the monsters or whatever that are going to happen at 3 a.m. Well, just don't play hide-and-seek and you won't have anything to worry about. True, true. But what if the monster comes to get me anyway? Daisy, I think Sarah is just a bully. You've known that she is ever since kindergarten. Don't listen to what she says. Okay, Mom, but I just feel like what she was saying was true. I know, sometimes bullies seem that way. Night-night, honey, I love you. Good night, Mom, I love you too. Wow, Molly fell asleep fast. It's not like her. <laughs> well, I guess she's not afraid of playing hide-and-seek at 3 a.m. Ah, she's too busy snoring away. Time to put baby Kira to bed. I better make baby Kira a bottle before bed. <laughs> she doesn't like to go to sleep unless she has her bottle. I'm gonna heat up her milk and she should be ready to go night night. There you are, sweetie. Are you ready for night night? I want a night night. I got one, one couch. I have lots of energy. 
play hide and seek. No, baby Kira, it's time for night night. Come on, I made up your bottle for you. I want Kanyanya. I can walk on the house. <laughs> you can find me. Oh, baby Kira. Well, good thing it's not 3 a.m. Well, creepy things might happen. <laughs> so silly. I remember when I believed silly things like that when I was a kid. Baby Kira, where are you? Is she hiding in Daddy's truck? She should be. Baby Kira, ah, oh, there you are, Baby Kira. <laughs> you better run to your room, or else you're gonna get a timeout. Uh oh, spaghettios. Yes, uh oh, spaghettios is right. Come on, up to your bed. It's night night time. One, two, three, four, five. Oh, the baby's ready to go to sleep. Guess my workout's done. Here you go, sweetheart. Take your bottle. Shh. Aww. Well, I guess I'll just leave it there for her in case she wakes up in the night. Oh, what do you think about the girls being afraid of this 3 a.m. hide and seek thing? I think it's just what kids are afraid of these days. Like Bloody Mary. Yeah, but I thought Bloody Mary was real. Well, I don't know. I never tried it, but it sounded like nonsense to me. Yeah, kind of creeped me out, I have to say. Well, <laughs> maybe you were a chicken. Ah! What? I'm a police ah! officer. Ah! Yeah, but you weren't when you were a kid. Yeah, true. All right, honey. Love you. Love you too. Good night. Good night. Oh, why'd you kick me? Because you're snoring so loud. All right, sorry about that. I don't want sheep. I'm not tired. I get up and run wild. I get to get what you got. My dad will never know. I go downstairs. Are you just my sheep of a baby? <laughs> Dan, did you just hear that? What? What? No, I didn't hear anything. What? What is it? Is it somebody that broke into the house? I... What? No. I thought it was baby Kira, but she's not in her crib. Where is she? Honey, I'm sure she's just going around the house being a baby. Ah, it's time to like, I don't know, get her a big girl bed, I guess, because she can get out of her crib. <gasps> no. I'm not ready for that. She can't be grown up that quick. I can't see you and you can't see me. I play hide and seek. Uh-oh. Oh no, she's playing hide and seek and it's exactly 3 a.m. Oh my God, no one told her that you can't play hide and seek at 3 a.m. Honey, I thought you were the one that didn't believe in all that stuff. Oh, okay. That was because I wasn't going to play hide and seek at 3 a.m. Honey, I'm sure it's fine. It's just a kid's myth. Come on, let's go find baby Kira and go back to bed. Okay. Baby Kira, where are you? Baby Kira? Um, come on now. This isn't really that funny. Oh my god, I can't find my baby anywhere. This is getting kind of insane. I'm getting kind of hungry. It's 3 a.m. and I'm getting the munchies. I think I better have a snack. Is that all you can think about is your stomach? Now I know exactly where Molly gets it from. Look, the doors were all locked. She can't reach the locks. She's in here somewhere. Honey? What, 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 what's that on the, 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 the back of your head? Wait, what just happened? Dan got kicked out of the game? Okay. That's creepy. Dan? Are you okay? What? Of course I am, honey. I'm just getting a snack. What? Why? Why wouldn't I be okay? Because you had an eyeball in the back of your head and then you got kicked out of the game. What? <laughs> no, I didn't. I've just been making this delicious sandwich. I get you why? You want my pizza? I must be super tired. I, I, I could have swore you had an eyeball on the back of your head and... You got kicked out of the game, so we lost our house! <gasps> what, honey? I think you're just freaking out about this 3 a.m. hide and seek thing. Yeah, <laughs> you're, you're probably right. Come on, baby Kira, it's time to go back to bed. I cannot wait to get in the safety of my bed. 
At least nothing's hiding underneath. Honey, <laughs> you've gone crazy. <laughs> I haven't gone crazy. I just, I'm just a little freaked out because I swear you, you left the game. <laughs> Everything's fine. Look, baby Kira's back in her bed. She's sleeping. Now, come on. Let's go back to bed ourselves. Okay. Will you hold my hand? I'm kind of afraid. Oh, of course I will, honey. I'm telling you, there's nothing to be afraid of. Okay. Ugh. Wait, what are you doing? I'm just brushing my teeth before I come in to go back to sleep. You know, you don't want to go to sleep with food in your teeth. You could get cavities. Yes. Um, okay. Huh, Laura's being so ridiculous about this 3 a.m. hide-and-seek creepy thing happening. <laughs> I don't even know what she's talking about. <sighs> brush, 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 brush. La, la, la. Ah! 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 What's wrong with my face? Ah! Ah! Laura, 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 wake up, wake up, wake up. What? What's going on? What, what's wrong with you? Look at my face! It's... it's... Oh, it's like a demon possessed me! Are you pranking me right now, Dan? No, oh, seriously! Look at my face! It's so creepy! <laughs> Whoa! Now who's the 3 a.m. challenge creeping out? Uh, I, I, <laughs> tell my face go back to normal! Dan, what has gotten into you? Come on, let's go look in the mirror. Nothing is wrong with your face. <sighs> My face! I don't even want to look at myself! Wait a minute. I look totally normal. Yeah, that wasn't a funny prank. Ow. I wasn't pranking you, Laura. When I looked in the mirror, it was creepy and crazy. Couldn't you see it? No, but you couldn't see the eyeball or the fact that you got kicked out of the game. Something really weird is going on here, Dan. It's freaking me out. Well, let's just go back to bed and hope that... Oh, morning comes sooner rather than later. Good idea. <coughs> this is getting way too creepy. <coughs> okay, baby Kira, I'm coming. Oh, this is the worst night. I'm not getting any sleep at all. Baby Kira? Where's baby Kira? Dan, baby Kira's missing. Oh, what? Uh, she's right there in her crib. No, she's not. She's not here at all. Huh? What? What are you talking about? Another round of hide and seek? I'm not sure I can deal with the creepy things that happen at 3 a.m. when you play hide and seek. Um, honey, did that door just open on its own? Oh, uh, I didn't open it. But I want to hide under my blankets. Oh. Man, we can't just hide under our blankets. Where's baby Kira? I hear her. Let's go see if we can find her. Baby Kira, this is not funny. You're gonna get a timeout for playing hide and seek. I'm right here. Ah, oh, there she is. Get back here. Wait, wh where'd she go? I, I don't know. She was right here. <coughs> Baby Kira? She's over there. Let's get her. Baby Kira. She disappeared again. Oh, what's going on, Laura? I don't like this. I don't like it either. Something really creepy is happening in our house. And it's messing with our baby. There she is out in the garage. Baby Kira, hang on, mommy's coming. She disappeared, again. Okay, whatever evil you are, you better not do this. Wait, the, the door just closed again on its own? Uh-oh. Yeah. You were talking to it and apparently it didn't like it. It locked us out of the house. Oh my god, our kids are in there! What are we gonna do? I don't know, something evil is in our house because baby Kira played hide and seek at 3 a.m. Don't worry. I'll get my hammer out of the safe. We'll break it. Yeah, good idea. But what are we gonna do then? <laughs> that sounds like baby Kira, only evil baby Kira. Well, I'm in the house. You first. What? You're the cop! You go first! Okay, fine. I think I think she's back upstairs. Laura, be careful. Something evil is in this house. I should probably go first. Okay, I'm not gonna complain about that. Look, she's back in her crib. Oh, I think everybody's safe. 
Um, maybe I should like Snapchat just in case. Snapchat? Why? Because this has been the craziest night of my life. Guys, something crazy happened when we played hide and seek at 3 a.m. Well, we didn't mean to, but our baby did. And all these evil things kept happening in our house. And we're warning you, don't play hide and seek at 3 a.m. Okay, I, I, I took the snap. Send it to everybody we know. We don't want this to happen to them, Laura. Okay, I will. Baby, 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 Kira? What's wrong, baby? What's wrong? She? She? Oh my god, what's wrong with her? to boop that like button for a delicious cookie. So glad to be home. That was the longest study session ever. Um, Mally, you locked me out. Well, you should have your own key, Daisy. Uh, yeah, I do, but I'm just saying, it, you didn't have to lock me out. Um, yeah, whatever. I'm going back to my room. Nice talking to you too, Molly. Jeepo, sometimes she's so rude. I wonder what they had for dinner. I'm starving. Ooh, cheese boobies, one of my favorites. Oh, hey, sweetheart. Did you just get home from your study session? Yeah, Mom, I did. It went pretty good. I think I'm ready for the test tomorrow. Oh, but I'm so glad to be home. I still have a lot to do before I go to bed, though. You do? Like what, honey? Well, I promised some of my friends that I would do a Snapchat of my night routine. Wow, that sounds really cool. Well, um, as long as you're in bed by like 10 o'clock, okay? Deal, Mom. So, anything else happen awesome today? Not really, just a lot of studying and schoolwork and stuff. But it's gonna get a lot more interesting when I do my Snapchat of my night routine because no one knows how to put pigtails in like me. Hey everybody, what's up? It's me, Daisy. I just got home from my study session and I promised you guys that I would do a night routine. So the first thing I'm gonna do is, you guys can see I'm in my bathroom right now. Uh, the first thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take a bath and wash my hair because the best way for me to show you how to put up my pigtails um, is to uh, take a bath and wash my hair first. I know what you're saying. Do you sleep in those pigtails? And the answer is yes, I do. Because after I wash my hair, if I put it up like this, I don't know. It just is so perfect the next day. It doesn't get all like tangled or anything. So I, I do sleep in my pigtails after I've washed my hair. So I'll be back in a minute, guys, with the second snap. But first, I'm going to show you how adorable I look right now. My name is Daisy, just like the flower. <laughs> so guys, um, I'll be right back after my bath. Daisy, I just got your snap and I have questions. Buddy, that right now. I'm getting ready to do my night routine and I have people that really want to see this. Okay, yeah, but I have questions about your snap. I mean, like, so you wash your hair and then you wear it in pigtails all night long? I mean, how does that even work? Like, like, isn't it uncomfortable to sleep on your, your pigtails? Buddy, I will answer all this in my Snapchat. Now get out of my bathroom! Okay, rude. Guys, I just got done with my bath, but I wanted to show you this part where I shampoo my hair because um, I use something really different than most people. I know this is kind of crazy, but I use baby organic shampoo ah. because it makes my hair so soft, just like a baby. It is like my favorite thing to use. I'm telling you, it will make your hair so healthy and soft. So I'm just going to hop back in the tub and show you guys how I put this um, baby shampoo in my hair. Let me just take that towel off. So just open the lid of the baby organic shampoo and just start putting it in your hair. The shampoo makes a lot of bubbles, but don't worry about it. Oh, it's some of it's like running down my face. Oh, oh, ow, 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 this, this is supposed to be baby shampoo. No more tears. What dials? Ow, it's hurting so bad. Okay, can I turn off the snap? Oh, I hope nobody sees that. My eye is burning. Ow, ow, ow. Daisy, are you okay? Molly, what are you doing? Get out of my bathroom. Um, but are you okay? You're like screaming. I, 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 I. 
Oh, Daisy! Your eyeball is disgusting! What happened to you? I got shampoo in it! It was supposed to be no more tears, but obviously they lied! Um, yeah, uh, I'm going to get mom. Ew! Oh, I think I'm gonna throw up or pass out. Oh. Molly, go get mom! I'm going, I'm going! Wow, I should turn Snapchat on. Everybody in the world should probably see this. Ouch! It hurts so bad! What's all this screaming about? You woke up baby Kira! Oh my god, Daisy! What happened to your eye? It's from that organic baby shampoo we got in my eye, Mom! Oh my god, we have to take you to the emergency room. That doesn't look good. Yeah, we definitely should take you to the emergency room. Okay, guys, check this out. My sister's eyeball is hanging out. Molly, are you putting this on Snap? Uh, uh, Molly, turn that off right now. We need to drive your sister to the emergency room. Go get baby Kira. And Daisy, um, put on some clothes, okay? Okay, I'll try. My eyeball just really hurts. I gotta do Snap for Molly. I wonder what it is. She's probably just telling me to feel better. <laughs> Molly, you Snapchatted me with, with my eyeball like this? Are you kidding me? Ugh, Molly! Oh, Mom, hurry. It hurts so bad. Okay, Daisy, I need to ask you to do something for me. Uh, probably not panic would be a good thing. Daisy, I think you should never wash your hair ever again. Wait, what? Yeah, look at the danger that can happen when you wash your hair. Uh, Mom, I think that's a little unreasonable. You might be freaking out just a little bit. Come on, let's go into the emergency room. Hurry! Okay, sweetie, how are you feeling after that medicine? A lot better, but will my eye heal? Of course it will. According to Dr. Google, it will heal in about two weeks. But your side effects could include having, well, random bouts of diarrhea. Wait, what? If the sides fail coming up, that doesn't work for me. Uh, yeah, I know, but I'm sorry. It's just a side of the fact of that. And, well, just try not to eat too many bean burritos. Ay, ay, ay. Could this day get any worse? Doctor, how is she? Well, like I said, this medicine can cause lots and lots and lots of... Let's not talk about that anymore, please. Did you guys hear that? Daisy's gonna have lots and lots and lots of diarrhea. Man, that really stinks. Get it? That stinks? <laughs> Molly, are you Snapchatting that? Um, uh, Molly, seriously, stop making snaps of your sister in this horrible situation. It's not very nice. Um, okay, sorry. I'm not sure this day could get any worse. Well, you also have to wear an eye patch over that eye for at least two weeks. Nope, I was wrong. The day just keeps getting worse. Now I'm going to be a pirate for two weeks. Great. Molly, why are you sending me a Snapchat right now? Just check it out, Daisy. It's adorable. Will she chase her own eyeball? <laughs> Molly, did you just make me into a googly-eyed puppy? Oh, you're ruining my life, Molly. I can't believe I have to go to school with my pigtails looking like this. I couldn't even sleep in them last night. Uh, Daisy, your pigtails are the last thing I'd be worried about. I mean, what about the fact you're wearing that pirate bandage and your eyeballs hanging out? I, I, I'm having the worst life ever. I wonder if I could fit in my locker. I could hide in there all day. Don't be ridiculous. It's not like I send any of the snaps to anybody else, but just you and, like, Brookie. Oh, well, that's a relief. Oh, when someone asks what happened, I'm just going to tell them, oh, I got a little scratch. I should be fine. Oh, my God. Look at this Snapchat of Daisy. Ew, your eye was, like, falling out. That's so gross. Wait, what? what? Let me see that. Molly, you sent it to the entire school. Wait, what? Uh-oh. Molly, what? Turn around and face me. I would, but I don't know where your face is because it's all bandaged. <laughs> Molly, how could you? This is so embarrassing. Yeah, but you're going to be, like, so popular. Share that on TikTok and you could be, like, a TikTok star. I mean, your eyeball was, like, hanging out from that shampoo. Gross and cool and weird and ew. <laughs> Tell me how you really feel about it, Stephanie. Okay, I just did. Duh. <laughs> hey there, Cyclops. Whoa. That is so crazy and weird. Is your eyeball going to, like, fall out? 
Cyclops. Oh, oh no, I really can't see. <laughs> okay, what's that say? Toy. Toy, let's. Oh, perfect. I can hide in here until the entire day is over. Oh my god, it's so embarrassing. Daisy, are you okay? Molly, go away. I'm never gonna be okay until this is over. Daisy, come on. Come out of the bathroom. I would if I could find the doorknob, but I don't know where it is. Okay, just just move your hand up the door and and Where's the doorknob? I can't find it! Oh, this is so annoying! Why did this have to happen to me? I was just trying to wash my hair and do my night routine! And my life is just ridiculous right now! Okay, wait, I found the doorknob. I'm sorry this is happening to you, Daisy. Me too, Molly! It's so bad! And every time I cry because I'm sad, it burns my eyeball! And I don't know what to do! Oh, Dizzy, maybe it's getting better already. I mean, let's just take the bandage off. We're not supposed to take it off for two weeks, Molly. Yeah, but you heal super fast. Remember that time you fell off your bike? And you cut your knee and it was healed like the next day? Your eye is probably all better already! Do you think so, Molly? I think so, Daisy. Let's take off the bandage. Well, here goes nothing. I hope you're right. And I think it's probably healed, just like you said. My day will get so much better, because it is. Oh, no, 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 no. Daisy, just, just put the bandage back on. Uh, no, yeah, you should definitely listen to the doctor. Ooh, put it back on. Wait, why? <gasps> you said it was all better, right? Um, it, uh, it needs a little bit more healing. Yeah, that's it. Like, a little bit more needs to heal. <laughs> but sure, it's looking a lot better. <laughs> It looks terrible, doesn't it? Daisy, don't look in the mirror. D don't do it. Ah! I'm hideous! I can't believe this! It's, 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 it's a disaster! Well, um, the one good thing about the pirate patch is, well, um, it doesn't look as terrible as that does. Uh... Daisy, I have an idea. Stay here. Really? Why? Just trust me on this. I'll be right back. I have to go to the school nurse. School nurse? What's she doing? Here, Daisy, put this on your eye instead. Okay, well, that doesn't cover your total eye, but it definitely covers the part where it was hanging out. And it's got a cute little heart on it. Look at it. Oh, wow. That looks so much better, Molly. I mean, it still looks like I got hurt, and you did snap it to everybody in the school, but it's not as ugly as that other one. It's actually kind of, well, cute. It matches my shirt. Thanks, Molly. I'm really sorry that I accidentally sent that snap to everyone. I really didn't mean to. It's okay, Maddie. It happens. Thanks for being so nice to me today. You're welcome, Daisy. And I'm sorry this happened to you. Try not to get shampoo in your eye ever again. Oh, I learned my lesson. I definitely did. Uh, no more baby shampoo for me. I'm making homemade shampoo out of like the most gentle stuff like coconuts and you can make your own homemade shampoo, you know that, Molly? Uh, yeah, if you're not too lazy. I mean, I'm totally lazy, but then I don't wash my hair every day anyway. Ew, Molly, what? No, I can't wash it because it gets crazy if I wash it every day. You're just saying that because you want to be lazy. Okay, yeah, well, maybe a little. Well, should we get to class? You love science class. Yeah. I guess I have to face everybody with this eye patch again. Well, it's a lot better than your eyeball hanging out. <laughs> yeah, true. <laughs> gymnast she's up next special news report sorry we have to interrupt your gymnastic competition what oh uh, they always do this every time <laughs> there's nothing on but this news channel what are they talking about 
Well, a woman went missing for years, but our big news today, Stephanie, is that it's Wear Your Favorite Color Day! And guess what? If you wear your favorite color, you get a free ice cream! Wow! Say what? Oh my god, this is amazing! It's a fashionista's dream! Wear my favorite color, get an ice cream. How do they know if you're being honest about what your favorite color is, though? I mean, what if your favorite color is blue, like me, but you wear pink? They're just trusting you, man. <gasps> oh, wow, that's pretty nice of them. Well, I'm gonna wear my favorite color. Oh, wait, I already am. No, Molly, you have to wear your favorite color all the way from top to bottom. <laughs> and I have to paint my skin blue? <laughs> okay, that's a little weird. I'll show you what, how to do it, Molly, because I'm a fashionista and I know this kind of stuff. Boom, perfect. Pink is obviously my favorite color. I even have a pink lollipop. Holy guacamole, Daisy. <gasps> your hair looks so different. Well, it's wear your favorite color day, so I decided to take down my pigtails and dye my hair pink. Whoa, <laughs> you're definitely going to get the free ice cream. All right, well, I guess it's my turn. And what's your favorite color, baby Kiwa? Rainbow! Uh, baby Kiwa, you don't understand the assignment. It's supposed to be your favorite color. I don't stand, I told you. Rainbow! <laughs> I didn't know it is. No, you're just supposed to pick one color. Just let her do what she wants. She's a baby. I'm sure they'll give her a free ice cream anyway. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> okay, well, um, let's get dressed. We can put our ice cream. No, we're getting dressed in our favorite colors because we love being our favorite color. No, I'm just doing it so I can get free ice cream. Why are you so tall? Take off those heels. I don't think so. I think these heels look adorable on me. Yeah, but they make you look a giant. Uh, correction. They make me fabulous. <coughs> Is everybody ready to go? Molly, what are you wearing? My imposter costume from last Halloween. It's the bluest thing I own. I'm blue. I'm blue. Molly, I am not being seen out in public with you wearing that. What? I think I look great. I did it, I did it, I did it, I did it, Oh, baby Kira, look at how cute she looks in that little rainbow dino sweatshirt. She looks adorable. That is a cute hoodie. But Molly, we are not going like that. Too bad I'm going like that. We are going for ice cream. Let's go. <coughs> Molly, you can't even walk in that costume. You just sort of waddle. Well, <laughs> too bad. Actually, I'll be waddling after I eat all that ice cream anyway, so I don't really care. Ay, ay, ay. Can't believe this girl is my sister. Watch this. This is so cool about Roblox. I'm totally going to teleport. <gasps> do, 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 do. <laughs> awesome. Uh, Dizzy, why did you bring your own spoon? <laughs> they have spoons at Coastal Combs. What? What are you talking about? On the side of your bag? There's a spoon there. What? Honey, that's not a spoon. It's the handle to my bag. Um, okay. Anybody who's watching this video right now, slam the like button if you think Daisy's purse looks like it has a spoon on it. Come on. That looks like a spoon. It's not a spoon. Uh, this is a very fashionable bag. It looks like a spoon. <laughs> I did not wear a spoon on my purse. Ay, ay, ay. Hey, Molly, look, there's a fitness center over there. We could work out after we get our ice cream. The only thing I'm worried about is fitting this whole ice cream cone in my mouth. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, very funny. Welcome to Coastal Cones. <sighs> what can I get for you? Yuck, we're very good food, good combo, and we get free ice cream cone. Oh, look, I haven't heard that all day. What are, you supposed what are you supposed to be, a blockhead? Um, no. It's my costume from last Halloween. And it's from that game of Long Ass, and my favorite color is blue. Could I have a strawberry ice cream with two scoops, please, for free? Whatever. Here you go. Yeah. Being wearing your favorite color, Daisy, she sure is grumpy. Hey, what's your favorite color? I don't have a favorite color. Say what? You don't have a favorite color? Who on earth doesn't have a favorite color? Apparently she doesn't, the ice cream worker. You might not want to eat that. 
lollipop while you're also eating the ice cream. You're gonna rot your teeth. Um, yeah, okay, I have a chocolate ice cream cone, please. Excuse me, I did order strawberry, I ordered chocolate. Too bad, that's what you get. Um, yeah, okay. I am a, a rainbow ice cream. You get this, watermelon. She obviously is not very happy about it being your favorite color, thing. I hate it. I've had to work twice as hard at this ice cream shop today because the owner said I had to give out free ice cream. Mwah. I think that would make you really happy that you got to be so nice to people. Well, it doesn't. Come on, sisters. Let's go over to the beach and relax while we have ice cream. Hey, you don't have to say thank you to me or anything. It's not like I've been working all day. What'd she say? Man, she was grumpy. Snapchat, Snapchat, set me free. Take these colors away from me. Daisy, what is going on with your hair? And your clothes. You look like Corella DeVille. What? What are you talking about? Ah! Whoa, what are you guys wearing? Baby Kill, why are you dressed out in black? And Molly, what is he? what is up with you? What? What are you talking about? I'm wearing my costume. It's a totally different one. It's just black and white. I get from Alien or some creepiness right there. O M G. We've been cursed. What? what are you talking about? It's in the ice cream. I bet. Stop eating it. Wait, but why? Why would we be cursed? I think yeah, the ice cream person who gave us the ice cream mask. And she made it turn black and white. And she made it turn black and white. Wait, what? Why would she do that? Um, because she's really angry about having to serve this much ice cream today. Did you not notice? Guys, I think the town is looking a little black and white too. O-M-G! Let's go talk to her. Maybe she'll change your mind. Or maybe she'll tell us what the antidote is for the ice cream cone. Ha 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 ha! This is perfect! No more serving ice cream to all you brats! What? That's not very nice! You are more like the ice cream than the ice cream, Sofa! That's right, I am the ice queen! Ha 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 ha! I make everyone's heart turn to ice and everything black and white! <gasps> well, um, I was wondering, uh, could you? Kind of turn us back because I like pink. It's my favorite color. I don't think so. I just asked Snapchat to take all the colors away and everybody's losing their color one at a time until the entire town has been washed of color. <laughs> so you did this with Snapchat? Jeepers, I thought it was something you put in the ice cream. Nope. Snapchat granted my wish. Holy guacamole. Well then, if that's true, I'm gonna pull out my Snapchat. Hey everybody, it's Daisy and don't even bother. I'm the Ice Queen and I'm in charge of Snapchat. Oh really, are you? Then what's this rainbow color? <laughs> oh Daisy, you're starting to sound like the evil one. Wait a minute. That put a rainbow face on me, too! How could this be? Well, I just happen to be amazing at Snapchat. And obviously your spell with Snapchat isn't working any longer. It is, because everything is black and white. Listen, if you hate your job at the ice cream shop, maybe you should try something else. I mean, evil ice cream's working for you pretty good. Wait, are you saying that I should try getting a different job? Yeah. You don't like the one you got, obviously, if you're turning the whole town black and white. Sheepers, creepers. Career change for you is necessary, I think. I do your job. I love ice cream, and I bet you get free cones, don't you? I like ice cream. If you work at ice cream shop, I will be there when you eat the ice cream with you, Molly. Oh. I don't have to serve ice cream to brats anymore? Huh. Why didn't I think of this before? <laughs> I'm off to be an evil villain. <laughs> now hear me, world. I am the villain 
Ice Queen! Is she seriously standing on top of the picnic table? <laughs> uh, Molly, just let her have a moment. Obviously, she's totally crazy. <laughs> I will make the whole world black and white. <laughs> Whoa! Losing my balance. Whoa! She's not really good at being a villain either. <laughs> yeah, I don't know what her job should be. Whoa, Molly Jack, a big ice cream cone bar with the freaking. I'm thinking that if we start serving everybody ice cream again, the world will go back to color. Ooh, that would be wonderful. Well, let's start with us. This ice cream looks delicious. I want some blueberry flavor. Mmm. A pile on some watermelon. What else makes me happy? Chocolate, strawberry, and mint chocolate chip. Woo, this ice cream looks so good. Daisy, it worked. Yay! We're back to our normal selves. And our town is back to color too. Um, the evil villain is still laying out there. And she's still black and white. It's because she's not happy. I think if we start giving everybody ice cream, everything will be back to normal. Agreed, Molly. Hey guys, welcome to my Snapchat. Today I'm working at Coastal Cones. And if you're still black and white, don't worry. I can change you back to color and you get a free cone while you're doing it. Head on down, guys. You think that will work, Daisy? Ah, uh, well, here's our first customer. Hey, guys. Luke, <gasps> is that you? Yeah, I got the black and white curse and... Uh... I need to have some ice cream to see if I can get rid of it. What's your favorite? Mint chocolate chip. You got it. Mint and chocolate. Eat this and you should be back to color in no time. Wow, this ice cream is delicious. What happened to us anyway? Well, basically there was an evil ice cream that used a Snapchat curse to turn the entire town black and white, including us. Um, wear your favorite color day. I know, I was so excited about wear your favorite color day. can't believe she did that. Yeah, she was really unhappy with her job. Whoa, it worked! Can you guess what my favorite color is? Um, green. You guessed it, Molly. You know me so well. Uh, yeah, we've been friends since preschool. Of course I do. Molly, what are you doing? Uh, last year's Halloween costume because my favorite color is blue, duh. Oh, <laughs> I should have known you would have done that. So there you have it, guys. Make sure you're using your Snapchat for good and not evil. Don't try to take people's colors away or their happiness away. Don't bully or be mean on Snapchat. Just be yourself and then other people will be themselves too. And come on down to Coaster Cones if you want a free ice cream cone. All right, guys, have a wonderful day. And don't forget to subscribe. Bye! Daisy, what are you doing laying on the floor? <laughs> I was just trying to do the gymnastics that I just saw on the TV and it didn't go so well. <laughs> That's why you should be lazy like me. You don't ever have to worry about, you know, falling over onto the floor. Ooh. Girls, have you done your chores? <laughs> no, Mom, but what I have done is found an amazing game on my phone. Monster Slayer, level one Slime King. Whoa, Molly, that looks like so much fun. Okay, basically, I just gotta, like, um, just, like, blast him, and I get all these coins. Oh, yeah, that's a nah. That's so annoying, though, because, like, your finger just starts to get, like, really tired, and then what are you supposed to do? Upgrade, Molly, upgrade, upgrade. Okay, I'm gonna try to upgrade. Oh, what? And I can have, like, all these other damages. I only have 90, though. So I need to go back. Girls, I really do think you should probably, you know, do some of your chores or your homework. Nah, Mom, I don't think so. Ooh, balloon game, stacking blocks. What can I... Oh, wow. Oh, my God, I'm doing so good. Bah! Uh, oh! Oh! Molly, you almost got it on that one. Try again. This game is actually harder than it looks. Whoa! Oh, wait, um, Brookie's calling me. Um, all right, we gotta stop our game for a minute. Hello? Oh, hey, Molly. Hey, Brookie. Uh, I was wondering, do you want to come, like, hang out at my house later? Or just, like, right now would be even better? Uh, I would love to. Can Daisy come? Because I know she's gonna ask me. Well, I am 
some of fun too, Molly. Yeah, you both are invited. Um, but are you bringing your baby sister? Because the last time she chewed up all of my shoes. Ooh. Wait, what? She's a baby, not a puppy. I know, but she was teething and she chewed my favorite leather sneakers. Oh, sorry about that. <laughs> um, yeah, she's not coming along. Um, but, uh, you want us to be there in like five minutes or so? Um, yeah, five minutes if you can. Okay, we'll see you then. Bye, Pookie. Okay, Molly, I have to go get my phone because we're going to make some Snapchats, I'm sure, while we're at our house. Yeah, exactly. Go get it and um, I'll meet you back down here. Sounds good, Molly. Hey, everybody, what's up? I'm about to go over to my best friend Brookie's house and, like, I don't do any chores or anything, but I don't really care because I'm just going to go have fun and... Whoa, Dad! <laughs> my dad's home from work and look at guys, he's got a dog face too. Not funny, Molly. Turn off the phone. Dad, we're making a Snapchat. Molly. Okay, fine. Wow, rough day at work. You're really grumpy. I'm grumpy because there is stuff all over the floor, and the dishwasher isn't unloaded, and Ooh. this was all chores that you and Daisy were supposed to do, and you didn't. Why? Well, we were going to, but then we were playing this game on our phone, and it actually two games, and they were really fun, and then our friend Brookie called, and she wanted us to come over, Dad, and we were like, yes, we'll come over. That would be so fun. We'll make so many snaps for Snapchat. Molly, you can't go anywhere. You didn't even do any of your chores. Um, well, um, Mom said I could. Mom, Dad won't let us go to Brookie's. He's being really rude and saying we have to do chores. Yeah. Well, I don't see any harm in them going to Brookie's for a while. Laura, these girls never do their chores. We have to get on the same page here. Uh-oh. Hey, I mean, they're just young. They just want to go have fun. Yeah, Dad. Girls just want to have fun. Um, haven't you ever heard that song? We do. We want to have fun. Ugh. Laura, can I see you outside for a minute? Um, okay, sure. Molly, you stay here. This is grown-up talk. Uh, okay. I wonder what my parents are talking about. I know. Oh, I put it on Snapchat. Hey, everybody. Um, so my dad is, like, really strict, but my mom is really fun and, like, Pretty much, well, I wasn't centered. Okay, now, what, what's going on with this camera angle? Okay, all right, there we go. <laughs> anyway, my dad is strict and my mom is not. She always lets us go have fun and now he wants to talk to her outside. Bum, 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 Let's go see what this is all about. Our kids are turning into brats. Oh, come on now. They just want to have some fun. We, we need to get on the same page. They are very bratty. Oh my gosh, guys, did you just hear that? My dad told my mom that my sister and I are bratty. <sighs> What's going on? What? Oh. oh man, my phone battery's about to die. And, 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 and I'm, I'm trying to capture this. Oh, I can't make it, this snap on Snapchat if I, my phone dies. Oh no, it died. Oh. Well, I'm still gonna listen to what they have to say. You have to start agreeing with me that these kids are becoming brats. What do you say, Laura? Our children are brats. Our children need to behave. Our children need to behave. This starts now. Holy macaroni and cheese. What just happened to my mom? I've got to go tell Daisy. Daisy! Daisy, where are you? I'm getting my phone, Molly. I was just thinking, where did I leave it again? I think I might have let Baby Kiro watch Coco Melon on it. It's probably in her crib. Daisy, stop it. I have to tell you something important. Oh, look, I found it. There it is. Daisy, Mom just turned into this, like, weird, strict mom. <laughs> what? What are you talking about? Why are you freaking out? Because Mom, she's weird and strict now and crazy. <laughs> Molly, quit it. I hate when you prank me. Girls, where are you? Here she comes, Daisy. Hide! I'm hiding behind the door. Molly, what are you doing? Molly, where are you? She's up here hiding behind the door, be crazy. Whoa, Mom! Did you go to the salon today? You look, um, different. Where is Molly? Um, uh, Daisy! Sorry, Molly, I have to tell her I can't lie. She's behind the door. Molly, come out from behind the door, please. Um, okay. I have some jobs for you girls to do. 
Oh yeah, mom, but you said we could go to Bookies and- I don't care what I'm set. You're staying home. <laughs> Told you she was the weird strict mom. What? What did you just say? Ooh. Um, you're the nicest mom in the world. We love you so much. Time to plunge the potty, Molly. <laughs> while I take a little nap. Uh, <laughs> while you're a little big to sleep in the crib. You will be next, Daisy. But first, Molly, <laughs> plunge the toilet. Oh, gross. Yeah. I took off my favorite um unicorn sweatshirt because there's no way I'm getting doo-doo on that. I can't believe my mom is going to make me plunge the potty. What's wrong with her? She turned into a weird strict mom right in front of my eyes. Ah, it's a giant poo-poo. Oh, <laughs> gross. There's no way I'm plunging that. I'm out of here. <laughs> Where do you think you're going? Ah, um, yeah, I'm going to plunge the toilet. Of course I am, mom. Very good. Make sure the job gets <gasps> done right. Um, okay. Okay, listen, Poo Poo, it's you against me. You're going down! As in flush down? <laughs> Into the sewer? Yep, that's what's happening right now. <laughs> ah! The Poo Poo! It's, it's attacking me! Ah! Ah! Oh my gosh! Yeah. <laughs> Help somebody! Ah! I never want to plunge the toilet ever again! Oh, Daisy! Come here, Daisy! Yes, Mom, what is he? I would really like a patty. Um, okay. My feet are really sore and yeah. tired. You expect me to touch those? I don't think so, lady. Really? Are you talking to me like that, your own mother? Now, please go get the nail files. You're gonna need more than a nail file. Look at your toenails, they're black, and they look like talons. Holy guacamole, you could catch a trout out of the river with those things. You look like an eagle. Holy <gasps> guacamole, I don't want to touch those grody things. I can't believe you're talking to your mother this way. Either do it or shut the controversies. Hey guys, it's me. My phone just charged up or I would have shown you where my mom turned into a weird strict mom. But I'm sending out this Snapchat because my mom has gone bonkers. First, she had me plunge the toilet and um, insert the largest poop emoji <laughs> ever here because it was ew. And now she's having Daisy give her a pedicure. Only her toes are really gross. I hope somebody's watching this and can help us. So guys, I'm spying on my weird strict mom right now and Daisy's about to give my mom a pedicure. I, I'm gonna show you guys how crazy, weird, and strict she really is. Um, yeah, uh, try not to make my toes too short. I like my nails to be a certain way. Huh, <sighs> your feet smell so bad. I can't take it. Ugh. What? You passed out? My feet don't even smell that bad. I washed them two weeks ago, so I don't know what you're being a baby about. Ugh, what a terrible day. Ugh. What are you doing, Molly? I'm cleaning up the playroom like you told me to. No, go feed our pet monkey right now. What? What? We have a pet monkey? <laughs> yes, of course we have a pet monkey minion. Whoa, a pet monkey? That's so cool. Maybe this day isn't so bad after all. I mean, my mom is still weird. Who has a pet monkey? That's weird. But she might not be strict because strict moms wouldn't have a pet monkey. So she's just weird and not strict. This I can live with. Sure, mom. I'll go, um, feed your pet monkey. Good. He's in the spare bedroom. Make sure you give him two scoops of monkey food. Okay, will do, Mom. I bet this monkey's gonna be so adorable. We're gonna be the bestest of friends. I can't wait to meet the little monkey. Oh, he's gonna be so adorable. Aww. Sweet little cute monkey. <laughs> what is that monkey doing? Ew! It took a giant popo in here. Ooh. Okay, just why doesn't this door unlock? Why? Ooh, oh, ah, 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 oh, ah, 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 Smells like poo in here, crazy monkey! Ah, 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 psycho monkey! Psycho monkey! Oh, God. Oh, please tell me the front door will open. Oh, why won't it open? Okay, ah! Oh, ah, 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 Just get in the house.
house and slam the door shut, then the monkey can't get in. And bye-bye, monkey. Yeah, go back to the zoo, you crazy lunatic. <laughs> Why did I eat that extra cupcake? Oh, God. I can't run very fast. Slam it into face. Ah! Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> He's really mad. <laughs> He's going crazy. Oh, oh, this has been the craziest day ever. Okay, I'm just going to see if anybody's replied to my Snapchats because someone must see that this has gone crazy. All right, maybe if I just hide in the bathroom here. Okay. <sighs> Wait, what? N no one has replied? Oh. Wait, no signal? What's going on? Come on, you stupid phone! Oh, this phone is such a piece of junk! <laughs> I've turned off the internet. What? Uh, oh, Mom, I didn't see you there. Sorry, I didn't mean to get out of my phone. I was just checking the time. Wanted to make sure I had lots of time to clean all these things. Yep, clean them all. <laughs> There's no internet for you. No Snapchat. No fun ever again. <laughs> I'm the wee strict forever. One hour later. One eternity later. And another. pizzeria together molly so 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 what uh daisy probably just gave him a ride hey guys what's up i uh luke just texted me and said he needed a ride see told you would have been nice if you gave me a ride sorry molly you were going over to pick up Fuki. hey everybody oh hey luke <laughs> what's up not much uh daisy just gave me a ride because she's really <laughs> i mean really nice <gasps> oh <laughs> thank you so, um, we're gonna go get pizza? Yeah, I thought so. Rosa Pizza is, like, the best. Except for if you count going to Chuck E. Cheese. What? Chuck E. Cheese? I haven't been there since I was, like, baby, a baby or something. <laughs> yeah, I think the last time we went, we were, like, three or four years old. I totally want to go to Chuck E. Cheese. It's so fun there. And a little bit creepy. Chuck E. is, like, something from my worst nightmares. <laughs> Wrong Chucky, Molly. Nope, 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 nope. I'm talking about Chuck E. Cheese, the giant creepy rat. Seriously? You're afraid of a giant mouse? Yeah, he is kind of creepy. Well, maybe he took the day off. I'm gonna go to Chuck E. Cheese and play some games and eat pizza. Yeah, me too. Let's see if we can all stuff inside my car. I don't know, Daisy. Your car is really small, but we might be able to all fit in here. I get shotgun. See, we all fit. Just goes kind of slow because Molly ate too many cupcakes for lunch. What? Okay, I can't even deny that one. I probably did eat too many cupcakes for lunch. Chucky e. Cheese is so much fun. Daisy, way to run every single red light in the entire game. Uh, I didn't run that one. It was green. Yeah, but you just ran that one. Daisy, you just drove right by it. I'm parking in the back. Chill out. Does anybody else notice that Molly and Daisy fight a lot? It's probably because they're sisters. Definitely the most annoying sister. Whoa, Chucky e. Cheese got a makeover. Yeah, no creepy animatronics or anything. <gasps> yeah, just so many cool games. <laughs> so one of my favorites. All right, I'm going to snap this because I just feel like um, people might not know that our town has such an awesome Chucky e. Cheese right now. Hey, guys, there's my BFF, Brookie. There's my annoying sister, Daisy. Hey, Molly Boo. And there is my um, friend, yeah, friend, Luke. And we are at the new and improved Chuck E. Cheese. Look at this. This looks amazing. They have air hockey. They have bowling. Hey, Molly, they've got your favorite crane game. What? Okay, I got to finish this Snapchat, guys, because I'm going to go play crane game with um, Luke. Okay, bye. Hey, Molly, did you know that if you stick your arm up inside the crane game, um, you can actually just, like, take a toy out of there? What? That's cheating. I know, I would never do it, because you know I'm not a thief, but 
I just think it's kind of cool that you could actually do it. One time I watched this kid like crawl up in there and he got all the toys. And then he took a nap inside. You're making that up! No, I'm not. I'm being serious. <laughs> oh my god, that's crazy. Well, um, I'll be right back because I'm gonna go get a soda, but then we can play Korean game. Do you want a soda too, Luke? Sure, that would be great. I'd love one. Okay. Be right back. He really likes me. <gasps> Well, we're just waiting on the waiter or waitress to come take our order because I'm starving and I want something to tweet. Yeah, Luke's waiting to play crane game with me, but I want some soda too. Oh, I can't wait to snap this. Oh, I look so cute today. Hey, everyone. Just looking adorable at my job. Excuse me, but not to be rude, but we're really hungry and we want something to drink. Can you please take our order? Yeah, and our friend Luke over there definitely wants something to drink and eat too. Wait a minute. There were ten toys in that crane game, and now there's only nine. Whoa, but friend Luke must have won one. No, there was no more money put into it because every time money gets put in, we get like a little signal on our phones that tells us that. Whoa, really? Yeah, it shows us every time we make a sale at Chuck E. Cheese, and I didn't get one. So, did your friend just steal from the crane game? Well, I just heard him say that you could stick your arm up in there and get a free toy. Um, Daisy, I'm not sure we should tell her that. Our friend Luke, he doesn't steal anything. Well, maybe we should let the police decide. What? No, put away your phone! He didn't do it! He's innocent! Let's just let the police decide whether he stole a toy or not. Lady, why are you being so rude to my boyfriend? <gasps> your Ow. boyfriend? Who said it was your boyfriend? Oh no. Are you guys going to fight over Luke? I mean, your sister's first, and then your friend's with Luke's second. Well, there's no fighting. He's my boyfriend. He's actually neither of your boyfriends. Well, I'm sure he didn't steal anything. Luke, Luke, they're about to call the cops. Wait, what? Why? Did Chuck E. Cheese come back? Has he gone crazy like you said? No, there's a toy missing from the crane game. And no money got put in. There was supposed to be ten toys, and now there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. There's two missing toys. Well, I didn't take them. I don't know what happened. It wasn't me. Well, it had to be somebody, and you were the only one standing here. Are you accusing me of stealing those toys? <gasps> I thought we were friends. Ah, uh, no, I'm not accusing you. I'm just saying that the police are coming. Uh-oh. I think you're innocent, though. Well, I'm sure it's just all a misunderstanding. Where's the criminal? I'm going to take him down. What? There's no criminal here. Actually, someone stole two toys from the crane game. And I looked at the surveillance footage and you were the only one. <laughs> yeah, but that doesn't mean he took it. Yeah. Maybe he's very good at being a thief. Is this the first time you've stolen from a crane game? <gasps> are you a serial crane game thief? Uh-oh. Um, I don't even know if that's a real sentence you just said, but... Maddie, don't talk to the police like that. You'll be arrested next. Well, I'll be hauling you off to jail now. Wait, what? You can't take him. He's, he's my friend. Yeah, and he's gonna stay here, lady. It's okay, Molly. I'm sure this is all a misunderstanding. Yeah, you'll be out in no time. I just know it. Mm-hmm. Sure you will. That's what all the criminals say. Come on, let's go. <laughs> Hey, you, there, in my bed. Huh? What? Ugh, you're in the wrong jail cell. This is my room. No! Jail cell number one is mine! This is only my third time in here, and I always am in number one. Oh, sorry. Did you just get taller? No, I was just squatting down, so I didn't want to make you feel as bad. But now, since you're just trying to steal my bed, I just gonna have to beat you up what no i i i'm not like a, a criminal i i they said i stole two toys from the crane machine at, at Chuck E. cheese but i didn't do it really wow. Harsh. you're a bad guy um not really because i didn't actually do it what are you in here for and what's your name hey i'm fred my reason for being in here this time is that well I stole a pacifier from Target. Seriously? Dude, you're like 40. You don't need a pacifier anymore. No, it's for this kid that was crying in the one aisle over. 
I felt sorry for it, and also it was really loud. So I went to give it a pacifier. But of course, I don't know what a pacifier. Um, Fred? Are those bunny slippers? Yeah, of course they are! I'm about to go to bed, duh! Now get out of my jail cell! Um, I would, but I can't open the door! Well, then I guess you gotta sleep on the top bunk. Okay. Hope we can be friends, Fred! Don't count on it, kid. So, uh, boss, why'd you want to see us in your jail cell? Yeah! Wow! I've got a new idea to get on out of here! Oh, boss, you're so smart. I hope this time we get out of jail for real. Yeah, so we can rob some more banks. Okay, boys. First, change my diaper. Boss, uh, I don't think so. Aren't you potty trained? Yeah, but I was just messing with ya. <laughs> uh -oh. oh, boss, you're so funny. <laughs> well, laugh. <laughs> you're our funny boss. When I say laugh, I mean laugh. When I say break me out of jail, I mean break me out of jail. I can't believe I got put in a max security prison for all boys. Oh, I miss school. I miss my friends. I miss pizza. Mm, this pizza is really good. Yeah, really good. Molly, are you okay? Uh, yeah, sure. Molly, you're eating ale. There's no pizza in your hand. Oh, yeah. I guess I wasn't very hungry. Molly, what's going on? I found out today on Snapchat that Luke has been sent to a max security all boys prison. What? Yeah, we can't even go visit him because we're girls. Oh, but gee, Molly, how long do they be there for? I don't know, Daisy. I, I think probably ten years for stealing those two toys from Chuck E. Cheese. What? No, five years for each toy, and the things were only worth about fifty cents. That seems a bit harsh. Yeah, but if you do the crime, you do the time. Except for Luke didn't do anything. I don't know how those toys disappeared. Maybe they just counted wrong. But my friend, he's not a thief. I know, Molly, I know. But there's not much we could do. I know. Oh, this is terrible. Who's going to play Roblox with me? I will, Molly. But you're my annoying sister. I want Luke. Yeah. Molly, I know you have a crush on him. What? Don't say that. He's just my friend and I miss him. I know, I miss him too. Breaking news, breaking news. Little Nikki is back in prison. Oh my gosh, that guy will never stop. Yeah, and he's not even five years old yet. Think about the criminal, Sarah, that he's gonna be when he's like 15 or 20. Yeah, he's the biggest criminal we have in this town. Whoa, little Nikki is back in prison? Wait a minute. That gives me a great idea. Molly, I don't like when you have great ideas. They end up really bad ideas. If they're going to put Luke in an all-boys prison, then they're going to have to lock me up too. Uh, Molly, you're a girl. What are you talking about? <laughs> You'll see. Molly, where are you going? Ah! Outfit change. Molly, you're going to get dressed up? But Luke's not even here to take you out on a date. <laughs> oh, very funny, Daisy. Hey, everybody, it's me, Molly. I'm doing this last Snapchat because I don't know if I'm going to return from this mission. But if I do, guys, you can guarantee that I'm going to have my friend Luke with me. And then he might ask me to dance, so I'm extra excited about that. Okay, guys, I hope I see you soon. Bye. <laughs> well, what do you think? Molly, what are you wearing? <laughs> you look like little Nikki. Yeah, I'm Little Nikki's twin. <laughs> this wig is awesome. Uh, Molly, I don't know if they're gonna believe it. And why do you want to pretend you're his twin? Because how do they know who did the crime? Little Nikki or Molly Nikki? <laughs> I guess they wouldn't know. And that means they'd have to put you in the prison. That's right. So I get to see Luke and hopefully break him out of there. Molly, when I said that your ideas were bad ones, I really meant it. You might get locked up forever. To help my friend, it'd be worth it. Molly, don't leave. Don't worry, Roblox wouldn't let me. It actually made me chill on the couch. <laughs> I hate when Roblox does that. Yeah, well, now I'm actually leaving. Bum, bum, bum.
Time to use my phone to teleport. Wouldn't it be amazing if we could actually teleport in real life? <laughs> yeah. That well, would save a lot of car accidents. <laughs> All right, guys. Here we go. I'm about to save my best friend. Actually, sorry. Uh, Brookie, are you watching this? Yes! Did you just call Luke your best friend? Ow. See, I mean, you're my best friend, Brookie, and Luke is my soon-to-be <gasps> boyfriend. Yeah. Ooh la la! <coughs> Hi there! Whoa! Little Nikki, how'd you get out? Wait a minute, you're not Little Nikki. You're way too tall to be Little Nikki. Haha, <laughs> that's because I'm Little Nikki's twin! Uh -oh. Little Vicky! Little Vicky? Yeah, as in Victor, Vicky, Victor. I didn't know he had a twin brother. Wait, how are you so much taller than he is if you're twins? I had a growth spurt, duh. All kids grow at different rates, duh. Huh. Are you supposed to be smart, bacon hair? Actually, no, I'm kind of a noob. Uh, okay. Well, do you need to lock me up? Um, why? Because how do you know which twin actually did the crime? Oh, yeah, that's true. Have you been helping your brother rob banks? Absolutely. You have the right to remain silent. You're going to jail. Perfect. Really? You're that excited about it? Wow, you're kind of messed up. Well, you know what they say. Three hots and a cot. A place to sleep and a place to eat. Sounds good to me. Hi, Bree. Now, do you serve pizza? No. Uh-oh. Only have gruel three times a day. Yeah. Ugh. Well, I guess I'll learn to love it. You'll be in cell number one. Luke! Little Nikki? Wait, did you have a growth spurt? I'm sorry. I promise I won't ever look at you the wrong way ever again. Um, yeah, um, what? I promise, don't give me any more swirlies in the toilet. Yeah. That was the worst day of my life. <laughs> oh, wow. Totally gonna have a little bit of, uh, just trauma from that one, huh? <laughs> Luke, it's not little Nikki. It's, uh, little Vicky. <laughs> Wait, there's two of you? <laughs> uh, no. Luke, it's me. I know. Oh, please. I'm, okay, I'm sleeping. Just ignore me. I'm not even here. Luke, it's me, Molly. Wait, what? What? Molly? Yeah, I'm wearing a wig and some fake muscles and this ridiculous outfit and I don't know... Why I keep just, this game is so glitchy. Ah! Don't you know I'm trying to make a role play? Uh, Molly, um, can we get back to the story? Oh, yeah. Okay, here we go. Anyway, so I'm a little Vicky, but I'm actually Molly, and I, I went undercover to get you out of here. Wait, you snuck into an all-boys prison? Are you crazy? <laughs> Only for you, Luke. Only for you. Aww. Oh, <laughs> um, that was a nice thing to say. Well, I guess we're going to get to know each other better since we're roomies now. Yeah, except for this wig is really itchy. Ugh. Okay, everybody. You have the right to remain silent. Who is this clown? He's just one of little Nikki's, well, cronies. Wait, little Nikki? I didn't know you were in here. <laughs> Sorry, boss. I'll do better next time. Uh -oh. Yeah, you better. You better get me and my friend Luke out of here tonight. Okay, well, I got a job in the tools section, so finally they trust me enough and don't know that I'm one of your cronies. Did you hear that, Luke? He works in the tools section at the gym. <coughs> he's going to get us out of here. I don't know. That guy's kind of, well, ignoramus. Well, it doesn't matter if he's dumb or not. He's getting us out of here. They locked the doors after 8 p.m. There's no leaving or going from the jail cells. Don't worry. I have a feeling that my crony will figure this out. Wow, you're actually kind of like little Nikki, only cuter. Oh, even in this ugly wig. Absolutely, Molly. <laughs> that was a nice thing to say. Hey, if we get out of here, do you want to go to the dance with me? What? Um, uh... I mean, you don't have to. Yes, I'll go to the dance with you, sure! Okay, I didn't think you were going to be that excited about it. Well, I will be excited about anything if I can get out of here. Um, it's kind of bad, but I have to go to the bathroom. What? No, you're going to have to hold it. But I had a taco for lunch. Molly. Whoopsie. <laughs> uh, well, I guess we're stuck in the same room, so, um, didn't mean to gas you out. Psst. Guys, come on. I broke the lock. 
Perfect, crony. Let's get out of here. You do have a way out, right? Sure do. Watch this. What? Freedom! Come on, Luke. We're out of here. Are you sure this is a good idea, Molly? Yeah. Now we have to figure out how to prove your innocence. Should we steal that police car? No, then we go back to jail for that. We just need to go to Chuck E. Cheese and try to figure out how to get you out of this. And uh, I probably should change out of this outfit. And you should change out of that one. We look pretty obvious. Uh, Luke, are you going undercover like that? Mamma mia! Boy, are you going undercover like that? Your dress is a giant burrito! I know, I was so hungry that this is what I picked because I'm, like, really hungry. The jail doesn't even feed you. Molly, you were there for, like, two hours. Yeah, I know, but I was expecting to give me pizza for dinner. It's jail! Exactly, it's jail! You don't get fed there! They just feed you gruel, and and if you can catch a mouse, you could probably eat that. Ew, Ew gross! Now, come on, Luke. Let's go to Chuck E. Cheese and get to the bottom of this. Yeah, Molly. Hopefully we can prove my innocence. Yeah, and then we can go get bean burritos. I'm starving. Oh, Molly. You're always thinking of your stomach. Very true. Very true. <laughs> Right, Daisy? Yeah, that's right, guys. Today we're gonna show you differences between Roblox Pokemon and a special Pokemon built inside Minecraft. Daisy, can you have to sing that part? Yeah, I'm so excited. We're gonna play Minecraft. All right, guys. So let's take a quick look around Brookhaven so you can remember exactly what we're talking about. You guys all know this spot by the waterfall. The water fountain, actually, not a waterfall. Duh. <laughs> You already making mistakes. I'm only one second into the video. You really should do your homework. Uh -oh. What does my homework have to do with playing Roblox? Anyway, guys, we are next to the water fountain. So hopefully when we um, are in Minecraft, we see that. And here's the town, guys. There's a grocery store, Brookhaven Apartments, the salon, ice cream, arcade, the police. Very important in case there's any angry mobs in Minecraft. Ah! Um, guys, there's also an airport. The, you know, the mall with the TV station. And very important, Starbrooks, because I'm about to go get a snack from there. Molly, could you could you stick with the program here? We have to we have to show them what it looks like to go to Bookie in Minecraft. Well, if Minecraft doesn't have treats, then um no Minecraft for me. Molly, I don't know if they have what you're looking for. Oh my god. Look at this cookie! Oh, that's delicious. And the guy also want the donut. Molly is the biggest pig in all of Roblox. <laughs> yeah, and um, I plan on being the biggest pig in all of Minecraft, too. <laughs> so, guys, um, I'm going to show you the house we spawned. I'm really hoping that the one in Minecraft is, like, almost identical, but we're about to find out. So, let's go look at the house that we spawned in Brookhaven so you can see if it's in Minecraft, too. Molly, I can hear you crunching on that... Donut and cookie. Are you still eating that? What a silly question. <laughs> Are you an ignoramus? Of course I'm still eating it. It's delicious. Anyway, guys, here is the house. And um, I hope we have one just like this in Minecraft. Yeah, this is a pretty sweet house. Let's go inside. Hey, you got any snacks in here? Buddy, quit eating all the snacks. All right, guys. So there's bunk beds in here. There's a kitchen. And also, you can go up here to the upstairs. And there is more bedrooms. And does this one have a balcony? Ooh, that bathroom's pretty awesome. I don't... Oh, there's a secret sink. Okay, um... This one does not have a balcony. Noted. Well, I don't know if Minecraft's gonna have a balcony. Maybe it's over here, Molly. No, this one doesn't have one either. Does this one... Nope, this house has zero balconies. Oh, whoa, so if Minecraft has a balcony in their house, that means Minecraft is better. Just saying. Molly, should we head over to Minecraft now? Yeah, let's do this. Look at us, Molly, we're adorable. Oh my god, we are so cute in Minecraft. Holy guacamole. Guys, does this look familiar? I mean, besides Wow. This. Look at this. Here it is. Brookhaven in Minecraft. Mm. Why do we think so anyway, Molly? 
Yeah, we think so. All right, the first thing I'm gonna show you guys is the square where you spawn. Because there it is. There is the water fountain. Water is actually running in everything. And here's all the plants and stuff that's there. Look, guys, you know you can see down through like the glass floor in Brookhaven? It's exactly the same in this Minecraft map. So amazing. Um, what? Can you even put the diving board in here? Are you serious? All right, I have to jump off that. Oh, 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 here we go. What? <laughs> That's so awesome. All right, guys, you know in Brookhaven, though, there's like a secret door down here. <gasps> there is not one in Minecraft, I don't think. Wait, what's that? Would that be a secret door? If that's a secret door, oh my god, I'm not even gonna know what to do right now. Well, I don't, the secret door was like there, but look at that. That is actually a different color, so that could be a secret door. Well, don't go punching through it, Molly. Don't ruin this map already, jeepers. Okay, the first thing I noticed is they added the stores. Like, this looks like the bank, but it's pretty empty. Like, there's, there's no ATM here. Um, but they did get the building look right. Yeah, um, we probably have to build the money. Which you won't be able to do, Molly, because you don't ever get to get a job because you never do your homework. What? Rude! Um, oh, look, this is like the little cafe. I think this is supposed to be Starbucks. Yep, it totally is. What? Wait a minute! This is Starbucks? But, but, there's no snacks! OMG. Okay, let's see what's in our inventory. Wait a minute. What's that? <gasps> Guys, is that what I think it is? I think it's a cookie. Wait a minute, where's that cookie I just threw out? I'm about to eat it, wait a minute. I, I, oh yeah, I'm eating it, it's good. At first I thought maybe it was a fake cookie. If it was a fake cookie, I'd be like, nope. Minecraft, two thumbs down. <laughs> I have to have my cookies. Doesn't matter what game I'm in. Um, can you stop eating them all? Sure, Molly. Mmm, oh this cookie looks so delicious. Oh, I can't wait to eat it. Yum, yum, yum. Delicious chocolate chip cookie. Making my world so sweet and delicious. Ay, 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 Molly. You and your cookie obsession. Hey, what other kind of sweet treats do they have in here? Well, let's take a look. What? A giant cake? Oh, right, yeah, I'm throwing that out. Daisy, don't touch it. What? I can have some cake too, Molly. You're being so greedy. Oh, well, where am I going? <laughs> Obviously, I'm still learning. To play Minecraft. Oh my god, I was like walking the wrong way. Oh, wow. Wow. Buddy, you just blew it up. What are you doing? You blew up the key. As I said, I might be a little bit of a noob in Minecraft. Molly, <laughs> cake right now. Okay, bossy jeepers. Um, all right, let me throw out another cake here. I'm gonna try to throw it right on the counter <laughs> instead of on the floor. I don't want to eat a uh, floor cake. No, thank you. Um, this time, guys, I'm gonna try not to beat up the cake. I'm just gonna eat it. Whoa, that is a delicious cake for you guys. There's so much chocolate on the inside. Mmm, that was good. Okay, Molly, let's go check out some more cool things in this game. All right, yeah, guys, let's check out the rest of Brookhaven in Minecraft. That was pretty cool that we could eat cakes and cookies, but it's time to do some exploring. Guys, over there you can see um, that is supposed to be the diner. And wow, I'm like super impressed by this. Holy guacamole. It doesn't look like they put much inside though. I think they want you to build your own world, Miley. Oh, really? That's super cool and also a lot of work. Wait, what's that? Is that the house? Guys, that's the house we saw in, um, in Brookhaven. So, here is the house in Minecraft, and here is the original house in Brookhaven. Guys, comment down below if you think the house in Minecraft looks like this one. So, guys, let's go inside. Obviously, um, Brookhaven is pretty sweet. Like, look at this. Look at that comfy couch. And the kitchen is amazing. But this one is nothing like the inside of the Brookhaven house at all. Yeah, guys, this one is so different on the inside in Minecraft. You guys can see the difference between the two. It is nothing like it at all. Well, it's still cool though. I mean, it's still like a Brookhaven house. Wow, fancy tub. The um, bathroom in Brookhaven, well, it's pretty nice, but I mean, they're a little bit similar because they have 
both have tubs and you know i would live in either one really i mean they have cookies and cake <laughs> and that's all i really need yeah miley who needs to take a bath yeah. wait a minute does this one actually have a potty what happens when i eat bean burritos wait let's 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 look Molly, the bathroom is right here. The toilet, I mean. Okay, get, get out of there, Daisy. What? You have to use it or something? No, I just don't want you to break it apart. <laughs> you did eat a lot of cake. Molly, I'm not going to make the toilet explode. That's your job. <laughs> All right, guys. Let's go explore the upstairs. What's leaking? Um, that's not a good sign. Something is leaking in the Minecraft house. And, guys, the kitchen is, like, up on the second floor, which is kind of cool. So do you think that this kitchen in Brookhaven looks like the kitchen in the Minecraft version of Brookhaven? Guys, if you do, slam that like button. I mean, I think it looks kind of close. It looks pretty close. Molly, maybe we should go up to the third floor and see what that is that's leaking down to the ceiling. Uh, my sister has a good point. This house might actually be um, condemned if there's a leak in the roof. So let's go see. And here's one of the bedrooms, guys. Wait a minute. What is that? Does it have a balcony, guys? We talked about this at the beginning of the video. I said, Minecraft's gonna win if it has a balcony. Yeah, it has a hot tub too, Molly. Whoa, do you think that's what's leaking? Um, maybe. Who cares? Look at this view of Minecraft Brookhaven. This is amazing. Look, they even have the arch, guys. That is so cool. Would you guys live in this house in Minecraft? Yes or no? Um, let us know in the comment section below. I would live in it because, I mean, a hot tub, um, cookies and cake sounds like my kind of place. It is pretty nice, Molly. I mean, we'd have to build some more furniture and stuff. Yeah, when it gets dark, we don't want to run into any mobs. Molly, look! It's our school! I'm so excited! I could never be in Minecraft if it didn't have the school. Um, I could live without school. <laughs> Why do they have another school? Oh, oopsie, I sort of fell off that giant brick wall. Whoopsie! <laughs> uh, Molly? It looks like the school is boarded up. What? Um, that doesn't look good. But also very good, because if the school is boarded up, it means it's closed. And if it's closed, no more homework, no more rules, no more the teachers, that's true. Really, Molly? Dizzy, are you breaking and entering into the school? Pretty sure that's kind of illegal. I made a way for us to get in. Now I can go to science class. Wait a minute. It's super dark in here. This is obviously where the zombie apocalypse starts. Um, Molly, throw out some torches already. Okay, my sister's being super bossy. Just like she is in Brookhaven. Go figure. Um, all right, guys. Let me throw out some torches so we can see where we're going. All right, I'm throwing out some torches. I'm working on it cheapers. Ah, that's better. Wait a minute. <laughs> the entire school has been taken over by wildlife. Look at it. It's like just grass in here, guys. Let's explore this haunted Minecraft Brookhaven school. Creepy. Ooh. I missed the science lab. Um, okay. There's like a random hole in here. It might be a grave. No, Maddie, it's not a grave. My sister likes to make everything creepy. Pretty much. Um, guys, this is exactly how I pictured the school to be. Empty! Closed down! No homework! Yay! Alright, since we're talking about creepy stuff, I think we should definitely go and see if the um, graveyard from Brookhaven is in this Minecraft Brookhaven. Let's go. Guys, look, here is Minecraft Hospital. Guys, you can see this is the hospital in Brookhaven as compared to the hospital in Minecraft. They look pretty similar, guys. Except for it's raining really hard here. Molly, help! Daisy, where are you? Are you inside the hospital? Do you need a doctor? No, Molly, I'm in the graveyard. You're in the graveyard without me? Why'd you do that? There could have been a zombie or an angry mom. Molly, I'm stuck down in this grave and I can't get out. <laughs> Wait a minute. I have to go back into Roblox so I can do the laugh emoji. <laughs> Molly, would you stop laughing at me? I need your help down here. Okay, guys.
guys. My sister needs my help to try to get out of this grave. Um, but I'm a noob, so I'm not really sure I can help you. What do you want me to do? Stop hitting me, Molly! Oh, sorry. Um, let me see if I have, like, a step ladder in here. Molly, you don't have a step ladder. Um, yes, I do, Daisy. Yes, I do. You do, Molly? Molly, you're my hero! <laughs> do, 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 do. Thanks, Molly! Ha! And you thought I was a total Minecraft noob. Try not to fall down into that grave again, okay? Uh, noted, Molly. Definitely. I'm gonna fill it in with dirt. And that way, no one ever falls in there again. Um, alright guys. While my sister's filling in that, I want to go see if there's anything else cool to see inside this amazing Minecraft Brookhaven. Let's go into the hospital. Whoa, this looks much different than Roblox Brookhaven. I mean, it, it looks the same, but there's like no beds or anything. I really like Brookhaven in Minecraft, and I really like Brookhaven in um, Roblox too. I think they'd both be fun to play. What's that sound? Ah, it's a bat! There's, there's so many bats in this Minecraft hospital! This is totally different than Roblox Brookhaven. There's never any bats in there. Somebody locked the door with these with these bats everywhere. Ah! Okay, um, all right, uh, let's get out of here. <laughs> Molly, there's probably more bats outside. <laughs> no, I don't see any bats. Molly, back up before they get you. Oh, they're following me. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. All right, let's run back to our house. And um, hopefully we can survive this bat invasion. Molly, we have a little bit more to talk in here. There's a lot of cave spiders in this book even in my crib. Yep, that's it. Chase Daisy. Go ahead, chase her. Chase her. Oh, very funny, Molly. <laughs> I think it's hilarious. Oh, man. Daisy, they're after you. The bats, too. <laughs> None of the mobs in this Brookhaven in Minecraft likes Daisy. Oh, God! Take me back to Brookhaven in Roblox! Ah! <laughs> that was so much fun. Oh, yeah. So much. I got chased by cave spiders and bats and... Ay, ay, ay. Yeah, but you have to admit, that Brookhaven in Minecraft was pretty cool. Yeah, it was pretty cool. Except for the part where I get chased by all those mobs. <laughs> hey guys, thanks so much for watching. If you would like to see Daisy and I play more Minecraft, please slam that like button. And let us know in the comments section below. Guys, we read all of your comments and we can't wait to see what you have to say to us about our Minecraft adventure today. All right, guys, we'll see you next time. Hopefully without a bunch of spiders chasing me. Bye, guys. <laughs>
was so insane. <laughs> At least we're talking. That's a good sign, right? Totally. Anyway? So, yeah. He's not that great at typing. Who cares? I'm so in love. Aww. My partner is ready. See you in class later. I think by this text, it means he's totally going to ask me to the dance. When am I ever going to sleep tonight? Tomorrow's going to be such a big day. I can just dream about it now. Morning already? <sighs> well, today is gonna be the one of the best days of my life because Dan's gonna ask me to the school dance. I can't wait! I can't wait! It's gonna be an amazing day. I'm gonna like look so beautiful. I I just have to like look so great because I'm gonna. <gasps> ah! What's going on with my face? There, there, there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Pimples? Ah, it looks terrible. Oh my God, what are we gonna do? Well, maybe nobody will notice. I mean, I'm a teenager. We get pimples, right? Oh my God, who am I kidding? Everybody's gonna notice. Oh, well, I guess there's no choice but to go to school. And I'll just try to put some makeup on. Yeah, that should cover these pimples. <laughs> I have some really great makeup from Sephora and I just, I just, I, I just gotta use it on these pimples and Everything will be okay. Just put a little here, put a little here, put a little here. Later at school. Why can I not get a signal in this school? It's so annoying. Don't they know I need to put up a snap right now? Come on. <laughs> that TikTok is hilarious. <laughs> oh, hey Dan. Do you have a signal right now? Yeah, I've been watching TikTok videos. These ones are hilarious. Want to see? No, not really, but, um, hey, going to the dance this Friday? Um, yeah, I think so. I was thinking about this one girl I was gonna ask. Well, um, if you're gonna ask, you better hurry up. She probably will have five other guys asking her in the next ten minutes. Whoa, you think so? Yeah, she's really popular. Oh, I didn't think she was that popular. What? Yes, she's that popular. Who are we even talking about right now? Oh, uh, sorry, Bunny, but I gotta get going. <laughs> it's time for class. Yeah, okay. See you later, Dan. Bye. Hey, Bunny. I brought you your favorite from Starbucks like I always do. Ah, oh, you forgot to put the extra shot of hazelnut in it, Tiffany. God, can you do anything right? What? Bunny, I even paid for this myself. Do you think it's so rude? Oh, I should totally... Totally post about this online. What? You better not. Or, or I'm going to tell everybody your secret about how you farted at the sleepover. <laughs> what? You wouldn't dare. I would. Okay, Laura, don't panic. It's just a couple little pimples. No one's going to even notice. <laughs> no one. O-M-G. Look who it is. It's Laura and... Oh, what happened to your face? It looks like someone cooked a pizza on it. Um, uh, it's just a couple of pimples. I don't know why it happened. I woke up like this. <laughs> um, can you say loser? <laughs> Ugh, those are gross. Tiffany, what are you doing? Oh, nothing, Laura. Nothing at all. <laughs> well, we better get to class, Bunny. <laughs> we don't want to have to miss our cheerleading competition. And the teacher said if we missed another day, uh, we couldn't go. Well, see you later, pizza face. Uh, yeah, bye. Oh, no. Hopefully Dan just doesn't notice. I mean, there's not that many pimples, right? Oh, look. I got a new snap. What? What is this? Ugly? Ugh, I can't believe I have to be at school today. This is like the worst day to be here. Why couldn't this happen on a Saturday? Oh, my phone's buzzing. What? Gross? How, how could you put this for everyone to see? Oh my god! I can't show my face in this school ever again! <laughs> Seriously, Tiffany? 
That was so rude. <laughs> Whatever, Dan. I was just stating the truth. Yeah, Dan, she is a pizza face. Gross. You guys are the meanest ever. What? What did you say to me? I thought you were going to ask me to the dance. Not a chance, Bunny. You're ugly on the inside. And that's a lot worse than having a couple of pimples. I can't believe you said that to me. Oh, you are so rude. <laughs> you wouldn't know the first thing about being nice or rude. Both of you are totally rude. Anyway, I gotta go find Laura. You guys are bullies. Where's Laura? I've looked everywhere for her. <laughs> well, I hear her crying. Well, unless that's the school ghost. That person's creepy. I think that Laura's voice is coming from the janitor's room. I saw once, I think on like TikTok, that you could put just like a tiny bit of bleach on your pimple and then it would burn your face horribly. What am I thinking? Laura, are you in there? Oh, don't look at me. I'm so gross. I have a pizza face. Laura, I don't think you're gross at all. Really? But, but, but. Don't listen to those girls. They're just mean and rude and evil. And I think they're jealous of you because you're so cool. Really? <gasps> you think that they're just mean and jealous? Yeah. I think you're super cool, and I'm sorry you cried. That made me feel really sad. Aww. Aww. Thanks, Dan. So I was wondering, do you want to go to the school dance with me? Wait, what? Are you serious? Yeah, I mean, it's not very romantic to ask you to go in the janitor's room, but, you know, smells a little bit like, well, an old moldy mop in here, but, you know, <laughs> this is where you were, so... It's okay. I don't mind that you asked me in the janitor's office. I mean, is this an office? Uh, no, I don't think that the title's that official, that he gets his own office or anything. Yeah, true. So, um... So I'll pick you up about 8 o'clock? Sounds great. This is a see you then. Bye, Laura. Bye. Whoa. Amazing. Well, well, well. Look who we have here. Little Miss Pizza Face. You can't keep me down, Bunny. I'm going to the school dance with Dan. And he didn't mind if I had a couple of pimples. He thought I was amazing anyway. <laughs> no, he doesn't. He told me that he just feels sorry for you. No one else would ever ask you to the dance. <gasps> hey, what? Yeah, it's true. He's just feeling like you're a total charity case. So, he invited you to the dance. Oh, I can't believe it. The worst day turned into the best day turned into an even worse day. Well, sorry I had to be the bearer of bad news, Laura, but I am a truth teller, so, you know, have fun with your pizza face. Oh, uh, wait a minute. I know what I could do. If I don't have pizza face and I show up at the school dance, then he'll have to think that I'm the most beautiful girl in the world. Yeah, watch me transform to uh, from ugly to model. Hopefully this salon can help me look like a model. That way Dan will think that I'm the prettiest girl and the most amazing girl at the dance. They got really good reviews, so here goes nothing. Oh, hi. How can I help you today? Isn't it obvious? Look at my face. What? What's wrong with your face, honey? It's ugly. What? Your face isn't ugly? Who told you that? Please tell me that you're not saying that to yourself. That's not very nice self-talk. Well, it's true. These mean girls at school told me that I was ugly. Pizza face, even. Pfft. Well, obviously, they don't know what they're talking about. <laughs> the only person I see in front of me is someone that is totally beautiful, gorgeous, model-like, all on her own. What? Are you crazy? Do you need glasses? <laughs> I have pimples all over. So? Pimples don't make you pretty or ugly. You seem like a pretty nice person to me, too. I'd be happy to do your makeup for the dance, but I'm not going to make you into a supermodel. Girl, you already are. But can you cover up these pimples? Sure I can. Those are so easy to cover. They taught us all about it at beauty school. Come on, come sit in my chair. Okay. Oops, I'm not supposed to be sitting down. For some reason, I thought it was break time. <laughs> Just kidding. All right, let's see what we can do about those, well, little beauty spots. They're not beauty spots, they're pimples! Yeah, but everybody gets them when they're a teenager. It's totally fine. Now, let's just put a little makeup here. 
A little makeup here, a little makeup here. Voila, Cinderella, you're ready for the ball. <gasps> you covered them up perfectly. Thank you, Megan. Yes, you're welcome. But remember, you're beautiful no matter what, supermodel. Don't listen to those mean girls. They don't deserve your attention. Don't let them get in your head, okay? Thank you so much. You're the best salon in the whole world. Well, maybe not in the whole world, but at least in Roblox. Oh my gosh, I feel so cute right now. <laughs> this is so adorable. I'm gonna give myself like a little dog face. <laughs> I'm gonna have the best night in my life. Hey, Laura, what you doing? Oh, hey, Dan. I thought I was gonna pick you up from your house. Oh, um, yeah, I just got done at the salon and stuff, so I guess we could just walk to the dance together. Wow, you look amazing. Oh, thank you. You look really handsome. Thanks. I hope we have fun at the dance together. I'm sure that we will. I'm sorry those girls were so mean to you earlier. I, I... I hope that you didn't just ask me to this dance because, well, you didn't want me to go alone and you felt sorry for me. Wait, what? Who told you that? I've liked you for like two months now. Really? Yeah. I didn't know if you liked me back, so I didn't say anything. But then when you sent me that text, like, out of nowhere, I was like, wait, I think she might actually like me. <laughs> You're right. I do like you. I first noticed you in math class. You were really funny. Aw, thanks. Come on, let's go to the dance. Sounds good. Well, I see that Bunny brought her daddy's Bentley to the to the party. Yeah, of course she did. She's spoiled rotten. She totally is. Wow, this dance is going to be so amazing. Well, look who it is. It's Pizza Face. Except for my face isn't pizza. It's perfect. Well, not perfect, but pretty close to it. I look amazing. And nothing you say to me is going to make me feel bad about myself ever again, Bunny and Tiffany. You guys are just rude bullies. And besides, I have the cutest boy here ever as my date. So, who are the losers now? Well, he was going to ask me, but he felt sorry for you. <gasps> Whatever. I'm not even going to talk to them. Come on, Dan. Let's dance. Oh, I love this song. Whoa, what is he doing? Well, are you gonna dance or not? I mean, I know my dancing's a little weird, but I think you should dance with me. <laughs> are you laughing at my dancing? No, I'm laughing at the fact that you think that you're a better dancer than me. Obviously not. Look at me, I'm the world's best dancer. I'm having the time of my life, Dan. I am too. Hey, do you want to be my girlfriend? Wait, what? Seriously? Yeah. Sure I do. Hey, Bunny. Hey, Tiffany. You want to put out a Snapchat of Dan asking me to be his girlfriend while I do this crazy <gasps> awesome dance? Oh, get away from us. No problem. <laughs> Daisy, move over! Marty, quit stepping on me! Ah, oh, my sister is so annoying. What? I was just trying to get in the car! Kids, stop it! Whoa! Mom! You were distracted by us arguing when you ran into the wall! Well, then I guess you shouldn't be arguing so much, should you? Uh-oh! Anyway, is everyone okay? I know, Mommy isn't the best driver. Uh, yeah, you think? Now that we're here, go ahead and start picking up some groceries for me. Will I go speak to the manager of, about the damages? Uh-oh! Mom, it, it wouldn't surprise me if you would blame them for you running into their building. Yeah, Mom, you are sort of a Karen. What? Well, my name is Karen, but I don't act like a Karen. Uh, yeah, Mom, you totally do. Um, guys, I'm getting all the necessities. I'm getting some... Um, cola. I got some, uh, <laughs> some ramens. And now I'm getting some beans. Because, you know, very important. Yeah. Ew, Molly. Go 
goodness. I'm grabbing all of the beans. I love the beans. They're so delicious. <laughs> and some bananas, some cabbage. Oh, great. Marty's buying everything that can make him a farting machine. Broccoli. <laughs> Marty, I don't want to have you farting all night. Sorry, but it's what they had at the grocery store. Why is mom taking so long? I don't know, Molly. I, I guess something's probably wrong. Yeah, she's probably telling them it's their fault she ran into the building. Like, why'd you put your building so close to my car? <laughs> yeah, you probably right. It's 12 a.m. Oh, there's a worker. Hey, have you seen my mom? She's the one that complains about everything. Uh, nobody's talking to us. Surprised worker. Okay, yeah, that is pretty surprising. Look at my mom's car. She totally crashed it. It's wrecked. It's done. Maybe she'll get a Lamborghini then. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> mom's not that rich. I literally do not see our mom anywhere. Let's check the bathroom. <laughs> what? You're telling me you want me to pay... $10,000 in damages? <gasps> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> what was that noise? Oh, it's kind of creepy in here. Uh, guys, I keep hearing all these weird sounds. I don't know what it is. Ah! Ah! Good job, scare! Karen is falling asleep when awake. She will search the store and kill everyone she finds. We must revive until 6 a.m. Um, okay, I need to revive. Because I definitely died. Ooh. Your toxicity will slowly rise. Clean the air. Oh, uh, my God. How do I clean the air? Scared worker. Oh, man, you do seem scared. Hunger will slowly drop. Eat to fill your hunger. Well, okay, I'll eat this broccoli. Yeah. But then, Karen, Mom, I'm gonna fart a lot. What I need to do is hide. When she's coming, where do I hide? Save workers around the store. Okay, I'm gonna lead you to safety. And you. Come on. Oh, I can hide in this box. <laughs> oh, that's that scared worker is, like, so scared. All right, I can hide in this box. I'm telling him to get in the box, too. Everybody get in the box. He can't fit. <laughs> sorry about that. I'm sorry you can't fit, you know. Money, you have to get out of the box. No, you have to run, Daisy. Mom is looking at all of us. Oh, God. Is she getting me? No. I was inside the box. She didn't get in there, Money. She be... Oh, my God. She knows to look in the box. Guys, I'm watching my Robux go down as we speak. <laughs> I just spent so many Robux. I cannot make it past 12 a.m. Holy macaroni and cheese. What's that? I don't know what that is. Oh, I just got 12 points, though. Sh ah! No, it's just about to hide! <laughs> ah! <laughs> Alright, it's okay. It's okay. I love you guys so much. I'm gonna show you that I can survive this game. Never give up and never surrender. You can beat evil Karen. If you put your mind to it, whoa, 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 you can do it. Um, uh, what is that? It's a refrigerator. Oh, that's the safe. Duh. Well, do I still have the lockpick? No, I lost it when I died, I guess. Oh, God, here comes Karen, here comes Karen. Ah! Get in the box! Ah! Oh. <sighs> this is the hardest game ever! It steals all your robots! Ooh. God, you're being so dramatic. I know, because... Uh, I'm so sad. What about that never give up, never surrender thing? Are you hiding, or am I supposed to revive you, or what are you doing? I just ate so many cabbages, guys. Da, 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 I need that lockpick again, and it like disappeared. Stinky lockpick. I feel like she's gonna be coming soon. I'm gonna get in this box. I'm just hiding because I don't know where she is, but I am not spending more of my Robux. Ow! 
Oh yeah, she's she's coming, guys. She's coming. All right now, I can unhide. Um, Daisy, are you making the air toxicity better? Yes, Mandy, I am. Ah! Oh, jump scare! Holy guacamole! <laughs> guys, the only way I'm winning this game is just by spending Robux. Yep, I'm to like 5 a.m. now. I only have to survive till six. And the only reason I'm surviving is because A, my sister's helping me, and B, um, I just keep spending Robux. Ha ha, Karen! She's checking the box. Well, okay, but I'm in it. Wait, what? I thought we could hide in the box. She saw you go in the box, Molly. She knew you were hiding in there. If she sees you, she gets you. What? She didn't see me. That's ridiculous. She had to see me go right now. Make an epic fart in this bathroom. <laughs> Molly, really? Well, I ate so many cabbages in this game. This is my health is terrible. No kidding, I have this evil psycho chasing me. What in the air purity in here is terrible. We're gonna die. What? But Daisy, I thought you were handling that. Well, I can't handle it all, Molly. Oh my God, but we only had one more hour to survive and I'm out of Robux. This game. Oh, it's so hard. Why do they have to make this game so hard? Wait, I think you fixed it, Daisy. I did, Molly. You're so lucky that I did that. Yeah, you're right. You're the best sister in the world. Thank you for not letting me die. Oh, God, I think Karen's coming. What? She did not see me go in that box. Daisy, I don't think you know how to play this game. 5 a.m., guys. Will my Robux last longer than this game? That is the question everybody wants to know. I just want to get into the safe, and, and the lockpick isn't anywhere, and I have epically failed at this game. Ooh. I just have to tell you guys I'm so sorry, but I have epically failed at it. Oh my god, that time I actually don't think she saw me. Oh god, maybe I can run. Run! <laughs> Get away from me, you evil monster! She fell over. Guys, I actually escaped her that time. <laughs> Man, that'll teach you, evil Karen. She hid in the box, and when she did, I jumped out of it and ran. Keep that in your mind, Daisy, because that's what you need to do. Really, Molly? That's how you survive? <laughs> fill you up and then they'll really make you fart yeah. Yeah, yeah yeah this is my sister I survived oh my god I got 252 dollars and I survived I don't you know how I survived guys Robux lots and lots of Robux you guys are gonna play this you better be amazing or you better have the best um Robux bank account ever game modes coming soon dizzy if we get two wins we can play nightmare let's go back in but like let's try not to use any of our robux okay uh -oh. actually let's go in with other players because it might not be so hard then okay let's go into this one are you coming dizzy i was trying to molly i'm just waiting for everybody else to come in too all right, guys, we have extra people now for backup. Let's see how we can do on this one. Oh! Crazy Karen. She's just in the grocery store. So, guys, I figured a couple of things out. If I hit shift, I can actually go, like, mega fast. I don't know if I can outrun evil Karen. But, oh, God, she's slowing me down. Oh, God. I hid in that box, though, guys. I hid in the box. Okay. Karen has fallen asleep. Let's go. I see the key. Wait, is it on this wall? No, I think it's on the other side. Get it! Did I get it? Yes. Great, guys. Oh, my God. Now I just have to go into the safe, which I can't really remember where it is. But, oh, wait, there's a safe. What's inside? Really? Okay. That was completely useless. Thanks for that. Maybe the other safe has something else. Because I just got another one. Um, there's another safe back here, guys. Let's go see what's in here. More money! Yay! I don't need money! I need to figure out how to survive this evil monster woman. So far, guys, it's 12 a.m. And I haven't actually, um, 
died yet, which is better than the first time I played. I feel like you get better at this game as you realize what's actually happening in it. Oh, while I'm in the box, I can eat a drop of stick. <laughs> Love it. Um, whoa. Whoa, whoa, I got all turned around. Ah, no, there's Karen! Oh, God. Ah! <laughs> oh, okay, guys, I am going to revive. Oh, come, on. come on. Why not? No. Ah! Okay, that's it. That's all the robot That's all you get. <laughs> Molly, this game is so crazy. Guys, the point of this game is do not ever go grocery shopping with evil string Karen. Ooh. She will kill you repeatedly. And you'll get a lot of gas because all there is to eat is cabbage. <laughs>
Land on the pad to win. Dog Pounder! <laughs> These games look so fun. I don't know if I can actually play this one. I, I don't, Some of them you can play, some not. But pull the handle. Yeah, okay, I'll pull the handle. Come on, big winner! Attention, Chuck E. Cheese fans. We have a birthday girl in house. And our pizza's ready. Meet us in the showroom, Brookie. And you can have an amazing party. I won 50 tickets. And also, Brookie, Daisy, it's time for us to eat our pizza and watch the show. I hope they heard the announcement. I'm sure they did. Oh, my gosh. Look at this. Holy moly. This is awesome. <gasps> There's even a birthday cake for Brookie. That is so cool. <laughs> Here you go. Here's your birthday cake. Oh, no, it's not my birthday. It's my best friend's. It's your birthday. Don't lie. It's not my birthday. It's her birthday, Brookie. Oh, <laughs> you're just being silly. Don't you want birthday cake? I want you to go away because you're super annoying. Molly, don't be rude to the dog. Can't remember what character he is. All right, guys, let's eat some pizza. Mmm. Are you gonna sit here the whole time? Ho 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 ho! Probably! I love the customers! Um, okay. Well guys, the show's about to start. Hey Molly! What are you doing here? Oh, hey Unicorn Princess! Nice to see you. Haven't seen you since math class. Oh, well, why are you guys at Chuck E. Cheese celebrating something special? Ho 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 ho! Of course they are! They're celebrating Molly's birthday! What? No, no we're not! We're celebrating Brookie's birthday! Oh, this Chuck E. Cheese has gone right downhill. Oh, well, happy birthday, Brookie. Um, I'm so glad that you're able to come to Chuck E. Cheese. Can I hang out with you guys? And my friend, too? Uh, yeah, you guys can both hang out with us. I think all the pizza's gone, though. But you can have some delicious cake from this dog. Okay, everybody, attention. The show's about to start. Hey, does anybody remember that cheeseburger being a part of the animatronic show oh yeah isn't that um oh no i i don't know if i remember oh wait yeah cheesy mccheeseburger or something cheesy mccheeseburger is not one of the characters like you got chucky you got the bird thing you got the weird the purple monster guy that looks out the corner of his eye at you and you wonder what is he thinking there's the dog that plays the guitar and the chef that plays the drums the Cheesy McCheeseburger is not an original character. It's just weird. Well, the show's about to start. Let's just see what happens. Hi there, I'm Chuck E. Cheese. Did you like your pizza? <laughs> it's the best on the planet. Oh, Chucky, you're the best on the planet. Give me a big smooch. <laughs> I don't think so. You have pepperoni breath! <laughs> well, oh, okay. All right, kiddos, let's get poppin'! I'm Chuck E. Cheese and I'm here to say I'm the coolest mouse anyway. He's Chuck E. Cheese and I really love him. Oh my gosh, isn't he so cool? Molly, look at Chucky. Um, cheese. He keeps looking over at that cheeseburger. He doesn't trust him. Yeah, the bird girl keeps looking over there too. Something very strange is going on here. Uh, Molly, don't look now, but that creepy cheeseburger is standing right behind you. What? I, I don't see a creepy cheeseburger. I just see a person dressed as Chuck E. Cheese. Oh, Molly, she's not lying. It's right behind you. Bah! I thought you were animatronic! Are you going to say anything? Molly, I don't think it talks. Okay, well, I'm just going to go over here and sit over here. Molly, it's following you. I think it wants you to die. What? No, this is Chuck E. Cheese. What are you doing here, you imposter? This place is an amazing place for kids. Ah! Oh, my gosh. Yep, it's definitely following me. Um, guys, do you want to get the check and get out of here? Uh, not really. It's Bookie's birthday. Besides, it's only chasing you. Oh, my gosh. Or maybe if I stand on the table, it'll just go away. Ah! Molly, is that a knife that the, the cheeseburger has? I don't know. Okay, I have an idea. I have a plan. You guys distract the hamburger. I'll be right back. For some reason, it must know that that I'm a Roblox star. And, 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 and... 
it's after me because it wants my Roblox star. That That's all I can think of. How do I get out of here? I, I knew I came in here, but... All right, there we go. I'm gonna go dress up like, well, Chucky. That ought to help me. Wait a minute, I can't get over there. But here we go. Buy access, 440 Robux? Holy guacamole! Okay, maybe if I just put on this like costume over here or something. Ooh, I'll pretend I work here. How do I put this on? Oh my gosh, that thing's gonna come and kill me! Perfect! That creepy, creepy, creepy cheeseburger won't even know who I am now. I'll just go over here and take people's orders. <laughs> Perfect. Hi, welcome to Chuck E. Cheese. I'm Molly. What can I get for you? See, my disguise is working perfectly. Oh no, here comes the creepy cheeseburger. They don't even recognize me. <laughs> but it looks like they're looking for me. Why are they after me? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. And the dog's after me too. Abandoned ship. Guys, our Chuck E. Cheese time is over. Guys? Guys? Oh my God. My friends, they're missing. Um, guys, Brookie, are you okay? Molly, that evil, that evil cheeseburger trapped me in this ticket blaster. I can't get out. Brookie, don't worry. I'll try to rescue you. Great idea bringing me here for my birthday, Molly. Um, okay, well, I didn't know about the evil cheeseburger, so that's not really fair. Where's, oh God, there they are. No, no. Molly, I thought you were gonna get us out of here. All you did was get stuck in here yourself. Well, let's look at it this way. We could collect some of these tickets while we're in here and play lots of free games. Yeah, if, if, if a giant cheeseburger wasn't chasing us. Uh, yeah, good point. Sorry I ruined your birthday, Brookie. That's all right. We'll figure this out somehow. If that cheeseburger ever goes away. Wait a minute, I have an idea. I could take a chomp chomp out of his head. I love cheeseburgers. Molly, I think that might make you a zombie if you try to eat the cheeseburger's brain. Good point. <laughs>Gwen and I love chilling on my couch watching TV and eating lots of potato chips well actually I like pizza and I also like cupcakes but for now I'm just gonna eat chips because that's what I really want today's story is going to be crazy because I learned a lesson from a crystal ball I know right but this crystal ball let me see the future <laughs> Oh my gosh, I love this show. I could literally binge watch this all day long. Gwen, come on, you need to do your homework. Let's go. Mom, I'm busy right now. I'm binge watching Netflix and I love this show. And besides, I'm not done eating my chips. Gwen, I've asked you every single day to get off the couch, do your chores, and come on, do your homework. What happens if you fail? I'm not gonna fail, Mom. I'm gonna be just fine. I mean, I got a C plus on my last test. A C plus, Gwen, you're so much smarter than that. You know you could be getting better grades if you actually applied yourself and did your homework and studied. Yeah, but who wants to do that, Mom? That sounds so boring. Oh, I love this show. I can't believe I've watched it for so many hours straight. Like, it's getting kind of crazy. I think I'm their most dedicated fan ever. Gwen, are you still sitting on that couch? I told you, you need to do your homework. You know, you're going to end up, well, well, like a bum living on the street or something. Mom, quit being so dramatic. I'm fine. Besides, I'm just about to find out what happens to this one character on my show and... Gwen, I'm serious. Turn off that TV before your entire life is ruined. Uh-oh. I wonder what I could find on Amazon. If there's any new shows or... Oh, new treats. I love buying snacks and new movies to watch on Amazon. What's this? A crystal ball that can predict your future? Whoa. Oh, my God. I can just see it now. If I buy this crystal ball, it's going to tell me my future. Gwen, Gwen, uh, can I take your picture, please? You're just so famous. Could, could, could you just please? Sorry, I'm going into the grocery store to buy more snacks, so I have them when I watch Netflix. Maybe next time. Whoa, you're so popular, and all you do is eat snacks and watch Netflix? 
Your life is so dreamy. Yeah. <laughs> I'm going to buy this crystal ball with my allowance money because I just know that I'm going to have the most fabulous future ever. And I don't even have to do anything but sit on my couch. Oh my gosh, I can't believe my Amazon package is here already. I can see my beautiful future in three, two, one. Thank you for choosing Amazon. Um, here's your package. Thank you. It's a, it's a crystal ball. It's a crystal ball. Whoa, that sounds like sort of like, uh, well, a uh, scam. It's not a scam. OMG, it's beautiful. And it's going to tell me exactly what I want to see. Hmm. Crystal ball, crystal ball. Will I have the best future of them all? Whoa, what's happening? <coughs> wow, <coughs> this crystal ball is, well, <coughs> kind of stinky. Yeah. It smells like it had a rotten taco for lunch. Ew. Wait a minute. I think it's starting to show me something. My, my, my future. I'm so hungry and thirsty. And it's so cold out here. I wish I had a, a, a house, but I have no job. And, and, oh no. Wait a minute, is that a dumpster? Oh, I bet there's something in there I could eat, even if it is old and maybe kind of crusty and maybe it has a little mold on it. I can just pick the mold off and that's no big deal. I mean, the last time I had to go dumpster diving, I had to fight off a raccoon, but you know, I, I, I didn't mind. I mean, the raccoon did, but I got to eat something and I'm really hungry. Ugh, it smells so bad in here. There has to be something to eat. <gasps> I found it. Ooh, what a piece of pizza and it's not even that gross. <laughs> I mean, it's a little gross because somebody threw it out in the trash, yeah. but still very edible. Mmm. Mmm. Oh, that tastes so good. I need to find a job. Stat! Hello, how can I help you? Whoa, what's that smell? Oh, sorry. Um, I haven't been able to take a shower today. I've been really busy out looking for a job. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's it. It wasn't that I was diving in the dumpster for a piece of pizza. <laughs> Not me. Um, okay, what can I help you with? Would you like to open a bank account? Uh, no, I saw an ad that you wanted someone to work here, and I was wondering, I'll do any job, really. I just need a job. Will you hire me? Um, well, okay, where did you go to college? I didn't. Uh-oh! Okay, I'm sorry. You have to have a college degree in banking in order to work here. Oh. Okay. Maybe try the Brookhaven Diner. I know they were looking for a new waitress. Oh, great. Thank you. Hey there, honey. What can I do for you? You hungry? Ooh, something smells so ripe. Were you near our dumpster out back? Oh, hi. <laughs> um, yeah, I walked past it. And it was so smelly. It just, well, it just surrounded me. And it was, it's on my clothes and stuff. But it's not actually me that smells like that, of course. Anyway, I really was wondering if I could work here as a waitress. Oh, sugar. I just took the job last week. <laughs> I'm new here. Sorry, we're not even hiring. Oh, okay. Do you know anyone in Brookhaven that is? Well, if you got a college degree, the bank is hiring, and I heard the hospital's looking for nurses, and... No, no, no. I didn't go to college. You see, I just spent all of my schooling, junior high, high school... All of them, basically, just sitting on my couch, never doing any homework. Oh, sugar. That was a real bad idea. Okay, well, um, sorry about that. Do you want something to eat? No, I don't have any money to make, and also I just ate some pizza from the dumpster. What'd you say? Oh, nothing. What am I gonna do? I guess, I guess I'll just have to take out my sleeping bag again and sleep next to the dumpster. I should have, I should have done my homework and studied and got good grades so I could get a good job. Now I don't know what I'm going to do. I'm, I'm stuck. I'm homeless. I have no food or no house. Why didn't I listen to my mom? Oh, holy, holy cow. If I don't stop being lazy, eating chips and binge watching Netflix all day, my future is super dark. Oh, 
I need to really get my act together. All right, first things first, no more yucky snacks. Oh my gosh, this is so much work. Gwen? Wait a minute, what have you done with my daughter? You can't possibly be my daughter because my daughter is a, well, lazy bum and sits on the couch all day. No, mom, you don't understand. I, I, I can't let this be my future. Well, Gwen, I'm proud of you to hear you say that. Good job. Really, Mom? You're you're proud of me? Of course I am. Honey, this is great that you're turning over a new leaf. Congratulations on doing and being your best. Thanks, Mom! Wow, this math homework is kind of hard, but I'm determined to turn my grades around and start doing really well in school. I just need to put in another hour or two of studying, and then I should be ready for the math test. Okay, class, pencils and pens down. That's all the time there is for their test. Boy, Gwen, I can tell already you're probably gonna get detention. We'll see about that, Mrs. Griffin. I've been studying. Wait, what? I know, it sounds crazy, but grade my test and you'll see. Oh my gosh, Gwen, you, you got a 96 on your test. This is amazing. Wow, I I feel like I'm finally gonna have the future that I always wanted. I'm very proud of you, Gwen. And you should be very proud of yourself. I am. I think that I can be, well, anything. Crystal ball, crystal ball. I think you're going to show me I have the best future of them all. Oh. Oh, this thing makes so much smelly smoke. Oh, wait. What's this? It's still showing me as homeless! What? But I did all this work! What? Wait a minute! I'm calling Amazon support! Thank you for calling Amazon. How can I help you today? Yeah, I ordered this crystal ball and it's supposed to predict your future, but all it does is show me as homeless over and over again, even though I changed my life. What's going on with this thing? Am I just doomed? Um, well, I'm not a psychic, but we have gotten a lot of complaints about the crystal ball predicting a horrible future for people. I think there might be some sort of short circuit in our crystal balls, you know. They're supposed to sort of just be for fun. Wait, it doesn't really predict your future? No, nothing could do that. Only you can with hard work. And then it's not always guaranteed that you're going to be successful. Wait, what? So you mean I'm gonna put all this work in and I might still be, well, just a bum? Well, I don't know, but I guess if you sit on the couch all day, you'll never know. Oh, how will I know if all this hard work is gonna get me anywhere? Well, I guess I'll just sit on the couch then. What? No, you're not sitting on the couch, honey. You've been working so hard. Come on, I'll take you to your favorite pizza place. You can't give up, no matter how many times you fail in life. Yeah, Mom, I guess you're right. I just wish there was a crystal ball that could actually tell me my future. Oh, honey, we make our own fate. Hmm, gotta have my Starbucks before school in the morning. How else could I make it through the entire school day? Speaking of school days, this school day I'm actually excited about. I know, that's crazy, right? I'm never excited about going to school, but today I am because this weekend's the school dance. And I just know that Luke is gonna ask me. Today's gonna be the most amazing day because he's gonna say, Molly, will you go to the dance with me? And I'm gonna say, of course, Luke, because we're in love and we're gonna get married. Okay, I probably won't say that. I'll probably just say, yeah, I'll go to the dance with you. And I'll leave the marriage stuff for you now after high school. Good morning, Marley. Whoa, you're not even late today. I know, right? It's gonna be a beautiful day at school. Uh, okay, what have you done with my sister? Are you an alien? A monster? <laughs> no, I'm just excited about the school dance. I am too, Marley. I wonder if someone will ask me. I don't know, but Luke's definitely gonna ask me. Oh, hi, Luke. Oh, having your Starbucks, I see, Molly. Yeah, are you eating a burger for breakfast? Yeah, 
It was leftover from last night. I was too lazy to make anything else. <laughs> hey, a burger works for me. Whatever you want. So, uh, Luke, you, you got something to ask somebody? I sure do. And here she comes now. Hey, Sarah. Um, I wanted to, to, uh... What are you saying, Luke? I mean, are you going to spit it out or am I going to stand here all day? What are you asking her, Luke? Um, uh... Will you, um, go to the dance with me? Wait, what? What did you just say? He said, will you go to the dance with me? What? Uh, were you talking to Sarah or somebody else? Excuse me, is this your special moment? Because you keep butting in like it is. I think I just got asked to the dance, so why are you here? Oh, um, uh... So, Sarah, w will you go to the dance with me? Of course I will. What? No! No, this can't be happening! No! Oh, <laughs> Luke was supposed to ask me to the dance! <laughs> my entire life is ruined! Luke is my, is my best friend, but also... Uh, <laughs> I have the biggest crush on him, and now he's gonna take Sarah to the dance! <laughs> Molly? Molly, are you? Oh, there you are, Molly. Oh, Molly, I'm so sorry, you're so sad. My life is over. Oh, Molly, there's plenty of fish in the sea. Well, I can't take a fish to the, to the school dance. What are you even talking about? No, that's just what they say, like there's lots of boys. I don't, I don't want any other boy to take me to the dance. I just wanted Luke to. Well, Molly, I'm sorry, but he's taking Sarah. Thanks, Captain Obvious. I already know that. I know what I could do. I could cast a spell. Make Sarah disappear. I mean, temporarily, just until the school dance is over. Wait, what? You can't do that, Molly. That's a horrible idea. You're going to make her disappear? She'll miss class. And then she might get detention. You mean she doesn't get to go with Luke to the dance and she gets detention? Perfect. Molly, come back here! Don't you dare cast a spell! Molly, this is a bad idea! What are you doing, Molly? You missed all of class. Um, <laughs> I was just prepping to do this. To do what? Wait, wait, what's that book and that wand for? Oh, you just wait and see, Sarah. You just wait and see! Alakazam! Alakazam! I'm gonna make Sarah disappear! What? What's happening? What's happening? Sarah? Sarah? Oh my gosh! My spell! It 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 it, it worked! Ha <laughs> ha I even laugh like a witch, don't I? This is perfect. Now Luke will ask me to the dance! <laughs> Hey, Molly, have you, uh, seen Sarah? Oh, <laughs> yeah, but she disappeared. Wait, what? Yeah, like, permanently, she's gone. Well, at least till after the dance. Wait, wh why did she disappear? What are you talking about? Um, uh, uh, she got snow vid and she's sick. She can't come. Oh, man. I was gonna take her to the dance. I was really excited. You didn't have to be that excited. I mean, she wasn't that special. Um, okay, Molly, are you okay today? Uh, yeah, yeah, I'm fine. Okay, well, I'm just asking, because you seem like, well, a little grumpy. Do you have to fart? No, I don't have to fart! <sniffs> okay, yeah, maybe I did a little. Yeah, see, don't you feel better, Molly? No! Oh my gosh, I have to get to my next class before I'm late. Hey, Brittany, you want to go to the dance? Oh, Luke, I thought you were taking Sarah, but, oh my gosh, I can't believe you chose me. Of course I'll go to the dance with you. Wait, what? Now you're gonna take her? Yeah, she's super cool. <laughs> Ugh, oh my gosh, she doesn't even know what one plus one is. But she's super nice. Ugh. <sighs> Molly, are you okay? Okay, she's running towards the bathroom. She must have to go poo poo or something. Daisy! Molly, what are you doing in here? I'm just washing my hands so I can get ready for lunch. Daisy! <laughs> I have to eliminate all girls on the planet. What are you talking about? Make them disappear. Goodbye, Kaplooey. He asked another girl to the dance after I made Sarah disappear. 
Molly, I think it's a bad idea that you're making all girls disappear. What about me? Well, it's only for a little bit. I have to, Daisy. I have to. Molly, are you okay? I will be. I will be. Alakazam! Alakazam! Let's make all the girls disappear! Ha 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 ha! Whoa, the sky went all funny for a minute there. Uh, does that mean it worked? I'm not really sure. I guess if I go back to the school and I see any girls, I'll know that my spell failed. And I don't see any girls. Jiminy Cricket, my spell actually worked. Hey, Molly, what's up? Oh, uh, hey, Sam. Uh, not much. Just having a better day all of a sudden. That's good, Molly. Oh, look, there's another boy. Hey, Molly. Oh, hey, Aiden. Wow, there really are no girls here. Have you heard the news? It seems like all the girls in the entire school have disappeared. They must have all got snowed or something. Oh, wow. So, um, you can't take Sarah to the dance. You can't take Brittany to the dance. No, I can't take any girls to the dance. Wait, what? No, no, you can't. Either there's, there's a girl left. Oh, uh, well, I guess I didn't really even want to go to the dance. It's sort of a girl thing. I mean, I like to dance, but I can dance at home. And sometimes I even make videos for TikTok. Want to see one? Um, uh, not really. So, who are you going to take to the dance? Nobody. If I go, I guess I'm just gonna go alone. I mean, there's no girls to ask. What are you talking about there's no girls to ask? There's lots of girls to ask! Well, I mean, not lots, but th there's one! Really? Where? I don't, I don't see a girl anywhere. Me! I'm a girl! Oh, yeah, I forgot you were a girl. <laughs> You're just like my best buddy, my best friend. I just think of you as like, I don't know, not, not really a, a girl. Well, I am a girl! That's it. This spell didn't work. I gotta go talk to my sister, Daisy. I'm feeling so sad. Daisy, are you still in the bathroom? Wait, maybe she was having lunch. She said she was gonna have lunch. Daisy? Wait a minute. There, there's no Daisy because... I disappeared all the girls in Brookhaven. So, so, Daisy's a girl and now I don't have my sister. I have to reverse this spell. I have to reverse it. Okay, I can do this. I mean, I'm not really good at reversal spells. They usually go wrong, but, but, but I think I can do it. I hope I can do it. I need my sister back. I need to talk to her. I'm having a really bad day. Alakazam, Alakazan, my last spell. Be undone! Did it work? Did it work? Molly, there you are. Hi. <laughs> I'm so in love with you. Will you go to the school dance with me? Wait, what? I've been thinking about you all day and my heart just breaks when I'm not near you. Oh, Molly, you're my girlfriend. I am? No, she's my girlfriend. No, she's not. She's my girlfriend. Okay, I'm neither of your girlfriends. She's my girlfriend. No, she's mine. Uh-oh. This reversal spell didn't seem to work. Uh-oh. Gotta go. Gotta go to the bathroom. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Uh, uh, finally. Oh, Molly. This is the girl's bathroom. Because I'm in love with you. Ooh. I know, that's why you're not supposed to be in here. I don't care, because my love for you is true. Ah! Get out of the girl's bathroom! Oh my gosh, where can I hide? I'm so embarrassed right now. He saw me fart! Oh, that is so embarrassing. I know how to make myself feel better. I just need a slice of pizza. That makes the everything in the world so much better. Mm. That's good pizza. Hey, you like pizza? So don't I. Huh, what? Oh, I can't believe it. You're going to be my girlfriend. Wait, no, I'm not. What are you talking about? Yeah, <laughs> we are. We're going to go to the dance together and we, we love, both love pizza. Why wouldn't we go to the dance together and be boyfriend and girlfriend? Oh my gosh. The school has gone completely crazy. Daisy! Did my spell bring all the girls back? Molly, what's going on? Daisy! Oh my gosh, I'm so glad to see you. What do you mean you're so happy to see me? It's during the school day. Of course I'm here. Oh, Daisy, I made a huge mistake. What are you talking about, Molly? What's going on? Well, it all started when... Oh, 
Alakazam! Alakazun! My last spell. Be undone! Did it work? Did it work? Boo, 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 boo. Let me get this straight for a second. You, you, you did a reversal spell? So what was the spell to begin with? Um, well, you don't remember this, I guess, but I... I made it so that all the girls would disappear so Luke would ask me to the dance. And it didn't work and I needed to talk to you and so, um, here we are and, uh, when I reverse the spell, now all the boys are in love with, well, me! Wait, whoa, whoa, whoa. So you did a spell to make me and all the other girls disappear so you wouldn't have any competition for Luke? Correct. And then when it didn't work, you wanted me back? Correct. So you did a reversal spell? Correct. And it backfired and now all the boys at school are in love with you? Also correct. Money! You should stop doing spells! Obviously you're terrible at them! Um, uh, uh, exactly my point. Now what are we gonna do? I can't wait to take a selfie with my new girlfriend! New girlfriend? What's he talking about? Oh no, he means me. Oh, Molly, when you're making that angry face, you're so beautiful! What? No, I'm not! I look ugly right now! Uh, Molly, I think he loves you no matter what because you put a spell on him! Well, I didn't mean to. It was just sort of a backfire spell, but whoopsie. Um, I'm really sorry, Jack, but we can't, we can't be boyfriend-girlfriend. Wait, what? What'd you just say to me? Um, we can't be boyfriend-girlfriend? Then I... I'm going to have such a broken heart that I'm going to need to explode all the broken even. <laughs> uh, Daisy, there's only one thing to do. Run! Molly! Are these boys going to follow us home? I don't know. I hope not. Meet me at my science lab. We'll try to fix this. Good plan. Molly, go to the dance with me and I'll give you a loan. Do you work at the bank even? Of course I do. <laughs> I'm a mortgage lender. You could have a brand new house. No, I don't need a new house. But I want to take you to the dance. <sighs> oh my gosh. That was so far to run, Daisy. How'd you beat me? Because I didn't have an entire town of boys chasing me. That's how. I can't believe what a mess you've made of everything, Molly. <sighs> I know. I don't do my homework. I sleep in past my alarm, so I miss the school bus. I set bad spells, and then when I reverse them, the whole world explodes. Pretty much, Molly. But according to my calculations, I should be able to reverse everything well without too many mistakes. See, so you don't know how to do it either. Yes, I do. I'm just trying to unravel your giant mess. Molly, there you are. I've been looking everywhere for you. Oh, Luke, the world's gone crazy out there. Yeah. Crazy for you, Molly, because you're just so special, and and I I I, I I'm tongue tied around you. Wait, what? I thought you didn't want to take me to the dance. No, I I'm in love with you. You you are, Molly. That's just the spell talking. Now I think it's really Luke. Molly, you know it's not. I didn't want to take you to the dance before you backfired spell. Oh, who cares? Who cares about a spell or a wrong spell or a right spell? You've put a spell on my heart, Molly, and I'm going to love you forever. Oh, <laughs> well, um, okay. Uh, Daisy, we're not gonna reverse the spell. What do you mean we're not gonna reverse the spell? Molly, snap out of it. I can't, I'm too busy gazing into Luke's beautiful eyes. Molly, he doesn't really love you, it's just a spell. It'll never be true love. You'll be living a lie. I don't care, Dizzy. I'm gonna go to the school dance with Luke, and I'll do anything to do it. So you only want Luke to take you to the school dance because he's under a spell, not because he actually likes you? I don't even know you anymore, Molly. I can't believe I'm about to say this, but... <sighs> Luke, I can't go to the school dance with you. What? No! My heart! It's broken! <laughs> do this, Molly. This is all you're doing. Now, the spell is going to be reversed. All I have to do is say these simple words and program it into my computer, of course. Alakazam! Alakazoom! My sister's spells are done by a noob! Really? That's the spell? Yes, Molly, that's the spell. Luke? Luke, are you okay? 
I feel kind of weird. Oh, it's been a very long day. Do you need a glass of water? Uh, I'll get you one. Don't hate me, please. Hate you? No, I don't hate you, but why'd you cast a spell on everybody? My brain hurts. Um, well, this is embarrassing and don't hate me! I already said I'm not going to hate you. What's going on, Molly? Oh, look. I could get a job as a scientist. This would be awesome. Daisy, no one cares about your job search. Sorry, I'm just saying I'm overqualified. Aunt uh, Luke, so do you hate me? No, Molly. But you cast a spell on me and everyone else in town. That wasn't very nice. It's because I wanted to go to the dance with you and you kept asking everyone else. My heart was breaking. Oh, Molly. This spell made me realize something. Do you hate me? No, how many times do I have to say it? I don't hate you. I actually really like you. Like, like, I think I might be in love with you. Say what? I didn't see that one coming. Neither did I, Marley. Neither did I. Uh, I was wondering, um, do you want to be my girlfriend? Really? Or is this still a spell? No, according to my calculations, Marley, um, the spell was broken. Daisy, you're on a shopping website. I know, but I checked before I got on you. Look at these pants. Aren't they cute? Daisy! I already did my job, Molly. Uh, so Molly, what do you say? Will you, will you be my girlfriend? Um, uh... Of course I will, Luke! <laughs> this is like the best day ever. Wait a minute! Does being your girlfriend mean you're still taking Sarah or Brittany to the dance? No, silly. <laughs> it means I'm taking you to the dance. Yahoo! Then my answer is yes. Oh my gosh, my sister has a boyfriend! Luke, you're the cutest boy in the whole school. The cutest boy! because today is the first day of being boyfriend and girlfriend at school with Luke. I can't wait to announce it to everyone. But first, I have to get dressed. What should I wear? What should I wear? What should I wear? I have to look so cute today. Oh, look at these jeans. They have little hearts on them. That's kind of perfect because my heart is so full of for Luke. Let's see, does this match? Oh yeah, I look adorable, I look styling, I look ready to announce that I'm Luke's girlfriend. Riley, why are you awake before 6.30? Are you crazy right now? Who are you even? Because obviously you're not Molly getting out of bed this early. Nope, I'm definitely your sister. Wake up, wake up, wake up, wake up! Oh, Molly, why are you jumping on me, you cray cray? Today is the first day of being boyfriend and girlfriend at school, of course, so that's why I'm super excited and I have to get up. Okay. Uh, I'll be up in a minute, Molly. Uh, at least you're not excited. It's pizza day. Wait, it's pizza day too? Molly guacamole! This day couldn't get any better! Oh, hey, Luke. Oh, hey, Sarah. Um, sorry that I changed my mind about taking you to the school dance, but Molly's my girlfriend now and... Wait, what? I thought I heard this really weird rumor that she was your girlfriend, but I can't believe it's actually true. Your boyfriend, girlfriend with Molly? Ugh, she's not even popular. I know, but she's my best friend and we get along and we both love pizza and Roblox and um, we both laugh when she farts. I mean, it's just a match made in heaven. Oh, you know she only wants to be with you because you're popular, right? So she can be popular too. Wait, what? There's my boyfriend, Luke! <laughs> and he's talking to Sarah? Oh no, he's gonna dump me for her. Oh my gosh! I knew he wasn't over her! I knew he'd want to take her to the school dance! <laughs> my heart's broken! Molly? Molly! Molly, I can't come into the girls' bathroom! Come on, I'll get detention if I go in there! Come out, tell me what's wrong! My life is over! I thought Luke loved me! <laughs> he'd rather take Sarah to the dance! <laughs> oh, there's Daisy! Daisy, 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 Daisy! What? I just got in the door. What is it? It's Molly. She's super upset. She ran into the girl's bathroom and I can't go in the girl's bathroom, but you can, so we have to talk to her. Why is she super upset, Luke? Because it's all my fault. I was talking to Sarah and she saw us. Oh, don't tell me now you're taking Sarah to the dance again. No. 
Molly's my girlfriend. I'm taking Molly. Sarah just was trying to fill my head with nonsense, but I know she's a liar. But that's good. But why is Molly upset? I already said because she saw me with her and, and, and she thinks I'm going to dump her or something. Oh, I get it now. Yeah, you're totally in trouble now. Will you talk to Molly, please? Ah, okay. I'll go talk to her. As long as I'm not late for math class, I have a very important test today. Thank you, Daisy. Thank you so much. My life is over. Molly? Oh, go away, Daisy. I don't even want to talk to you right now. Molly, we need to talk. We're sisters. It's what we're here for. I thought we just fought all the time. Isn't that what you're here for? And to annoy me. No, Molly. Not to annoy you. Uh, to be an amazing sister who listens to you. Besides, I have a message from Luke. I don't want to hear it. Don't even tell me it. It's going to be bad. It's going to say, I dump you, Molly. Actually, quite the opposite. He's worried about you, Molly. He is? Yeah. He doesn't want to dump you. He, he knows Sarah's full of it. Really? Yeah, you know, Sarah, talk, 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 and all that comes out is garbage. Yeah, she really is rude and mean and sort of a bully, right? Most of the time, that's right. But he still loves you, Molly, and he still wants to take you to the dance and be boyfriend, girlfriend. Molly, you finally came out of the girls' bathroom. I brought your favorite pizza. Oh, Luke, you're the sweetest. Molly, I'm going to love you forever. Someday I'll probably marry you. Probably? What do you mean, probably? I'm gonna, I'm gonna, oh boy, I just, I keep messing this up today. Oh, being your boyfriend's kind of hard work. Well, get used to it. It's almost time for lunch, and that means Luke's gonna pick me up. We're having Starbucks together. I think he's the sweetest. Hey, Molly, are you ready to go to lunch? Uh, yeah, I'll be right there. I just have to log out from work. So, uh, Molly, um, I'm gonna need you to buy a really pretty white dress from your job. Wait, what? Why? Those are like $500 here. I can't afford that and rent. Well, uh, well, uh, I'm kind of nervous to ask you this, Molly, but, um, oh. you're gonna need the dress if you want to marry me. Say what? Please! Molly, I'm so in love with you. Marry me! Marry me! <laughs> oh my goodness, Luke! Of course I'll marry you! I've been waiting for this day since... Well, we were boyfriend-girlfriend ten years ago. I know. Yay! She's gonna marry me! She's gonna marry me! Are you gonna sing to me at our wedding? Maybe. Would you like that? Uh, no. Well, at least my new bride is going to be honest. <laughs> wow, Molly, you look beautiful. I can't believe it's your wedding day. I know, but I'm just a little nervous because the wedding was supposed to start, well, right now, and Luke's still not here. You know Luke. He's always 10 minutes late. He's been that way since you guys dated in high school. But this is his wedding day. Well, I still get paid whether he shows up or not. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're going to get paid. He's not going to show up. We're not going to get married. Molly, he's going to show up. Don't you worry. Oh, my gosh. I'm late. I'm late. I'm late for my own wedding. Oh. Whoa. Molly, you look beautiful. See, I told you he'd show up, Molly. Luke, you look so handsome. I'm sorry I'm late. <laughs> you know me. Yep, always ten minutes late. You'll be ten minutes late to your own funeral. Okay, can we get on with this ceremony? I do have a funeral next, and I gotta get moving. I think the dead person won't mind if you're a little late. It's not like they're going anywhere. <laughs> oh, Molly, always the comedian. Okay, this is going to be the fast version. Luke, do you take Molly to be your wife? I do. Molly, do you take Luke to be your husband? I do! Forever and ever and ever and ever and ever and ever and ever! Even when you're ten minutes late! Oh no, she's going to sing. Then I now pronounce you husband and wife. You may kiss the bride or whatever. Mm -hmm. Oh wow, Molly, I can't believe it. We're married. Da 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 And now for the honeymoon. Where are we going? We're gonna go over to Brookhaven Lake. Seriously? That's all we're going to? Yeah, is that not good? Oh, it'll be perfect, Luke. I thought we were going to Hawaii, but you know, 
you can start off our marriage with a little bit of disappointment. Seriously, Molly? <laughs> I'm just kidding. But you gotta walk since it, I didn't want to go there. Molly! You're running my car into the wall. Oh, Molly, why are you trying to run me over? Okay, this might not work out. You may need to get a divorce. Are you serious? No, I'm just kidding, but I really don't want to walk there. Too bad! I was expecting Hawaii! Another snowstorm. Mm, this donut tastes pretty good, though. Maybe it's not as cold out as I think it is. Oh no, it's freezing! Ah, oh, totally, Molly. But that's okay. We can always find something fun to do inside. Yeah, like your donuts, Molly. It's a new year. It could be a new year, new you. Blah blah blah. I like the old me. Well, um, the old you wears terrible outfits. And, um, eats way too many donuts. So judgy, this one. Listen, I like Molly just the way she is. If you don't, that's your problem, girlfriend. Well, I'm just saying, I think you'd be really, really helped out by my new TikTok idea. You have TikTok? Well, not yet, but I'm going to sign up. It's called New Year, New You. Oh, like I haven't heard that one before. Yeah, but it's all about, like... Having great fashion, um, even cooking healthy meals. Well, pretty soon, in about a week, you can turn your TikTok channel to eating terrible meals for beginners or for advanced people. Because basically, everybody in the new year wants to be healthy and whatever for like a week, and then they just decide, nah, and they eat all the donuts. <laughs> I just skip all that and just keep eating the donuts. Molly, seriously, stop eating that donut. I'm going to make an amazing TikTok. Now stay out of the kitchen and don't interrupt my healthy cooking TikTok. Yeah, okay, whatever. She gone. Hey, back to eating a delicious donut. As you can see here, I'm making a delicious apple that's baked in the oven. Super delicious and good for you. Hey, I'm Molly, her slob of a sister. I dress bad and I eat way too many donuts. Molly, get out of my TikTok. <laughs> I'm pushing send. <laughs> it's uploaded on your TikTok. Nah, 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 nah. Molly, how could you? Wait a minute. I already got 10 likes on that. Wait, what? They think that we're funny together? Yeah. You're funny looking. Molly, rude! Oh my god, now we have a thousand people liking it. Oh my god, Molly! It went up to 50,000! What? It's been like 30 seconds. Mm. I'm getting more TikTok subscribers before I even finish this donut. Ugh. Okay, now I got a little bit of a stomach ache. And these pants are getting a little tight. Molly! We're going to be TikTok famous. So, TikTok fans, if you want to have these adorable pigtails like I have, you just have to brush your hair exactly like this. Daisy, get out of the bathroom. I have to go. <coughs> Molly, I'm making a TikTok. What do you want? I need to use the potty. Seriously, Molly? Well, I guess it's TikTok gold. Well, whatever, but get out. Okay, TikTok fans, I'm going to show you how to get your beach body just in time for spring break. That's why right, let's start off with some jumping jacks in this new year, new you. Um, you could do all that, or you could say whatever, and sit on your couch and eat lots of donuts, till your pants don't fit, till your stomach explodes. Sounds like the good life to me. Molly! You could have put another TikTok. Ha ha ha. I don't think I'm ruining them. Everybody loves my personality. Holy guacamole. Macaroni and cheese. Hot dogs with ketchup. Yeah, Molly, we get the point. Food, food, and food. I can't believe that our TikTok has 1.5 billion people that are our fans. I know, right? This is amazing. We should go celebrate with um food. Molly, no. New Year, New You is all about healthy choices. And we could do something like yoga as a celebration. Is my sister kidding me right now? Like, seriously? Yoga? No, girl. You earned this. We're going for an ice cream. 
Well, they do have the frozen yogurt option, so I guess it's okay. Uh, Daisy life is about balance. Sometimes that balance means eating ice cream. Don't be such an income poop. Molly! I'm just saying, sometimes you just really need to have an ice cream. And girl, you need one. Welcome to Sweet Tooth. What can I get for you? I don't have a scoop of everything. Molly, new you, new you. You mean new year, new you? Yeah, whatever. Get one scoop, Molly. Wow, who knew you were so bossy? Well, I am a health guru now. TikTok even said so. Oh my god. It's Molly and Daisy. Oh my god, I can't believe it. I'm such a huge fan. I have to go say hi to them. Did you just hear that? I think that girl knows who we are. Nah, it must be a different Molly and Daisy. We're not that famous. Hey guys, it's Sarah. Welcome to my TikTok. And I'm here with Molly and Daisy. And hey, we didn't agree to be on your TikTok. Molly, come on. She's a fan. Don't be rude. Okay, well, she should have asked permission first. I, 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 I don't even look my best. Molly, you always look like that. Okay, but all right. She has a point. OMG, I can't believe it. This is amazing. What? You guys are famous and you're here at my at my ice cream shop? Woohoo! 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 Um, yeah, we really are that famous, Daisy. Yeah, I realized that. Aren't you excited? New Year, New You on TikTok is doing amazing! It's blowing up! But Molly, everybody knows who we are everywhere now. Can I get your autograph? Yeah, me too. And I want a picture. And can you be in my YouTube video? And and also, can you come home and um just like sign my cat? How am I gonna sign your cat? Oh, it's it's a cat that doesn't have any fur, so you could use a sharpie. No, I'm not gonna sign the cat. Hi, yi yi. I just want my ice cream, and and I want to just go sit down. Daisy, are you okay? You seem like you're freaking out about being a celebrity. Because Molly, I am. But you wanted New Year, New You on TikTok. Yeah, but now that I got fame, I want to give it back. Come on, Molly. Let's just go home and hide out. Good idea if you don't want to be famous, which I kind of do. No, Molly, I'm telling you. I can always see into the future. Wait, you can't? Are you some sort of like magical human or something? No, I'm just really smart. And this, this isn't going to go well at all. Well, if you say so... I think being famous is amazing. Finally, home sweet home. No people talking about how famous we are or anything. Yeah, but seriously, don't you want to be famous? I don't know, Molly. Seems kind of crazy to just go places and everybody recognizes you. What about ice cream on my face doing that girl's TikTok? Oh, you could be like me and don't care. I'm eating a donut right now. And I don't really care if anybody sees. Hi, um, I didn't get a picture with you guys, and so I followed you home. What? You can't follow us home. That's wrong and rude. <laughs> ha, ha, achoo! Ew, Molly, cover your nose. Sorry, I wasn't expecting to sneeze. Achoo! Molly, did you get sick? I don't know, maybe that fan had a cold, and she got super close to me and gave it to me. Ew, germs! Well, I think you better get used to it, because it seems like we're going to be mobbed by fans... From here on out, we need a security camera. And maybe a fence. Whoa. What's that? Uh-oh. Oh, my God. It's someone who looks just like me because they saw my videos about how to do pigtails. Hey, I love you. I want to be just like you. <laughs> oh, my God. That's hot shoe. Creepy. Oh, one of the fans definitely got me sick. I don't feel so good. Ugh. Molly, do you want a donut? Maybe it'll make you feel better. No! I don't want a donut! Now I have to go to the bathroom! Oh, that sounds so gross! Uh oh! Whoa, she really is sick! If going to eat a donut's gonna make her throw up! Ugh. Did you see that TikTok where Molly was like, don't work out, just like hang out and eat on the couch <laughs> and shove your face full of donuts? Yeah, I totally loved that one. It was hilarious. <laughs> we could be BFFs since we're such Molly and Daisy fans. I don't feel so good. Am I drooling? I don't know. I'm too busy over here vegging on the couch. Uh, 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 who got us sick? They aren't super fans. They're terrible fans. Hello, this is Bruce Springer for Action News. Today 
have a breaking story. The new famous TikTokers, Molly and Daisy, are very sick. If you like reality TV, you're gonna love this one. Watch them puke! Watch them sneeze snot everywhere! Watch them run to the potty! Are you serious? Get out of our house! This one's obviously rude in real life. I don't know if you should like her. Oh, uh, maybe unsubscribe. What? Don't tell people that! Rude! Get out! Molly, there's only one thing left to do. Run! I don't know if I can run. I gotta go potty! Oh, hello, adoring fans. It's me, Bruce Springer. Get out of the way, Bruce. I just want to be your friend. Come back, Molly. Come on. We could be BFFs. Get away from me, crazy Daisy wannabe. <laughs> huh, huh, huh. Come on. I could build a house right next door to you. It would be so much fun, right? No, stay away from me. Hurry, Molly, come down here into my science lab. Okay, I wasn't going to tell you about this, but I've been working on a new project. Is it quitting TikTok? Well, no, I mean, we're already famous at TikTok. Kind of hard to go back now, but I have a solution. Well, I hope it's a good one. Ha, ha, chew! Because I don't feel good, and I don't want Bruce Springer, like, putting me on the news when I'm sick. Achoo! Come here, Molly. I want to show you something. What is that? A giant person made out of jello? Sort of, Molly. I haven't quite finished programming it yet. But in a moment's time, you'll see what I'm up to. I don't know, Daisy. This seems a little like weird science to me. Uh, Daisy, I think you're cooking your jello, man. Don't worry, Molly, that th this is going to work. It just has to. Holy macaroni and cheese! It's a, it's a, it's a, it's a, a clone! That's right, Molly. And I'm making one for you, too. Which means next time, when someone thinks it's us, it won't be us at all. It'll be our clone. Watch this. Hey, Daisy Clone. Hey, I just want to let you know, you guys are the best fans in the whole world. See? Daisy Clone is amazing. I had to sit down for a minute. I'm a little lightheaded about how awesome I am to design this. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, it's Daisy. Hi, hi. I'm your biggest fan. I'm even wearing Daisy pants because, you know, your name is Daisy, just like the flower. And oh my God, where's Molly? Hi, you're the nicest fans in the world. I love you. Whoa, she said she loved us. Did you hear that? I totally did. Oh my God, that's amazing. So, um, will you sign an autograph? Sure, I'll sign an autograph. You're the most amazing fans in the world. I love you. Holy guacamole! The Daisy clone is working! Now we just need a clone of me, and it's all smooth sailing. <laughs>
Um, Molly, I'm so sorry, but I have to go do some homework now, but can we talk tomorrow? Yeah. I'm sorry, Molly. I'm sorry you're hurting right now, but don't forget, we're BFFs. I know. Thanks for listening, Brookie. Bye. Brookie! Hey, good morning! Oh, what's Sarah doing? Hey, Brookie. Nice to see you. Good morning. Sarah, why are you talking to my best friend? I didn't know it was illegal to talk to people at school. Well, well, but she's my best friend. Um, Molly, it's okay. Everything's fine. Don't freak out. Not everything is fine. I... What? Are you feeling kind of jealous? <laughs> Maybe she wants to talk to me too, Molly. You don't own Brookie. Whatever! Oh, this is such the worst day of my life ever! Molly, what's going on? Are you okay? No, I'm having another bad day and it just started. Oh, Molly, I'm sorry you're having such a rough time. But we have to skip ready for this quiz we're having in math class. I can't even think about the quiz. All I can think about is the fact that... My best friend is becoming friends with Sarah, who's a giant bully! Aww. Okay, class, um, everybody come on in, come on. We have a quiz today. Molly, did you study? Yeah, sort of. Aww, could this day get any worse? Probably. I mean, you also look terrible in that orange-yellow sweater or whatever it is. Oh my gosh, now she's picking on my fashion sense, too? Wow. This test is so much harder than I thought it would be. This test is a piece of cake. Oh, no wonder she thinks it's easy. She's so much smarter than me. I'm such a loser. Molly, don't say that. I just feel terrible about myself today. Sarah's really making me feel down. Okay, everybody, please hand in your test. Uh, the, uh... Test? I thought it was a quiz! Sorry, I meant quiz. The, the, uh, the class is over, so, uh, yeah, I just need to go get a cup of coffee. It's Monday and my brain's not awake yet. Okay, no problem, Mr. Jared. Phew, I'm glad that math test is over, quiz, whatever, whatever it was! It was horrible and I don't ever want to take it ever again. <laughs> Time to get out my books from English class. What's this? It's a letter, I wonder who it could be from. Dear Molly, I don't want to be your friend anymore. You're mean? My BFF is Sarah? At least she's honest? Oh my gosh. Brookie... Brookie doesn't want to be my friend anymore! <laughs> I don't know what I ever did wrong, but I don't think that I'm mean or a liar. Molly, are you in here? You missed all of English class. Molly, are you with you? Just go away, Daisy. Molly, I know I'm only your sister, but... If you need me to be, I could be your friend, too. Come on out, Molly. Talk to me. Oh, I, I'm having the worst life ever. Oh, there, there, Molly. I'll give you a hug and then make you feel a lot better. It doesn't make me feel... Okay, it made me feel a little bit better, but... But I can't figure out why Brookie doesn't like me anymore. What? Brookie doesn't like you anymore. This is news to me. What's going on, Molly? I saw her hanging out with Sarah this morning. She was probably just talking to her to be nice. Yeah, but then I got this letter in the, in my locker. What? Let me see that. It says, Molly, I don't want to be your friend anymore. You're mean, and I want to be best friends with Sarah because at least she's honest. Holy guacamole! This must be some sort of huge misunderstanding. It must be, Molly. You know Brookie loves you. You're her best friend, and you've been that way since preschool, since you were toddlers. Well, this letter says it all. Our friendship, it's over. Well, Molly, at least we're having pizza for lunch. Well, yeah, I guess that is a plus. You, you can't, you can't knock having pizza for lunch. Well, but it's still making me really upset. Come on, Molly. The pizza will at least make you smile a little. You gotta be hungry. Yeah, I am pretty hungry. Okay, let's go to lunch. Pizza makes everything better, right? <gasps> oh my God. Brookie and Sarah are sitting next to each other. That letter must be true. Oh, look, it's a loser, Brookie. <sighs> Don't let her sit next to us. Well, um, uh, oh, <laughs> everyone hates me, including my best friend. <laughs> Just hide behind this dumpster where nobody can find me. That's all anybody thinks I'm worth, trash. <laughs> We've been friends since we were Toddlers, and now she doesn't even like me anymore. <laughs> Who's texting me? Oh, it's Brookie. I'm, I'm not even going to look at it. I mean, why should I? 
she's she's not even my friend anymore. I mean, she's made it clear that she doesn't want to be my friend. So why just keep sending me texts to be mean to me or something? I don't need to look at those. I, I don't need to look at them. We're not friends anymore. 20 minutes later. Ha! Ah, what are you guys doing here? Well, we are walking home from school. You missed the rest of the day. Yeah, Molly, what were you thinking? Skipping school? Ugh, you're obviously not a good student. Well, um, that was never in question, was it? I mean, what's in question here is if I was a good friend and I don't think I was a bad one. I mean, I, I never have lied to you and, and... I don't think I was mean to you, and if I have been, I, I... We don't want to hear it. Ugh, what's that smell? Ew, you smell like a dumpster. No wonder you're next to it, because <laughs> you smell like garbage. Molly, I'm sorry, but Sarah just seems like a better friend. I mean, at least she's honest. Yeah, but she's a bully! You want to be a bully? Well, I mean, you just don't know her like I do, okay? So, um, we're breaking up as friends. What? You don't want to be my friend anymore? Sorry, Molly, but no, I don't. I just want to be Sarah's friend now, and she's going to be my, my BFF, right, Sarah? Yeah, whatever. We're going to be BFFs. This is going to be awesome. I mean, she brings me coffee in the morning from Starbucks, so she's pretty cool. Listen to the yourself, Brookie. She's not a real friend. She's a bully. Molly, you're not going to change my mind about this. I want to be Sarah's friend. Well, I guess all of those years of us being BFFs mean nothing to you. You're right, Molly. They don't mean anything to me anymore. Okay. Goodbye! <laughs> My life as I know it is over. It's just over. I mean, I don't even have a BFF anymore. Who am I even? Whoa, Molly, is your day still going really, really bad? Totally. Sarah and Brookie found me by the dumpster. What were you doing by the dumpster? Ew, it kind of smells bad. Don't remind me. They already did. What's going on, Molly? She decided she doesn't want to be my BFF anymore. What? So the letter was true? Yeah, every word. She's going to be Sarah's BFF. Oh, Molly. Do you need a hug? Yes, I need a hug. <laughs> except for, except for Brookhaven. We're like ghosts. We can't actually hug each other. <laughs> well, we can just hug like this, Molly. Here you go. There's a good hug for you. Oh, a Brookhaven hug. It'll have to do. <laughs> Molly, I'm always here for you, even though we don't get along. Sometimes I'm your sister and I love you. And I'll be your BFF until you find a new one. But what about Brookie? I thought she was my everything, my BFF. Well, Molly, I'm sorry you've had such a bad day. I hope things get better for you. Me too. Me too. I think it will be. I've never played this game before. But, you know, bacon is delicious, so it should be fun. Way more tasty than lava. Whoa! Everybody get up high, up high. Everybody get up high. Floor's gonna be bacon in six seconds. Whoa, I'm just like jumping as high as I can, but I don't, I don't think I can jump any higher than that. Oh my god, look at all that crispy bacon down there, people. Whoa, I can still jump higher. I could jump higher. Oh my gosh. All right, guys, the bacon is crispy and the grease is definitely rising. Molly! Um, uh, I'm on the way at the top. You survived the crispy bacon. Wait a minute, what's that? I want that bacon. Give me that! Of course, Molly's gonna get the bacon because she's the biggest piggy of them all. That's right, and I'm proud of it! <laughs> Whoa, 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 whoa. All right, I got the crispy bacon on that one. I'm pretty excited about that, guys. Look at all that. Well, there's somebody out there with an umbrella. Like, okay, he's gonna try to go eat that bacon and that didn't work out for him. Like, yeah, Marty, because you ate so much bacon, you can't even move. Ooh, a pyramid of bacon. No, Marty, not a pyramid of bacon. We're just, we're supposed to um climb up the pyramid, I think. You might be right, Daisy, you might be right. Wait, somebody else got my slice of bacon. That makes me annoyed. All right, who's pushing and shoving? The bacon grease is gonna be here any minute. Oh, God, no, I'm swimming in bacon grease. Oh, 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 oh. 
that's a delicious way to but guys look at daisy she's on top of the pyramid daisy that's amazing but you didn't get to eat any bacon i died a happy girl money i was the first one to get the piece of bacon up the pyramid so actually i did get to eat bacon oh man that means i just died then and there's nothing to even say to my sister about it. Look at this Aww. snowman. Oh, he's weird looking, but sort of adorable, right? Bacon will begin to rise in 12 seconds. Bam, bam, bam. Wait a minute. Am I going the wrong way? Oh, wait. No, 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 no. I don't think I am. How many bacon-haired guys are there in here? That's just weird. Floor is bacon, guys. Gotta keep running, running, running. Gotta keep running. Ooh, a piece of bacon. Mm, delicious. Gotta stop for that. Mm. Somebody didn't let me eat it, though. Cause you're already too full of bacon, Molly. There's only so much bacon one person can eat. Hey, wait a minute. Hey, wait. I went up the wrong side. Here comes the bacon grease. Oh, God. Guys, OMG. I'm trying to go as fast as I can, but the bacon just keeps rising. Survive the bacon! Did we make it, Daisy? Did we make it? Ah, uh, yeah, Molly. I think we made it. Oh, congratulations, bacon. You look delicious, but you didn't kill me. Why are you being so weird right now? I can't help it. The bacon, it's just, it looks so good. Whee! Okay, this is fun. Guys, if you think this game looks silly, awesome, and ridiculous, slam that like button. Jump every second. Bacon will rise. Okay, I think we already played this one. Whoa, oh, I jumped on that guy's head. Well, that was helpful. Okay, with the bacon hairs, it's a little weird in here, okay? How many bacon hairs do we really need to have in here? Whoa, come on, come on, come on, come on. I need to make it to the top. Why can I not? Oh, I'm trying to jump, jump. This next time I think I'll make it. Yes. Jump every second because if you don't, here comes the bacon. Guys, look at how far up I'm jumping. I'm going to zoom out to show you guys. Holy guacamole. What if you could jump this high in real life? You would definitely be a superhero. Ooh, a piece of bacon and it's got my name on it. Daisy, don't you dare. <laughs> Molly, I ate that bacon. Daisy, that was so rude. Seriously. I'm annoyed with you right now. I wanted to eat that bacon. I wanted it more than anything in the whole world. Really, I'm the only one that doesn't know where to go in this desert town. Bam, bam, bam. Oh my God, where are we going, guys? I don't even know. We're all gonna die right now because we don't know how to get out of here. Bacon's coming. The bacon is here. I feel like I'm not gonna survive up here. I don't know, though. What do you think? Ooh, Daisy, you're not doing so good. I'm trying, okay? I have a little bit of a stomach ache from eating too much bacon. Me too. Uh -huh. Ew, gross. Sorry about that. <laughs> Bacon does that to me. Actually, I think we're going to be okay. Standing on this um, dinosaur skull or whatever. The bacon's floating around like pool floats in a pool. I got the twinsies over here. The twin bacon hairs. Actually, is, is it twins or triplets? I think there's just twins in you, Molly. How much longer do I have to survive? I don't. I just won. Oh, yeah. Winter Village. You know, there really is nothing better than having some bacon in the middle of winter. I mean, sometimes you're just really hungry. I'm eating that bacon. Don't you dare. <laughs> Ow, he kicked me. He was like, all right, fine. You want to eat the bacon? All right, I'm going to give you a little kick here. Oh, wait, can I jump on those? Yes. All right, I feel like I'm going to do pretty good up here. We could just get up way up on this tree. Oh, wait, there's Daisy on a tree over there. Molly, look at the winter town. It's full of greasy lava. <laughs> With slices of none other than, you guessed it, bacon. If you like bacon, slam that like button. If you don't like bacon, why are you even watching this video? Just kidding! You don't have to like bacon and you can still watch this video because I love you and you're amazing. But there goes Daisy. She just fell in the lava. What are you doing, Daisy? I'm dying apparently. Oh my god, the tree is going down, but I won. Yes, a mega gamer town. Fun. I need to make it up this ladder and lickety split. Okay, I'm up on this building, guys. I, I'm not the tallest. Oh, wait, was that a pumpkin patch down there? I love pumpkin patches! Oh, no, Daisy. Oh, no, Daisy, keep jumping. Ooh. My shoes have melted. Oh, I'm a god. Hey, you don't get to stand on my head. I don't think so. The floor is bacon. The bacon, bacon. How about I stand on your head, huh? How do you like that, huh? How do you like that? No, you don't like it, do you? Don't stand on my head, then. Oh, my god. We only have to survive, like, a few more seconds. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I'm swimming in the bacon grease. Guys, this game was hilarious and lots of fun. We hope you liked it. It was kind of silly and just a really fun little game to play. Summer vacation is almost over. Can you guys believe that? Crazy. Guys, Daisy died in the bacon, so I'm just going to do this. Oh, wait, there she is. I'm going to do it without her. Molly, no. Um, we've got to keep running or we're going to die. Oh, someone else got the bacon. This is a good time to say sayonara, guys. And I love you. You're the best fans in the world. Hey, guys, thanks so much for watching, and we'll see you next time. Bye. <laughs>
I can't believe I had to get this after school job. Oh, I wish someone else was hiring. Molly, come on. There's customers going by. Okay. I'm a hot, hot, hot dog. I've got mustard on my tummy. I'm a hot, hot, hot dog. Buy some hot dogs here. They're yummy. Oh, this is humiliating. I'm a hot, hot, hot dog. I've got mustard down my tummy. <laughs> Molly, this is your new job? <laughs> you look ridiculous. <laughs> Daisy, be quiet. Okay, it's, it's an honest living. Dress like a hot dog? <laughs> Who gave you this job anyway? Okay, the manager of the grocery store. Hot dogs are on sale this week, and they're trying to get rid of them. Oh, <laughs> that's a great job, Molly. How much does it pay you? Minimum wage, but, you know, that's enough. Now go away. I'm singing my song. I want to hear it one more time, Molly. <laughs> I'm a hot, hot, hot dog. I've got mustard down my tummy. I'm a hot, hot, hot dog. Buy some hot dogs here. They're yummy. <laughs> See you at home, Molly. See you at home. Ugh. This is not worth the money I'm getting paid. Oh, thank goodness my shift is over. Oh, look! Mom carved pumpkins! They're so adorable. Mom, I'm home! Hi, bye! Hi! You're a giant hot dog! I know. Totally. Sing her the song, Molly. She'll love it. No! I've been singing it all day. Oh, there you are. <laughs> you look adorable in your hot dog costume. Ugh. Oh. Yuck. Is that what you want to be for Halloween, Molly? My work costume? No. no. I love it. I want a hot dog for dinner. Ugh, all I smell is hot dogs after being at the grocery store all day. Yuck. Ah, well, girls, I have to work late tonight. I have to go back to the office, actually. I'm thinking about calling Grandma to be your babysitter. What? No, I'm too old for a babysitter. I don't know, Molly. You're sort of at the age where I think you might still need one. Well, I don't. Mom, I can babysit my sisters. Molly, you're not even that much older than me. What are you talking about? Yeah, but I'm responsible, Mom. Look, I've got a job and everything. Well, you do have a point, and I'll only be gone a couple of hours during your night routine. Do you think you can handle it, Molly? Absolutely! Would a hot dog lie? Oh, my God, I can't believe you're going to leave the hot dog in charge. <sighs> I wonder what's on TV. I get a bad dog to do TV. Um, you're not allowed to watch TV. You have to do your homework and your night routine, Molly. Uh, boring. I am going to do my homework. Well, good for you, but I'm not going to do my homework because I don't have to. Mom left you in charge because she thought you were responsible. <laughs> that was silly of her. Oh, look at that adorable dog. It looks like he just farted. Molly! Okay, well, that was perfect timing because I actually had to fart. Oh, hospital 911! Boing, 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 whee! Can I jump on the couch, Molly? Yeah, you can jump on the couch. Let me join you! Ha, 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 whee! OMG, I'm reporting you to Mom. Where's my cell phone? Don't you dare! I'm in charge here, and I say no calling Mom. Oh, my gosh, well, then I'm filming this. Put that away! You're being so rude and bossy. Duh, I'm your babysitter. Of course I'm going to boss you around, tell you what to do. Wee! This is fine! Now put that away. Fine, Molly. But I'm still doing my homework. This is a special night. It's called No Rules Night Routine. Wee! Okay, now where are all my snacks? Are you not going to make us real dinner, Molly? Yeah, I'm going to make you some real dinner. Here, I'll show you what real dinner looks like. Looks a lot like this! Mmm. <laughs> These Doritos are delicious. You're the worst babysitter ever. Mom shouldn't have trusted you with being in charge. Well, since you're not in charge, I'm telling you, be quiet. Woo! Wait, where's baby Kira? I can't cook it for Daniel. Great idea, baby Kira. I like the way you think. That's because she's one years old, Molly. And, and you're a lot like her. A baby. You're rude and bossy and annoying. Go to your room! What? Are you serious? Yeah, you're grounded. But, but, 
fine. I don't need to be around you brats anyway. Did she just call us brats? I know, right? Ugh. I ate too many sweets. I don't feel so good. Mmm. Wait a minute. I don't feel good, Marty. I don't puke. What? No, don't puke on the couch. Ugh. Uh. No, don't. Come on, let's go upstairs. You can lay down. Okay, my I go night night. Yeah, sure. You can take a bath first. Come on. All right, let's go in um to mom and dad's room and you can take a bath. I take bath in slime? Why not? I don't see why you couldn't take a bath in slime. <laughs> Be right back, baby Kira. Got to make sure the one that's being punished is actually listening. Go away, Molly. Go away. Okay, maybe I was a little harsh with you. I brought you some Doritos for dinner. I don't want Doritos for dinner. I want a salad with some salmon. Ew, that's so healthy. This is our no rules night routine. Do you think you could just let down your hair for once, Daisy? No, being in pigtails is what I love. No, it's a figure of speech. Can you just stop being so uptight? Me? Uptight? Are you serious? Yeah, you are uptight. Come on. I'm going to show you some things that I think will make you feel a lot better. You okay in there, baby Kira? Wait, I'm so confused. I went the wrong way. Oopsie. I must have eaten too many Doritos and they went to my head. <laughs> baby Kira, don't fall asleep in the slime! I died, I died, I died. Okay, put on some clean pajamas. Okay, Daisy, the thing you need to start with is jumping on the bed. That is totally against the rules. Who cares? Whee! And now we're going to get in the safe. We're not supposed to get in the safe, Molly. Totally going to, though. Holy guacamole! Look at all the money Mom and Dad have. OMG! Are you serious? Our no rules night routine just got a lot better. Baby Kira, come on! We're going to the ice cream store! <laughs> cash money, cash money. Molly, I don't think that's such a good idea. It's a perfect idea. Now everybody, come on. I'm in charge. What kind of ice cream are you guys going to get? Huh? 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 Molly, I still think this might be a bad idea. It's not our money and we're not supposed to be here. Oh, feel good. Ew, baby Kira, gross. And baby Kira has eaten enough sweets for one night. Come on, use better judgment, Molly. The best judgment is, now she has room in her stomach for more sweets. Ew, Molly, that's disgusting. Whatever, come on, let's go. Welcome to Brookhaven Ice Cream Shop. How can I help? <gasps> Molly, what What are you doing here? Mom, what What are you doing working here? Wait a minute. We're, you're supposed to be home doing your night routine. Where's the baby? I can't, Mama. Hi. Um, where did you get that money? She took it from the safe. She's the most babysitter level. Daisy, you're grounded. Not a chance, Molly. You're going down. She's been jumping on the couch, eating sweets, and charging me around for trying to do the right thing. Molly, I thought you were old enough to to handle this responsibility, but I guess not. Mom, why are you working here? <sighs> well, I was going to surprise you girls next week, but I've been picking up some hours here as a second job so I could take you to Disney. But the way you've been acting, Molly, you might have to stay home. Really? No, but you're definitely grounded when you are at home for at least, I don't know, a month. A month? Holy guacamole, Mom! But trick-or-treating, I'll miss it! Well, that's the way the ice cream melts, Molly. <laughs> that was a terrible joke, Daisy. It was terrible! Well, I thought it was funny. <laughs> to the dance with me. What? Uh, um, is that like a question or a demand? Um, I'm the coolest baby around, so you're going to the dance with me. Uh, uh, no. I've decided to go with someone else. What? You decided to go with someone else? Are you crazy? Um, okay, I'm gonna go now. Bye! Hey, Molly, have you heard the news? Have you heard the news? What news? Oh my gosh, boss baby, he asked your sister to the dance. What, he did? Yeah, except for things didn't go so well. What do you mean? Well, boss baby didn't really ask. He kind of just like demanded that she go to the dance. 
Oh, boy. I bet that didn't go over very well. I know how Daisy is, and no one demands that she does anything. Well, unless the teacher says do more homework, then she does it. Yeah, he's like, you're going to the dance with me. And she was like, uh, uh no. OMG, what happened next? Basically, Boss Baby went insane. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> no, I'm serious. He's down below this treehouse right now, like, running around trying to kill everybody. Holy guacamole! That's bad news! Really bad news! Daisy should have just gone to the dance with him. Um, yeah, no. I, 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 I think that um, that would be a bad idea since, you know, he's kind of psycho. Oh my gosh, I'm going down there to see what's going on. Oh my gosh, Boss Baby's crazy! She wouldn't go to the dance with me! Ah! Boss Baby! Boss Baby's gone crazy! Ah! Ah! Okay, I'm dead. This is bad. This is very bad. Oh, I'm dead too! Okay, I'm gonna go find my sister and find out what is going on here. Daisy? 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 Daisy, what are you doing? Oh my gosh, Molly, I'm hiding! Shh! Why are you hiding? Okay, it's a long story, but let me guess. Boss Baby asked you to the dance, and you said no. How did you know, Molly? <laughs> Everybody's talking about it. <laughs> Basically, everyone's gossiping about it. And they're saying that you turned Boss Baby insane. What? It wasn't my fault. It was like, you're going to the dance with me. And I was like, oh, really? I don't think so. Why don't you just go with him? Because, Molly, I want to go with somebody else. Who? 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 I'm not going to tell you because you always can't keep a secret and I don't want him to know. <laughs> I'm kind of embarrassed. Well, I think you should just go with Boss Baby so he stops being insane. No, not a chance. I'm not going with him. Okay, come with me right now, Daisy. Why, Molly? I want to show you something. What is it? See Boss Baby over there? He's got a knife. He's trying to kill everybody because you wouldn't go to the dance with him. Holy guacamole! Boss Baby! Wait a minute, I think that might be an impostor. That baby's head looks huge. Um, newsflash, Boss Baby has a giant head. Okay, well, um, he looks friendly enough. I'll go try talking to him, see if I can, you know, talk him, talk him down from being so crazy right now. Okay, good luck with that. Boss Baby, I knew I was- Ouch! Why are you smacking me with that? Ow! Uh -huh, how'd that go for you, Daisy? Pretty bad, actually, Molly. Yeah, he went insane because you won't go to the school dance with him. Oh, no, this is terrible. Now Luke would never ask me. Luke? You want to go to the school dance with Luke? Of course, Molly. That's why I said no to Boss Baby and because he's very bossy. OMG, I've got to tell Luke. I've got to tell Luke. You better not, Molly. You better not. <laughs> I'm going to tell him gonna tell him money seriously all we have to figure out right now is how to get out of this treehouse and get home so that we're all safe um i don't think that's gonna happen boss baby seems kind of crazy well molly um maybe we could buy granny's bat granny's bat what's that gonna do um well maybe we could knock him out long enough that basically uh we could get out of here okay well let me try it Ugh. Uh, uh. Wow, Granny's pat bat is pretty powerful, actually. Okay, let's go down here and see if it works. Okay, boss baby. You're about to get a taste of your own medicine. I was hiding under the stairs. Creepy. Take that! Take that! Take that! Take that! Oh, God, I still died. So that night, this Granny's bat was not worth 100 Robux. Okay. Oh, when I lost it? You die once and you and you lose it. <laughs> Luke, are you crying? Oh, I can't believe it. I was going to ask Daisy to the dance, but it seems like she's going to have to go with Boss Baby so he stops being insane. Luke, what are you talking about? Oh, I just really wanted to go to the dance with Daisy. Well, you're in luck because she really wanted to go to the dance with you. Wait, what? Really? Yep, she really did. Holy guacamole, that's amazing! Except for the fact that Boss Baby's gone insane, and she needs to go with him, so he stops being insane. Um, something tells me Boss Baby's gonna be insane anyway. You should go ask her. Really? Yeah, but I wouldn't say you're going to the dance with me! That doesn't go over so well. Okay, um, well, 
Here goes nothing. Wish me luck. Bye. Why are you following me? Because I want to see what happens, of course. <laughs> Daisy, where are you? I'm right here, Luke. Ah, I'm getting killed by boss, baby. I was wondering if, um, um. Yes, Luke, what is it? If you would like to go to the dance with me. <laughs> You're never going to the dance with her. <laughs> um, okay, so boss, baby, really doesn't want us to go to the dance together, Luke. Oh, uh, yeah, I, I, I kind of gathered that. OMG! Uh, guys, I think he might be coming out here, so you should probably be kind of careful. Uh, no, it actually looks like he's kind of stuck behind the stairs. He has a, a giant head, and it's stuck between two stairs. <laughs> Sorry about that, boss baby. Luke? Luke, he can't Luke! Oh, <laughs> now who will I go to the dance with? Okay, boss baby, I've had enough of you. This is ridiculous. Go ask someone else to the dance. I don't want to. I wanted to ask you to the dance. Uh-oh. Somebody changed his dirty diaper. <laughs> or maybe he needs a baba. Or maybe I just need to kill you all. <laughs> ah, boss baby just killed me. She should do her homework because she was going to end up with attention again. And she knew what she said. I'd rather eat this donut. <laughs> oh my gosh, Molly. That's so naughty. Okay, class. Okay, that's enough chitter chatter. Everyone, I'd like you to quiet down now. We're going to start class. Today, we are going to do a writing assignment. And I wrote it on the board. Today, we are writing a story about a scary thing that happened in our past. Whoa, is this English class or psychology class? Well, it, it's English, but I thought it would be an interesting thing for you guys to write about. I think that I've got something in mind. Uh, like, the only thing scary that ever happens to me is like, basically when I don't have enough Starbucks or I can't borrow my daddy's car and I have to take the school bus. That's like the worst, scariest thing to me ever. Well, thank you for sharing that, Sarah. Perhaps our new student would like to tell us a little bit about her scary story from her past. Yeah, Juniper, I'd love to hear one of your scary past stories. Um, okay, I don't know if I should tell this one though. It might make you guys like super afraid. Who, me? I don't get that afraid. That's not how I am. Yeah, we, Molly. One time you saw a snake crawling around in the grass and you about peed your pants. You were so scared. Okay, yeah, I don't like snakes very much, but besides that. Okay, well, I guess I, got, I can tell it to you. Okay, and also I want you guys to be writing this down too. Each of you has your own story and that's the assignment. But Juniper can tell us a little bit about hers before she writes it down. One of the reasons why my family moved us to Brookhaven was because my old school was completely insane. Insane? Why? What do you mean? Do they make you do lots of homework? You won't get any better here because... <laughs> Brookhaven High School makes you do tons of homework too. No, Molly. You see, my old school was like a nightmare. Did they take away pizza day? That is a nightmare. No, Molly. There was a girl there and all she wanted more than anything was to be a cheerleader. You see, her mom wanted her to be a cheerleader and she felt like she needed to be in order for her mom to love her. And she tried and tried and tried, but she still didn't get on to the cheerleading team. One day, the girl just disappeared. Nobody knew where. Whoa, that does sound scary. Why? I don't know what happened to her strange things started happening around the school. Whoa, this is starting to sound scary. What kind of strange things? Well, it started off with little silly things like someone's lunch would go missing and everyone just thought that someone else ate it. But then one day when I went into the bathroom and washed my hands, blood came out of the faucet. Blood? Holy guacamole! Whoa, that sounds like it's haunted! Pretty sure that that girl her name was Megan, who wanted to be a cheerleader, haunted the school forever. Kids started disappearing. Things got crazy. Oh, that sounds so scary. 
I heard about that school. It's only like 15 minutes from here and whatever. Did they shut it down? No, it's still running, but I heard rumors that they're going to try to shut it down. That's not scary at all. You know what? I dare you, Molly, to go over to that school and see what's going on. What? You can't dare me that. I just did. I dare you. Daisy, could you come with me? What? No way! That sounds crazy town. Come on, Daisy. After school. We'll go over there. We'll see what's happening. Ugh. How do you talk me into this stuff? I'm warning you guys. Don't do this. Megan, she's, she's evil. And she's taken over my old school. We've even named it Nightmare High School. Don't go there. Don't! Unless you want to lose a dare. Then, you know, definitely don't. <laughs> Whoa! There's still a lot of students that go here. Yeah, but we don't want to be here. It's so creepy. Yeah, you can say that again. Well, the first thing I have to do is go to the bathroom. <laughs> ah! What's that with the red eyes? Did anybody else see that? Yeah, there's blood that comes out of the faucets here. OMG. I feel like I should go to the bathroom uh -huh. really quickly. Molly, hurry up. I don't like the feeling of this at all. Um, well, we could just leave. But then we'd lose the dare from Sarah. Don't kill. Ah! Molly! There's something b b beside me! Oh, I saw that. Okay, I'm done going to the bathroom. Let's get out of here. Oh, wow. This place is definitely haunted. I just saw a ghost, Molly. Did you see that? I think I did see it. Let's go into this classroom and investigate. There has to be some clues. She said it was because she wanted to be a cheerleader. Don't get close to me. Go away. Ah! What's, what, what are you doing? I'm, I'm just, I'm spreading around these herbs because I think that they'll keep, keep the demon girl away. Um, well, unless it's skunk weed, so it stinks real bad, I'm not really sure anything's going to keep that crazy, crazy ghost away. This must be the nurse's station or something. There's cots in here to lay down on. Why is everybody acting like that? Because, Molly... Being about this ghost all the time is making people insane. Don't go up to the second floor. Maddie, it says don't go up there. Um, I just saw a ghost on the stairs. Did anybody else just see that? I did, Molly. It was so creepy. All right, well, now I'm going to go up to the second stairs, second floor. Megan? Megan, my name is Molly, and I want to talk to you. I know you wanted to be a cheerleader, but, but... Sometimes things don't work out like we hoped, okay? And... Wait, what's that? It's just me. I'm hiding. There's a ghost up here. It's gotta be Megan. Okay, um, well, uh, yeah, you probably shouldn't hide in the dark. That's where the... <laughs> that's where the ghosts like to be. Anyway, I'm trying to talk to Megan and just try to talk her out of being evil. Okay, now the door is locked. Molly, this is creepy! Molly! There's Megan! She, she locked you in ice! I can't move, Megan. You don't have to do this. Molly? Molly, run! I can't! She's after me! Oh my gosh, Megan! Quit being psycho! Just because you're not a cheerleader doesn't mean that you're... Okay, I just turned the light off. Oops. I thought it was going to make it brighter, but it didn't. Just because you're not a cheerleader doesn't mean you have to be evil. Molly... I think she's brought some friends. I see other evil ghosts here, too. Holy guacamole. All right, I'm going to go try to talk to her again. Megan, listen to me. Help! We're locked in this room! Okay, I've got to try to talk to her. Megan, I can see you. It's no use, Molly. She's just evil. When Juniper said that this school was, was haunted, she wasn't lying. And, Megan, she's just gone for good. No, I have to believe that there's some way we can help her. What's all this? It's just an old science lab, Molly. How can we get her to pay attention to what we're doing? Oh, look, I've got a cup of coffee. <laughs> that ought to help. Not! Why does it give me a cup of coffee? There's no clues, Molly. She's just evil. Whoa! Did you see that? She made lightning up here. Or maybe it's Echo's flashlight. I can't really tell. Hee <laughs> hee! Ooh, what's in here? Snacks? Ooh, I love some snacks. Molly, look at this! Maybe we can only talk to her and contact her if we do this. Okay, well, it looks like we need three people other than me. Now we have two. We need two more. And then maybe we could talk to Megan and she'll listen. Where do you think they are? Oh, look, they're in here. Molly? Daisy? Are you guys okay? Guys, what are you doing here? No, we're not okay. We need someone else to complete the seance. Okay, I'll sit down. 
Not me. That ghost is creepy. Okay, what should we say? Hey, turn off the flashlight! I don't know. Maybe bibbidi bobbidi boo 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 stop being scary? You know who? Molly, it's not working. I think Megan is just lost. Forever. Oh my gosh, guys. We've got to get out of here. And we've got to close down this school. This Megan person, she's she's an evil ghost. And she doesn't want this school to be open anymore. We have to get it closed. I couldn't agree more. This place is disgusting. I don't see her now. Maybe the seance worked. You said bibbidi bobbidi boo and like she went away? I think she did. I, I don't see her anywhere. Molly, it worked. You got rid of her. Yeah, I... Wait a minute. No, she's still here. Oh, well, I guess you're not magic then, Molly. I guess not. Megan, last attempt before we tear this school down and you're... Okay, she just froze me. Yeah, you're evil. We're tearing this school down and your soul's gonna be stuck here forever. Sorry. Uh, nice, Molly, nice. Now, everybody, let's get out of here before it's too late. Yeah, thank goodness that Juniper came to Brookhaven before Megan made her her next victim. Don't go upstairs. You'll regret it. I used to be a student here. She turned me into a ghost. And now I'm stuck here forever. Okay, getting out of here. Ah! Wow, it's so nice outside today. You can tell that spring is right around the corner. Wait, soccer ball, don't go over the edge. Oh, no. Wait, wait. Oh, my gosh. There goes another one of my soccer balls. Oh, man. Hey, Molly. Brookie, is that you? Holy guacamole. Look at your hair. I know, right? It's so different. I love it. Oh, whoa. It's awesome. You, like, straightened your hair, and you dyed it darker, and then you put red streaks in it. Holy cow, that's amazing. I love it. I love it. Oh, thanks, Molly. So, um, what are you doing? I'm playing with my soccer ball, but it accidentally rolled off into town. But that's okay, because I was thinking that maybe I could go to the salon and get crazy hair, too, because us besties, you know, we should, like, both have crazy hair together. Do you think my hair looks crazy? No, 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 not like crazy, like, woo, woo. Crazy, like, amazing. Like, you're so crazy, girl. You look amazing. Okay, I think I know what you mean, Molly. So, you want to have crazy, amazing hair, too? Yes, exactly. Let's go. Molly, wait a minute. What? What is it? Um, I think maybe you should ask your mom first. She's kind of strict, and I don't know if she's going to let you do your hair like that. Um, I, I don't think she'll mind. We should just go. Molly, you know that your mom will probably say no, but you should ask her because you don't want to get grounded for the rest of your life. Okay, fine. I'll go ask her. I'll wait right here, Molly. Hopefully she says yes. Yeah, I hope so. Hey, Molly, what kind of trouble are you getting into? What kind of trouble are you getting into? I'm not getting into any trouble. Mom, mom. Yes, Molly? Oh, I was just trying to think of what I was going to make for dinner tonight. Um, well, while you're thinking about that and not really paying attention, I have a question for you. No, Molly, you can't eat cheesecake for dinner. No, Mom, I was thinking, no, you can't eat a cupcake for dinner. No, 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 it's not about dinner. Um, Brookie dyed her hair like this dark color with red streaks in the front. What? Seriously? Her mom let her do that? Yeah, and it looks amazing. I was wondering, um... Can I take my allowance and um, dye my hair too? Um, no, Molly. I don't think so. What? Why not? Because, Molly, your hair is so beautiful the way it is. Besides, why do you want to dye it? Because I think it'll be really cool, Mom. And besides, look at your hair. I mean, your hair is like rainbow. I, I, I don't understand why I can't have rainbow hair. Well, Molly, I'm a grown-up, so I can do whatever I want with my hair. You're not a grown-up, so you have to do what I say. Mom, I'll do my homework every single night without complaining or detention for the entire month. Come on, Mom, that's a great bargain. Please, please, please! Ugh, you need to do your homework regardless, Molly, but the answer is still no. Maybe when you get a little older. Older? I practically have gray hair! Mom, I am so old. Ugh, so old. Look at these bones. They hardly walk anymore. The only thing that could help me be not so old is 
to get my hair dyed. Molly, quit being so ridiculous. You're not old at all. You're not even a grown up yet. And the answer is no. Mom, it's not fair. Why? Molly, I just think you have beautiful hair the way it is. Let's just leave it that way. Fine. Ugh, worst day ever. Hi, Molly. Are you having a great day? I am. Don't even talk to me right now, Daisy. Whoa, she's in a bad mood. Molly, um, how did... Uh-oh, it didn't go well, did it? Uh, uh, uh. Oh, Molly, I'm sorry. Y you can't get your hair dyed? Oh, no, 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 no. I'm gonna get my hair dyed, all right. She said yes, that's amazing. Come on, let's go to the salon. I can't wait. Oh, I'll race you there, Brookie. Oh, yeah, right. My bike is so much faster than yours, Molly. I don't think so. Looks like I'm beating you. Oh, whoa, we almost ran into each other. Whoa! Molly, what are you doing? Be careful. Ah, I forgot which way the salon was because I never go there. Hey, you're cheating by doing a shortcut through the park. Uh, yeah, I'm going to win. Duh. Brookie! What? You said it was a race. Oh, man, Molly, I totally won. Ugh, I need a faster bike. Well, you can't afford a new bike and your hair getting dyed, so what's it going to be? New hair! Hi there, sweetie pie. What can I do for you today? Um, I'm gonna have my hair dyed. Do you know what color, honey? Um, no, not really, but I'm gonna think about it while you're washing my hair, okay? Sounds good, sweetie pie. Is this the lady who did your hair? Yep, it sure is. Liz is the best hairdresser in all of Brookhaven. She's so fabulous. Look at her makeup and her hair. She's so amazing. So grown up. Yeah, I'm so grown up too. I can't even believe that I get to have the hair done. Yeah, and then maybe we could do your makeup too if you want. Uh, I don't know. I definitely want my hair done though. Mm -hmm. Okay, is this water too hot? Ow! Yeah, that was super hot. Holy guacamole. Oopsie, sorry. <laughs> Let's try that again. How's that? Too cold! Ah! Sorry. Okay, I think I have it just right this time. Okay, I hope so. Man. All right, you're all washed up. You can go get into the chair and we'll talk about what color you want your hair to be. So what are you thinking? I'm thinking about doing pink, something totally different that I would never do. Pink, really Molly? That's so like different than what you'd normally do. I know, right? But I think it could be amazing. It'll look amazing on you Molly, go for it. Thanks bestie. I just still can't believe your mom said yes. Um, yeah, well, uh, she did say yes, right, Molly? Um, there, I'm done. You look gorgeous, darling. Thank you. Molly, your mom did say yes, right? Well, not exactly, but once she sees how amazing my hair looks, she'll feel bad for not saying yes. Or she'll ground you for life. Let's make her hair blonde again. Oh, I'm sorry, but... I can't change her hair color twice in one day. It'll make her hair fall out. My hair fall out? Oh my gosh, no, I think that sounds like a bad idea. And besides, the pink looks amazing on me. Even Liz said I look gorgeous, darling. Well, I have to admit, Molly, it's very different. It's even more drastic than mine, I think. Come on, let's go back to my house and have a snack. Excuse me, are you going to pay for your pink hair? Oh yeah, sorry about that, Liz. <laughs> I gotta pay ya. How much was it? Three hundred dollars. Three hundred dollars? Um, uh... I'm really sorry, but I only have two hundred and fifty. Ugh, okay, well, I guess you're gonna have to sweep the floors then, because, uh, basically, you have to pay for it. Oh, Molly, you didn't see how much it was before you came in? No, now I have to sweep the floors to pay for it. Don't forget to get all the hair! Ew, gross, I gotta vacuum up air? That's disgusting. That's what it's like when you work in a salon. Do a really good job, please. You owe me $50. All right, fine. There, how's that? Well, it looks great, but next time try to come with all the money, okay? Sure, thanks, Liz. My hair looks fabulous. I know, darling, you look gorgeous. Molly, I'm really worried about what your mom is gonna say. It's gonna be fine. Now, come on, let's get out our bikes and go back to my house and get a snack. I'm starving. I'll beat you there. Molly, you never beat me there. Oh my gosh, she always thinks she's gonna beat me there. She never does. I'm going to this time, if I can make it up that giant hill, because the hill is huge. I should ride my bike more and get in better shape. <laughs> OMG! Beat you, Molly. 
What? Ah! Oh, you always beat me. That's so annoying. Come on, let's go get a snack. Hey, Daisy. Holy guacamole! What happened to your hair? Um, what happened to it is I look amazing. Oh, my gosh. Mom is going to ground you for the rest of your life, Molly. I don't think so when she sees how amazing my hair looks. Oh, boy. I don't know what to say to you, Molly, right now, except for good luck. Mom, I need a snack. Oh, hey, Molly! What did you do to your hair? Please tell me that's a Halloween wig. Please. No, it's my actual hair. Liz at the salon said I look gorgeous, darling. Molly, I told you you weren't allowed to dye your hair. Yes, but Mom, it looks fabulous, doesn't it? That's besides the point. You are grounded. What? No, Mom, I know that you would, you would said no, but look at my hair. It looks amazing. No, Molly, you went against what I said, and there's consequences for that. Consequences? You mean like having awesome hair? Oh, boy, this is going to be good. I got my popcorn for the show. Daisy, get out of here! I don't think so, Molly. <laughs> no, Molly, you're grounded for two weeks. You have to do extra chores to earn money to get your hair back to blonde. Two weeks? Okay, but I can still play Roblox, right? No. And your friend, Brookie, has to go home. You can't see her for two weeks. What? But mom! Molly, when I say no, I mean it. Now go to your room. Oh my gosh, this was a horrible idea. Uh, how'd it go, Molly? Daisy, leave me alone. Brookie, I'm sorry, but... I can't be your best friend for the next two weeks. What? Yeah, we can't see each other for two old weeks. I'm grounded and I have to go to my room. No, Molly. I'll write you letters. Yeah, I guess since I can't get on the computer, we could write snail, snail mail letters. Yeah, Molly. Good luck. Thank you. Oh, man, this day stinks. <laughs> Daisy, what do you think that our first day of kindergarten will be like? I don't know, Molly. I think it might be really fun, though. I hope so, because I like to do things like look at books, and I hope they teach me how to read. Yeah, they definitely will teach you how to read. I'm sure of it. Hey, look, there's my big girls. I can't believe it. Tomorrow's your first day of kindergarten. Oh, I feel a little happy and a little sad. Oh, you're not babies anymore. Why is mom crying? I don't know. She said she feels a little happy and a little sad. Probably because she won't see us all day. That's exactly right, Molly. Ah, but time to wipe my tears because I'm so excited for you girls. Are you girls excited? I am. I can learn how to read. Oh, you are going to learn how to read. Are you excited, Molly? I'm really excited because I get to eat school lunch and I heard her pizza is delicious. Of course you'd be most excited about school lunch. Okay, girls, well, I need you to hop into bed. It's getting late and you don't want to be tired on your first day of school. Good night, girls. I love you. I love you too, Mom. Love you, Mom. Wow, my first day of school. Can't even believe it. Night, Molly. Night, Daisy. Wake up! It's the first day of school! What? It's not even light time. It's not even light out yet. That's what I meant to say. Too tired, I can't even talk. Come on, girls! You have to wake up or you're gonna miss the bus. It's the first day of kindergarten! Oh, yeah! Today's our first day! Daisy, wake up! I'm already awake, Molly. Ow! Stop stepping on my toe! Sorry. <laughs> Just really excited. Okay, girls, come on, let's go have breakfast. The school bus will be here in 20 minutes. Oh, yeah, don't forget to put your school outfits on. Oh, boy, my new outfit. Okay, I'll put my school outfit on. Molly, we're big kids now. Yeah, totally, kindergarten. I like your outfit. I like your outfit. Come on, let's go have breakfast. I'm so excited for school. It's gonna be so much fun. Mom, I'm ready for kindergarten. Mom, look at me. Look at, look at, look at, look at. Oh, you look adorable. 
Okay, here. You know, just each take a banana because the school bus is pulling up right now. I want an apple. Okay, fine, whatever. <laughs> Have a good first day. I will. Wait, I don't see the school bus. Oh, wait. <gasps> ah, it's down the street. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. Daisy, hurry. Coming, bye. Good morning. Oh, you almost missed the bus. Yeah, I didn't miss it, though. I didn't miss it. Um, you can't ride up there, sweetie. <laughs> you have to ride inside the bus. Why are you dressed like that? Well, I was going to be a NASCAR star, but that didn't work out, so I'm just living my dreams as a school bus driver. All right, everybody. First day of school. Here we come. Molly, get up! Don't hit that snooze button! You're gonna miss the school bus! Don't care. Don't care! So tired. But maybe if you didn't stay up all night playing Roblox, you wouldn't have this problem. Ugh. Ugh, so tired. Can't get up. Can't wake up. Are you sleeping in your school clothes? Why did you do that? Because I don't want to take the time to actually get ready in the morning. That takes way too much time. Ew, Molly, gross! Daisy, what are you wearing? My Billy Eilish shirt and my Harry Potter inspired glasses. What are you wearing? Your braces? Yeah, but not by choice. Ugh, everyone in middle school is going to tease me when they see these. You mean call your metal mouth, brace face? Yeah, did you have to, like, bring that up, Daisy? Well, I'm just saying that's probably what they're going to call you. Thanks for making me feel better about it. I'm going back to bed. Molly, don't you dare! <sighs> Molly, are you just pretending to be asleep? No, not at all. Molly, you can't skip school just because you got braces! Oh, look, there's the school bus. There's no way I'm going to get down there in time now. Oh, looks like I missed school today. Oh, well. What am I going to do with my day today? Maybe I'll have some popcorn. Wait, I can't have that because I have braces. Maybe I'll have some, like, candy. Oh, wait, I can't have that because I have braces. Molly, what are you doing? Did, did you miss the school bus? Um, uh, the school bus missed me. <laughs> yeah, that's it. Well, good thing you got that new bike because you're going to do some pedaling. What? I have to ride my bike to school? Um, I can't go to school today. Yes, Molly, you're going to school. But it's the first day of middle school and I have these ugly braces. Why did I have to get them? Like, seriously. Because your teeth were crooked and you needed them. Consider yourself lucky. Braces are very expensive. And you're a lucky kid that you got them. Lucky? Look at my face! Ugh! Molly, don't worry. Lots of other kids will have braces. Now, get on your bike and get rolling. Oh, man. First day of middle school is going terribly. If A plus B equals C times D, then what will E equal? Oh, algebra. <sighs> you are so difficult. Excuse me, I'm here to be seated, please. Oh, sorry. Uh, I'm working here, and I'm also trying to get all my homework done. Wait, are you my old bus driver? Oh, yeah, how are you? I'm doing good. Here, come right over here. You can sit in this last booth if you want. Sounds good. You still think you're going to be a NASCAR star? <laughs> I sure do. Never give up on your dreams. Never, ever, Molly. I don't plan on it. <laughs> Um, okay, so what do you be having? Um, I'll have a cheeseburger, some french fries, and a chocolate milkshake. Okay, would you like whipped cream on your chocolate milkshake? Absolutely. <laughs> Who doesn't? You'd be surprised. Some people want raisins on their milkshake. Ew. Okay, um, so I just gotta make this food, and I've gotta finish up my algebra. So I'll do the algebra first. Okay, so when I do this, this equation... Hello? Is anyone going to bring me my food? Oh, no. I forgot about her food. Okay, I just got to prepare it really fast. Never mind. I'll just go to Starbucks. Ugh, terrible customer service. Sorry, I'm trying to juggle it all. Oh, man. My boss is going to want to fire me now. And I really need this job because I have to save up for college. Ugh, good thing the diner is about to close. Ugh, so tired. So tired. 
I wish I could go back to, to middle school or even elementary school where I didn't have so much homework and so much work. Oh. 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 oh, hey Marley, how was work? Oh, so bad. And I didn't get all my algebra work done. You know, Marley, if you had paid attention in elementary and middle and most of high school, you would have got scholarships like me. Then you wouldn't have to pay for college. Whatever. This is how I did it. No, 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 I have to just live with it now. Oh, I have to go to bed. I'm so exhausted. Marley, aren't you going to take your uniform off? No, not even. Not even. Oh. It is not morning yet. It is not morning alarm clock. Oh, I can't do this another day. This is too much pressure. I hate adulting. Oh, I'm going to go back to being in kindergarten. I'm going back. I'm going back. Good morning, Molly! <laughs> Whoa, someone woke up on the wrong side of the bed. Whoa, Molly! Ew, what's that smell? It's Molly! She didn't take a bath after she came home from the dino. Then she wore that as pajamas. Ew, Molly! Ah, no one talk to me! Oh, look, the bus is here. Have a good day, to girls! I am never gonna have a good day ever again! Oh, that's a bit dramatic, Molly. You know, Molly, all you have to do is turn that frown upside down. Daisy, don't mess with me. Don't mess with me! Oh, here's NASCAR driver. Good morning! Oh, you're the one that gave me terrible service at the diner last night. Sorry, I tried my best. Ugh, I have the most stressful high school life ever. Don't listen to her. She's a total grump monster. What? I got detention. Are you serious? Um, yeah, I'm used to getting detention, but pretty sure that Daisy's never gotten it before. Huh. Detention rules. I will not annoy Mr. Pickle. <laughs> Mr. Pickle. I will not try to escape from detention. Yeah, right. And I will not set off stink bombs in the classroom. Uh, ew, Molly, he said no stink bombs. Um, yeah, I couldn't help it, though. I had to fart. <laughs> oh, whoa, I'm going to use this chair, and I'm going to escape. But rule number two is, is we're not allowed. I don't care what number two is. I need to get out of here. Look at this insane obby. Whoa, you can buy, like, crazy things in here. Like, what's this? Speed boots. Or... What's this one? Ultimate bundle. Dun, dun, dun. Don't buy those, Molly. It's cheating. It's not cheating if you buy them. I mean, the game developer put them in here so we could buy them if we wanted to. But it would be stealing if you took them without paying for them. <laughs> yeah, but it's also cheating because it gives you an advantage. Which, Molly, if we're being honest, you need. Whatever! I have my unicorn. That's all I need. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Wait, where do I go now? Um, I'm confused. Marty, push the button. Okay, I pushed it. It's not working. I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do! Uh, follow me, Marty. Good grief. Whoa! <laughs> okay, I see what I'm supposed to do now. Well, sometimes those burn you, so how am I supposed to know if they're, like, good or bad? True, Marty, that is true. Sometimes the steam, like melts you and then other times it's just regular ale and it makes you go high up in the sky yeah exactly okay push the elevator i'm gonna go up you're so lazy molly go push it yourself <laughs> okay i'm gonna push this and the elevator is gonna take me up in the air yes i haven't died not even once i'm so proud of myself right now well, Molly, that's not saying much because normally you die about 6,000 times. <laughs> when it comes to Abby's, I really do die. Like, a ton! Woo, what's in here? Snacks? No, Molly, not snacks. But look, we have to rearrange stuff in here, I think. Uh, okay, respawn button. We have to put this here. Ooh, I think, I think it's, like, way high up. And you've got to, you've got to use these things to, um, 
to stack to be able to leave. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Come on, Molly, you got it. Whoa, you're really smart today. I think so. Um, Daisy, are we supposed to go down there? Um, well, um, yes, I think so. Whoa. I've never been in um, events like this before. It's kind of crazy, like going downhill and stuff. Maybe that means we can leave. I'm sick of being in this school. Yeah, tell me about it. Detention is the pits. Okay, can't go that way. Can't go that way. Wait, did you just go through that vent, Daisy? Okay, I'm not sure if Daisy went through here or not, but I, I can't, so... Uh, maybe I'm too chubby because I ate too many cupcakes, but I literally do not know how to get out of here now. Help! I'm stuck! Wait, maybe I forgot to pick something up. I feel like maybe I forgot to pick up something I needed because now I literally cannot get out of here. Somebody help me! Molly just walked straight ahead! Jeepers. Oh, wait, there's a hole here. Whoa! See, Molly? Now we're back in the school. Well, we didn't want to be back in here. We wanted to escape. It's okay, Molly. I know we're going to actually escape. Oh, look. We're outside the classroom now. There's Mr. Pickle. And he's sleeping with his eye open. No, 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 no. Looked like his eyes were open, but nope. They're closed. I was going to say, whoa, he's super creepy if he sleeps with his eyes open. <laughs> what? Oh, my God. Did he catch me? Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Ah, Mr. Pickle, no. Please. I don't want to go back to detention. Please, please, please. Wait, did I, did I go all the way back to detention? Thank goodness. I thought I had to go back to Mr. Pickle's detention. I was going to cry. I need to move super fast so he doesn't get me again. Because, uh-oh, there's security cameras in here. I don't know where my sister went. She took off. Left me here. Oh, my God. There's the outside. Ah, and there's Mr. Pickle. <laughs> Mr. Pickle, I really didn't deserve detention this time. <laughs> Um, I don't think that was the, um, way humans talk to each other, but, you know, I could be wrong. Ah! Mr. Pickle! <laughs> Alright, guys, I, may, I might need Power of the Unicorn. Say it with me. Power of the Unicorn with a sparkly horn. Alright, now where is the key to get out of this place? I obviously need a key. I have no idea where to, Oh my god, I never mind, I found it. Power of the Unicorn worked. Now, somehow I have to get away from Mr. Pickle. Which, I don't see him, which tells me he's probably right behind me. <laughs> yep, I can hear him. Is that your stomach or are you talking? <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for waiting for me, Daisy. Oh, look, Mr. Pickle's like right outside the door. <laughs> see ya, Mr. Pickle. See ya, Mr. Pickle. Come on, Marty. Quit trying to da be so teasing and taunting to Mr. Pickle. We've got to get out of here before he figures out how to get into the door. Whoa! Oh my gosh, I thought I was going to fall to my death right there. Holy guacamole, I don't like this, Daisy! I don't like it! No, oh, You made it, Molly. Look, this is just like gymnastics. Yeah, only look at where you go down and die if you fall. That, that, that's not like gymnastics. I can't even talk right now because I'm so nervous about how I'm going to die. You're not going to die, Molly. You haven't even died once. You're doing amazing. Yeah, she's got a point there. Um, Where do we go now? I'm confused. Wait, did I just go in a big circle? Go up, Molly. Go up. Oh, yeah, go up. <laughs> I knew that. Oh, this is like boxing class. Uh-oh. Whoa. Okay, gotta wait. Gotta be patient. If you're not patient, it gets you. A zip line? What? <laughs> I kind of just pushed Daisy down. That was kind of funny. Whee! <laughs> Whoa, uh-oh. I jumped too soon. Ah! Okay, I, 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 I ruined the record, Daisy. I died. It's okay, Molly. It's okay. Try not to jump too soon, Molly. Oh, there. That's better. Now where do I go? Oh, no. Not another springboard. I'm kind of nervous about this. Wow, we didn't make it. No. Oh, boy. Ow. <laughs> ow, 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 ow. Whee. Oh, I see. If you run and jump, that's the best way to get across it. Whee. Whee. <laughs> Made it. I only died twice. Oops. Oh, boy. We're never getting out of here. Of course we will, Daisy. Don't say that. 
All right, is this supposed to be a basketball or a giant orange? What is this? I'm not really sure, but um, we need it apparently. Score a goal. Oh, it's supposed to be basketball. Okay. Okay, I'm gonna be here a minute because I'm not really sportsy when it comes to basketball. Oh boy. Wait, is there a special sp place you can like stand to make a goal? Yes, finally! <laughs> Oh boy, Mr. Pickles, <laughs> Mr. Pickles after us again! <laughs> oh, Mr. Pickle, you don't have to get me, seriously! Oh god, oh god, here he's coming! He's coming, he's coming, he's coming! Ah! <laughs> I can't even talk right now, I'm like so scared that I'm gonna end up back in detention. I'm gonna go in the bathroom and hide. That sounds like a good idea, right? Oh my god, Mr. Pickle's right behind me! Wait, did he get me? I think Mr. Pickle got me. I didn't get into the bathroom stall fast enough. Where is he? Okay, I'm gonna wait till he's down to the end of the hall. And then I'm gonna make him run for it. Make a run for it. Gotta make a run, run, run for it. Um, so, okay, the door is open to the bathroom. Uh, now I just need to go into the stall. Oh God, oh God, oh God, oh God. <laughs> hey, how'd you get me in the bathroom? Mr. Pickle. <laughs> Good thing I wasn't farting in here or something. You'd be really sorry then, wouldn't you? Okay, not this time, Mr. Pickle. Not this time! Molly, use the center stall. There's a vent to get out of it. Oh, there's Stacy. Why didn't I see her before? Because you were too scared about Mr. Pickle, probably. You're probably right. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Ah! Ah! No! Oh god, oh god, I got it. <laughs> oh, I made it! Ha 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 ha! Ha Mr. Pickle, ha ha ha! Oh boy, that was a close one, Molly. Yeah, tell me about it. Good thing this event, this vet was here. Now what? Now we have to make another basket, Molly. These are weird basketballs. Literally, they look like oranges. Okay. Um, I have to try to hit that target. Bazinga! Don't tell me I hit it before you. Yes, Molly. Yes, yes, you totally did. <laughs> I beat my sister. Nee, 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 nee. Wee! Oh, God. I just lost my head. What? Why? Um, because there's like a laser in here um, when you get to the top. And oopsie, I accidentally ran into it. All right, I got to stay over to this side. And then immediately over to this side. And then, wait, 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 wait. Where? Oh, God, oh, God, oh, God, no! Oh, man. All right, I'm gonna check it out again. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, um, whoa. Whoa, whoa, what's happening? <laughs> oh God, I'm stuck. I'm stuck. <laughs> okay, I have to go out of first person, because that's, oh boy. <laughs> yeah, that's not good. That's not good. Okay, let's see if I can fix myself. Nope, um, I'm, ah, I'm stuck in the ceiling. Daisy, <laughs> help me. All right, guys, let's try this again. I'm trying not to die. Uh, no promises, though. Okay, if I go this way, maybe I can survive this. So far, so good! Wait, what? Oh, maybe you have to go right up in the middle. Holy guacamole, this is much harder than I thought. Okay, over here. Then over here. Whoa. Then in the middle. Right? Oh, man, I got fried! Again! I know I can do this. I know I can. Wait a minute. Okay, I've got a good view now. So, I hope I can make it. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay, then over this way. Then, Daisy, there you are! Oh boy, Molly, you really, really had a hard time with this part. But you finally made it. Now that I'm 80 years old. Oh yeah, ha ha, Daisy. Ha ha. Whee! <laughs> I feel like we've spent so much time in vents in this game. Tell me about it. Whoa! One more cupcake. I want a cupcake so bad. Cupcakes. Cupcakes. Molly, be quiet. You're making me hungry. And we don't want Mr. Pickle to heal us. Whoa, did we go into the cafeteria? Because that would be like the best thing ever. Oh, we did. It's like the universe heard me. Uh, Molly, I think that's a power up juice. So be careful. It's going to make you run super fast. Holy guacamole. Whoa. Oh my gosh. Whoa. 
<laughs> this is even better than a cupcake! Whoa! Whee! <laughs> Guys, if you haven't played this game yet, I would highly recommend it. It's really fun! Whoa, Daisy, you're like so far ahead of me. I can run faster than you, Molly. No, you can't, Daisy. Root. Whoa! Oh, no, no, no! Oh! Now I have to do it all over again? Seriously? Okay, here we go. Running super fast, gonna get out of detention. Hey, 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 what's new? Why are you waiting here, Daisy? Because I felt sorry for you that you were so far behind, Molly. Okay, if you say so. I'm not behind, you're behind! <laughs> Whee! Okay, this one's very hard. That's where I keep messing up. Yes! Ha <laughs> I did it! Um, Mr. Pickle, why is why is he on a go-kart? You have to race him, Molly. Go for it. Um Are we going now? Uh-oh, 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 whoa! Wait a minute, Mr. Pickle! Molly, you can't be second behind Mr. Pickle! Look at him, he's so chubby. How'd you get behind him? Oh, we got a speed boost. Rude, Mr. Pickle. <laughs> Okay, that's just weird. Get out of here, Mr. Pickle! I'm gonna try to shove him off the road. Ooh, a speed boost. Uh-oh, he's got one too. Whoa! Get out of here, Mr. Pickle! Whoa! How do you get that speed boost? You didn't even go over it. That's just rude. I'm gonna get him, Molly! Daisy! <laughs> it looks like Daisy's on some sort of weird boots or something. Whoa! Oh, no, my head went flying off. Uh-oh. Okay, Mr. Pickle wants to race me again. Do I get to get out of school if I win? Vroom, vroom, vroom. Here we go. He always gets in first. I don't get it. It's kind of rude if you ask me. Whoa, speed boost. Speed boost, Mr. Pickle. I want to beat you so bad, Mr. Pickle. Because you're rude for giving me detention. Whoa! Ah! Mr. Pickle ran into me and threw me off the edge! Mr. Pickle is evil. I'm just going to say it. Okay, I can do this. I know I can. I, I just... I want to win really bad. Yeah, okay. If you say so, Mr. Pickle. But you're not going to beat me. See, I just beat you. Get out of here. You smell like, you smell like a fart. La, 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 la. Yeah, yeah, how'd you like that? It was a nice compliment, wasn't it? <laughs> Speed boost! I think I might have tossed Mr. Pickle over the edge. I'm not really sure, I haven't heard from him and I don't see him. Oh yeah. Okay, this part is like really hard and I don't, I don't know if I'm gonna make it guys, but I hope that I do. I really hope so. Whoa! <laughs> I made it! I made it! Na, 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 na. Winners! Oh yeah! Congratulations, Molly! You beat Mr. Pickle! Wow, longest hobby ever, right? I know, but I like when they're long because then it just it's like they're really super challenging. Well, this one's definitely a challenge. At certain points, like some points it seems pretty easy, and then at other points it's like whoa. Wait, what? What is this? Does it look like Mr. Pickle is going to shoot stuff at us? It sort of does, Molly. Uh-oh. Okay, um, my pea shooter against the Lernatron. Yeah, right. Whoa. Whoa! <laughs> okay, I can't even see myself right now. I'm going to zoom out so I can see what I'm doing. He's after me, Daisy. He's after me. Molly, he's going to kill you, cheapos. Die, Mr. Pickle! I'm not going to learn your your stuff. Ew, I'm shooting like spit wads at him. That's disgusting. Take that, Mr. Pickle! Oh my gosh, he's up. he's got me like trapped in a corner. Daisy! Molly, get way far back! You can do this, Molly! Is he shooting books at me? He is. <laughs> That's funny. Okay, Daisy, you shoot him. Well, I distract him. 
No, I think we each have to take him down ourselves. Oh, man. Oh, God. He shot a book at my head and I died. Where's my pea shooter? I guess I don't get it until I go forward. O-M-G. My sister got out of school. Molly, watch out! He's after you! I hadn't noticed, Daisy. Ah, I was stuck inside his stomach. Molly, hurry! The school bus is going to leave without you. Well, I can certainly walk home. I just, I don't want to be stuck with Mr. Pickle anymore. Molly, I think it's safe to say he was stuck in detention forever. Wait, what? He's going to keep winning, Molly. He's very strong. No, he's not going to beat me. I will just keep trying in, until my very last breath. Well, your last breath isn't going to be too long from now, Molly. Turn around and shoot him. Oh, man. My sister's stuck in attention forever. What? No! Daisy, let me out! I can't, Molly. School bus is leaving. See you! Daisy! <laughs> Wow, that was a great movie. But uh, I'm getting kind of tired. I have work in the morning. Oh, Dad, you're so old. You have to go to bed at like 9.30. Um, no, I have to go to bed because I have a job and be responsible. Nah, you're also old. You're so old, you're like practically a zombie. Seriously? You think I'm that old? Uh, yeah. Are you getting cravings for brains, Dad? Okay, I'm going to bed. Good night, everybody. Good night, Dad. Well, I'm going to watch another movie. Sounds fun to me. Well, I'm going to bed as soon as I finish my apple. What's up with all these old people going to bed early? Well, Molly, I guess we're just zombies. We need our rest. And some brains. Brains. You can't eat mine, Mom. You can't eat mine. Molly, shh. I'm trying to watch the end of the movie. Daisy, we just started this movie. No, I turned it to family life. I never did get to see the end of this. Daisy, turn it back to Survivor. I want to watch that movie. It just started. Molly, I'm watching the end of this. I missed it the other day because I fell asleep. Oh, fine. It's only on for another 15 minutes. How much longer is this? Molly, it's, it's only a few minutes more. Oh, okay. Daisy, how much longer is this movie? Molly, I told you it's just a few minutes more. This is really starting to annoy me. Daisy, I'm hungry for brains. I got so bored, my brain turned into a zombie. Molly, quit being ridiculous. Okay, can I watch my movie now? I'm really sick of watching this. Yep, it's all over, but you should probably go to bed. It's after 10 o'clock, and you won't want to get up for school in the morning. Nonsense. Only babies and super old people go to bed this early. I'm going to stay up and watch my movie, even though I missed the first 15 minutes of it because of you. Whatever, Molly. Good night. Good night. Oh, whoa, it's midnight. Um, I better get to bed. Molly, Molly, it's time for school. Molly, wake up. Huh, what? Oh, yeah. Totally awake, Mom, totally. Molly, you have to open your eyes. You don't look awake. Okay, I'll open them. See? I'm, I'm, I've got an eye open. I'm, I'm awake. Only one eye, Molly? What about the other one? The other eye is still asleep, Mom. But don't worry, I'm, I'm, I'm awake. Okay, Molly. <laughs> Come down for breakfast. You don't want to be late. Okay, Mom. Sure thing. Oh, she's gone. <laughs> Molly, you told me you were awake. You fell back asleep. Oh, what? No, no, I didn't. Uh, I'm totally awake. Molly, get out of bed. You're going to miss breakfast and you're going to miss the bus. Too late. You've already missed breakfast. Just get dressed so you can go down the bus. 
And let me actually see you getting up. Uh, okay. Okay. Uh, head over to the dresser, Molly, and get dressed. Okay, Mom. Oh, she's gone. Good. Back to bed I go. Okay, that's it. I've had it. Ah! Mom, what are you doing? Ah, that's freezing! Now are you awake? Yes! I'm definitely awake! Good! Now you can get ready for school. The bus is gonna be here in five minutes, Molly. Ah, bus, schmush, Molly. Okay, fine. <laughs> OMG! <laughs> I love this Star Squad video! <laughs> it's awesome. Well, Molly, I'm going to bed. Don't stay up late tonight. You didn't want to get out of bed this morning for school. Okay, Mom, I won't stay up late. Okay, see you in the morning. Bye, Mom. Good night. Oh, man. Oh, I love the Star Squad videos. Molly, why aren't you doing your night routine? It's already almost 9.30. Who are you, Mom? No, I'm your sister, and I'm the one that tells you that you should go to bed because you don't want to get up for school in the morning. Yeah, like I said, you're trying to pretend that you're my mom. And guess what? You're not. You're just like the same age as me, and you're my sister, and you can't boss me around. Okay, fine. Have it your way. you got to get grounded when you don't get up in the morning. Yeah, right. Oh, my gosh. Look at this YouTube video. <laughs> it's awesome. Must watch more Star Squad. Wait a minute. Is it 3 a.m.? Holy guacamole! I need to get to bed. Ugh. I have to wake up in three hours. Ugh. I'm so tired. But watching all those videos was so worth it. My alarm went off, and I've been awake. I already worked out. I already brushed my teeth. Congratulations. You're the winning daughter of them all. But this daughter is sleeping still. Molly, if you don't get up, I'm telling Mom. And you're going to get grounded for the rest of your life. Oh, okay, Daisy. How late did you stay up last night, Molly? I don't want to talk about it. Tell me, Molly. 3 a.m. Molly! Oh my gosh, who stays up till 3 a.m.? What are you, crazy? Ah, uh, yeah, I think a little bit. Ow, I ran into the table. Molly, open your eyes. I can't, they're glued shut. Really, Molly? Seriously? Yeah, that's what happens when you don't get enough sleep. Oh, now how do I get to the bathroom? Oh yeah, here we go. Well, look who's, well, you're not wide awake, but you're at least out of bed. Congratulations, Molly, I'm so excited. Uh -huh, whatever you say. I'm excited because you're acting like a good kid and doing what you're supposed to. Sure am, Mom. Sure am. Okay, we're going to go back to sleep. This seems like a good spot. Is that water right here running? What could that be from? Oh, someone must have left the bathtub on. Molly, are you sleeping in the bathtub? Huh, what? No, no, I'm taking a bath, getting ready. Molly, you came in here just to trick me and sleep in the bathtub. Now, if you're late from school, for school today, you're going to be grounded for a week. Oh, no, I'm awake, I'm awake. Get ready for school. Hurry. So tired. So tired. Ugh. Why am I at school and not home in bed? Wait a minute. Maybe I could just pretend I was home and skip out on class and take a nap. Good morning, Daisy. Good morning, Mrs. Lynn. I'm so ready to learn all the things in English today. That's great. Well, where's your sister Molly? Did she stay homesick or did she just skip school? Uh, no, she came to school today. She should be here. Hmm, that's strange. Class started five minutes ago. What do you suppose she is? I have no idea, but you might want to go look for her. Hmm, maybe she has a tummy ache and she went into the bathroom. Molly, are you in here? What's that sound? Is that 
Molly sleeping on the bathroom floor? Molly, wake up! Huh? What? What's happening? What's happening is you have detention. Oh, man! Okay, class. Last night I graded your math papers, and I have to say that they weren't very good. What? I studied for like a week for that math test. Well, I'm sorry, Daisy, but you only got a B. A B? Oh, my God, my life is over. A B? That's pretty good. I'd call that passing. Molly, you don't understand. <laughs> Daisy, are you okay? Daisy, call 911. I'm fine, Molly. I just never want to come out from under this desk. It's so humiliating. OMG, she just looks so dramatic, Mrs. Smith. Oh, I don't even want to be in this class anymore. Sarah, try to behave, okay? All of you try to behave. Look, I hate to have to give you a mountain of homework, but since you all didn't do very good on the math test, I'm going to have to. What? More homework? All we do is homework and test. Tests and homework, then some reviews, then more homework, then more tests. Molly, that's how we get smart. I don't want to be smart if I have to do this much homework. Molly, you don't mean that. Yeah, Molly, you don't mean that. Well, do you have any homework? Um, well, not exactly. Well, then why should I have to do all the homework? You're a grown-up. Seems like you should have to do more homework than me. I'm just a kid. I should be able to run around and swim in the pool and live life while I'm still young. You're old. I mean, your time's almost up. Molly! Molly, that's kind of rude. You don't want detention, do you? No, Mrs. Smith. Sorry. <sighs> Can I go to the bathroom? My stomach kind of hurts. Sure, Molly, but hurry back. We're going to review these tests, and they're not very good. Okay, fine. I'll be back in a few minutes. Ah, freedom. Feel like I can breathe again. Ew, change my mind. Oh, it smells like sticky poo poo in here. Oh, I can't breathe at all. Oh, well, I guess it's better than being in the classroom. I'm just going to sit here and relax for a few minutes. Ah, this is the life. Well, it's not really the life. <laughs> I sort of made that sound like I was sitting on the beach, relaxing my life away. Now I'm actually hiding in the girls' bathroom, so I don't have to go back to math class, but, you know, whatever. Okay, let's see. Let me take out my tablet and, and see what I can find. What? There's a new spell out in my spell book? Amazing! What is it? A life swapper? OMG! I could swap lives with anybody! Who would I swap lives with? Daisy? Pfft, nah! Her life's boring! All she does is homework, homework, homework. Hmm, what else? Sarah? Nah, Sarah's a bully and rude. Nobody would like me if I was Sarah. Jiminy Cricket, I have a good idea! I could swap lives with my teacher! <laughs> then she'd have to do all the homework, and I could party! Woohoo! That's a great idea. Okay, what's it say the spell is? Alakazam? Alakazoo? Oh, I better not read the, le the rest of it. I don't want to switch lives with, like, the toilet or something. <laughs> Switching lives with a school toilet would be the worst life ever. Okay, time to switch lives with my teacher. Oh, nice of you to join us again, Molly. Wait, why do you have your tablet out in school? You're not supposed to have that out in school. I just have to say something to you, Mrs. Smith. Alakazam! Alakazoo! I'm gonna trade lives with you! Uh-oh, this is gonna be bad. What? What? What's going on? Why am I out of my seat? I don't want to get in trouble. Ugh, I don't want to get another detention. <laughs> Looks like the spell worked. Molly, wh what's going on? Why, wh why is the teacher a student and the student a teacher? My spell worked perfectly. Wait, I must have got bunked in the head when you did that spell. I don't remember you doing it. Nah, that's probably just part of the spell. Okay, class, time to get doing all your homework. Uh, excuse me, we're not even at home yet. Okay, well, you're at school then. Do some schoolwork. Uh, yeah, this teacher is, like, so lame. She's boring. Hey, you could call me Miss Molly, and I'm not boring. Wow, I feel like a giant. Look how tall I am. Sarah, you're very short. Ah, uh, rude. Why are you calling me short? That's just so mean. 
Sorry, I just, I just feel like you're so much shorter than me now. <laughs> you're like so tiny, like a little tiny baby. Go away. You're such a rude teacher. Hey, don't talk to your teacher that way. You'll get detention. Do you want detention, Sarah? Uh, no, not really, Miss Molly. <laughs> I can give Sarah detention. This is the best day ever. Well, I've decided you're going to have detention. What? What did I do? You're just rude in general. So, uh, stay after school. OMG, I have cheerleader practice after school. I don't care, Sarah. You're going to be here for detention. OMG, this is terrible. I didn't even do anything wrong. Um, Miss Molly, Miss Molly, Miss Molly, Miss Molly, Miss Molly. Uh, yeah, what is it? Um, I was wondering, can, can we go to lunch now? I'm starving. I guess, but don't be annoying or I'll have to give you detention. Wow, Marley, I can't believe you're the teacher. Do you even know enough to teach us anything? I know enough to teach you to shh, or you're going to have detention. Molly, t quit telling me to shh, be quiet, or detention. Molly, that's rude. Shh, quiet, or detention. Whatever, I'm going to lunch. Sarah, are you going to lunch? I don't know. I'm just so upset about my cheerleading practice. I can't even go. Well, that's what you get for being rude. Detention. Whoa, my stomach's growling. I've got to go to the lunchroom, too. I hope we're having pizza today. I'm so, so hungry for pizza. OMG, I love this song. I love sitting on the table eating pizza. Ah, bad students. Well, at least Daisy's acting the way she's supposed to. Of course I am. I don't want detention. Hey, you two get down from there right now or you're going to have detention. I don't care. You already gave me detention. Well, you're going to have a whole week's worth. Do you want that? Watch this dance move, Miss Molly. <laughs> Whoa, I'm gonna dance. Uh, no. You're not gonna sing either. <gasps> Stop stepping on the pizza. Oh, my God. You ruined the pizza. What a horrible day. Huh, maybe I shouldn't have been a teacher. This seems kind of crazy. Okay, sit down and... All right. Now, now, Mrs. Smith. Why are you calling me Mrs. Smith? My name is Hannah. Okay, Hannah, sit on the chair. You, you can't... You can't sit on top of the table. That's against the rules. Do you want detention? Um, not really. But I guess if it means that I can sit wherever I want, then maybe. No! You don't get to be a rebel whenever you want. Maddie, you were always a rebel. Daisy! Shh! Don't say that. Okay, fine. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and buy an ice cream. Buy it? But you're... What are you doing? Well, there's no lunch lady today, so I'm just giving myself an ice cream credit. You can't steal an ice cream. I'm not. I'm just giving myself credit for five of them until tomorrow. Daisy, you can't eat five ice creams. You'll get sick and throw up in the girls' bathroom. You're not my mom. No, but I'm your teacher. Now, give me the money for the ice cream, and I'll give it to the lunch lady. Okay, fine. Here you go. Very good. Okay, I'll just put it in the cash register. And done. Okay, lunch is dismissed. Sarah! Oh my gosh, that's it. You got two nights detention. Okay, well, as long as I have detention, watch this awesome cheerleading dance move. What? I'm amazing. Oh my gosh. The bell rang. Everybody back to class. Oh, being a teacher is harder than I thought. I will behave in school. Okay. Guys, new rule. It's on the board. Daisy, you can't bring your ice cream to class. I didn't finish it, Molly, and it's so delicious. I will behave in school? Pfft, what is this, English? I thought we were in math class. There was a math problems. Well, first of all, you need to learn basic, basic behavior in school. That's why I'm saying you will write a hundred times, I will behave in school. Two plus two equals poo! What? <laughs> Sarah! Oh my gosh, three nights detention! And I gotta erase this. I will not write poo on the board. <laughs> Sarah, write this a hundred times. <laughs> I will not write poo on the board. <laughs> oh my gosh, that's funny. I'm on the teacher's desk. I'm on the teacher's desk. Hannah, detention. Okay, everybody, class is dismissed. Go home, unless you have detention. I'm the only one that didn't get detention. Well, aren't you so special? Go home! Molly, I'll see you there. 
Oh, I'm so tired after this long day. Get out of my classroom. Get out, get out, get out, get out. Okay, Hannah, sit at your desk, please. Unless you like, would like a week's worth of detention. Well, you're a teacher and you can't even talk. You're like, whoa, 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 like a baby. Hannah, rude. Okay, let's go over some simple uh, math right now, okay? Ten um, times, oh wait, times three equals. Where's the equal sign? I can't find it. Um, you just write it on the board, duh. Okay, what? It, it didn't work out. <laughs> She's a terrible teacher. I'll write it on the board for you, <laughs> since you can't seem to do it. Okay, Sarah, fine. Write it on the board. Why don't you just get your homework out here? <laughs> oh, wow. Mrs. Smith had a lot of tests and papers to grade still. Okay, I wrote the question on the board for you. Ha ha ha. What's so funny? Three plus ten. Sarah! Okay, that's it. You have in school suspension. Everybody go home. I, I can't even deal with my job anymore. Oh my god. Why did I think I could be a teacher? Finally, home sweet home. Too bad I have all these papers to grade. Ugh, the teacher doesn't have homework, but they sure do have a lot of, well, teacher work after school. Oh my gosh, why did I eat so much ice cream? Blech. Ew, gross. Well, I guess I'll just sit here and grade papers. Oh wow, this student did terrible. Wrong, wrong, wrong. Marley, you want to play a game? We can play Roblox. Sorry, I'm the teacher now and very busy. Marley, come on, we can do some cool Roblox games. There's a new spy game and all sorts of fun things. Can't, Daisy, still grading these papers. Ugh. Ugh. So many papers. So many papers. Ugh. Marley, let's go get in the pool. You can't, Daisy. Still grading papers. You get an F. You get an F. You, 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 you get an F, too. You all fail. Wait, what? What? Oh, what time is it? Oh, my gosh. It's 8 a.m. I'm late for school. How can the teacher be late for school? This is so bad. This is so, so, so bad. Okay, where's my car? Where's my car? Ah! Daisy took my car. Okay, I can run there. It's good. Wait a minute. I forgot the papers. Oh, man. I'm totally going to be so late for my own class. Okay, papers, papers, papers. Got them. Oh, my gosh. I hope that they're not destroying the entire school because you know those kids are total brats. Huh. Finally, I made it. Huh. 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 And now I'm old, so I can't breathe because I ran that whole way, and that's what happens to old people. <laughs> Good morning, class. You mean afternoon? Could you get here on time? I mean, you are the teacher. Sarah, shh! Quiet, please. Well, she does have a point, Molly. What were you doing? You slept so late. I was grading all these horrible papers. You failed. And you failed. I didn't fail, did I, Molly? You got a C. You graded that wrong. No, I didn't. That's it. This, this classroom's a joke. I'm having a dance party. Well, what are you guys doing? You're the students. Get and who wrote 3 plus 10 equals poo? Uh, that would be me because it's hilarious. It is pretty funny. 3 plus 10 equals poo. <laughs> you, you all have detention. Well, um, we're not really interested in you being our teacher anymore. What? Okay, that's it. I quit! I wish I had never made that wish. Being a teacher is so much harder than I ever thought it would be. Oh my gosh. I don't want to be a teacher. I don't want to be a teacher. I'd rather be a toilet in the school bathroom than a teacher. Seriously, I can't do this. I can't do it. I can't do it. I can't do it. Wait a minute. I'll just use the spell and I'll reverse it back. Yeah, that's what I'll do. Besides, I'm wearing my Harry Potter glasses. I mean, I'm already magical just because of that. All right, here we go. I hope this works. I really hope this works. Ooh, this party's so much fun. 
Oh yeah, Mrs. Smith? Alakazam! Alakazoo! I'm trading lives with you! What is going on in this classroom? Sarah, get off my desk. You have detention. What? What? What's going on? Molly was our teacher. What are you talking about? Molly is certainly not your teacher. Molly, why were you standing up here? Um, I was just trying to tell you that um, Daisy and Sarah are misbehaving. What? You tattletale, Molly. Well, thank you for letting me know, Molly, but I have two eyes so I can see that they are being naughty on my own. Daisy, you have detention. What? I never had detention. Are you serious right now? <laughs> I guess swapping lives wasn't all that bad. I managed to get my sister Daisy detention. Molly, that is not an accomplishment. I can't breathe. I can't breathe. Daisy, you'll be fine. It's only one day after school. You can do your homework while you're sitting here. But, but the idea that I've had detention is, it's horrible. Oh, get over yourself. Sit down in your seat. Seriously, you're starting to annoy me. Okay, class. Okay. Um, did someone write 3 plus 10 equals poo on my board? Yeah, I think that must have been Sarah. Sarah? What? I didn't do it. It was Daisy. What? I didn't do it. It was Molly. What? No, I didn't. I was... I didn't do it. I don't care who did it. I'll just erase it. Don't do it again, guys. Seriously. I need a vacation. For once in my life, I understand what you mean. Truly, I do. Okay, class. I'm going to assign you a lot of homework tonight. I have to because, well, math is cool. I don't care. I'll do all the homework in the world. As long as I don't have to be the teacher. Really, Molly? You've turned over a new leaf. Yeah, but as you said, Mrs. Smith, math is cool. Oh my gosh! <laughs> this is insane! Molly, I, I'm not sure I like this. I'm not going to be able to sleep for a week. Daisy, don't be such a chicken. It's only Amanda the Adventurer. The Amanda the who? The Amanda the creepy? What's she gonna do to that cute little sheep, by the way? I don't know. She seems pretty evil, though. Girls, hi! It's Mom! <laughs> it's time to go to bed. You know, school tomorrow, that whole thing? Mom, we know it's you, and we know it's school tomorrow. It's the first day of school! Come on, Molly, be a little bit more excited. Go do your night routine! I'm excited about school. Besides, this Amanda the Adventure with is creepy. I'm out of here. Uh, Mom, I'll do my night routine in like five minutes, I promise. Molly, okay. But make sure you brush your teeth and get your backpack all packed up. Will do, Mom. Will do. Oh, my gosh. I wonder what's going to happen to Wooly. Amanda is just too, too crazy. Molly, go to bed. You cannot miss the bus for school tomorrow. It's the first day. Okay, Mom, I'm going right now. By right now, I mean in five more minutes. What's going to happen to Wooly? Don't hurt Wooly. Don't do it, Amanda. Don't hurt Wooly. Molly? Molly, you fell asleep on the couch! In your clothes and everything. Uh, you're obsessed with creepy things on Roblox. Wake up, Molly! You're gonna be late for school! Huh? What? 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 What's going on? Where's the man of the adventure? Where's Chucky? Where's Huggy Wuggy? Molly, that's just video games and shows you're watching on TV. Wake up! <laughs> I thought it was real for a minute. <laughs> What a crazy dream. Molly, the only nightmare you're going to have is if you're late on your first day of school. You're going to get detention. Huh? What? No. No, I just need some coffee. Give me some coffee. I don't function without coffee. Well, good morning, sleepyhead. I see you camped out on the couch last night. <laughs> I'm so sorry, Mom. I'll never let it happen again. Don't, don't ground me. Molly, you're totally faking those tears. What? Um, uh, well, maybe a little bit. <sighs> I'll make your breakfast to go. Now, go get your backpack. Hurry! 
I have the coolest backpack in all the school. Marty, what is that anyway? Uh, it actually refrigerates my lunch and all my snacks. It's amazing. Molly, you could have lunch in the lunch room. Yeah, I plan to, but I also need to have treats at the ready. You know, mm, when I start to get, like, super hungry. Oh, brother. Um, Molly, I made you a healthy breakfast burrito. Oh, you didn't have to do that, Mom. <laughs> I've got a donut. Perfect food for the first day of school. Oh, boy. Well, girls, <laughs> I'm so sad that summer vacation's over. <laughs> yeah, me too, Mom. But don't worry, we'll be back next summer. Uh-huh. Okay, well, see you later, girls. Bye, Mom. Have a great day. I know you'll miss us so much. They're gone. They're gone. <laughs> I've got my freedom again. Oh, I love school. I wish they had school every day. Every single day. Well, except for maybe Christmas. But I mean, no, even on Christmas after they open their presents. Oh my gosh, I love when the girls are at school. <laughs> there it is. Oh, amazing school. Amazing? Seems like more like a prison to me. Molly, don't be so negative. School is amazing. We learn so much. And... Well, there are school lunches. I like those a lot. <laughs> First day of school and it's already pizza day. Woohoo! Daisy, I was watching that show last night and I uh, was wondering what would we do if a man of the adventure was here in real life? Oh, that's ridiculous, Molly. You watch way too much of that stuff. Now, come on, I don't want to be late for class. All right, fine. Molly, sit in front of me. Sit right there. Okay, I don't know why you want to sit by me. Ah, uh, cause you're my sister, and also I love to be able to have a first row view of when you get detention. <laughs> oh, very funny. Good morning, class. I'm Miss Bryington, and I'm going to be your math teacher this year. You may have been expecting someone else, but no, it's me. Miss Bryington, we're supposed to have Mr. Smith for math. Yeah, this lady seems kind of crazy. Why is she wearing a hospital patient outfit? Maybe she escaped the insane asylum. Oh my gosh, Daisy, we're all doomed. The entire class is doomed. Molly, what are you talking about? She seems like an ordinary teacher to me. What? What's going on with Mrs. Bryanton? That's Chucky! Ch Chucky is our teacher! Miss Bryanton is Chucky! Molly, what are you talking about? I just see Miss Bryanton there. Daisy, it's Chucky! Excuse me. I'd like you to be quiet, please. We're about to start math. Um, okay, uh, but you look like Chucky! Molly, what has gotten into you? Obviously a lack of sleep and way too many scary things on TV and Roblox. Is he carving something onto our board with with his axe? Uh, does this not seem a little crazy to you, Daisy? Uh, no, I just see Miss Bryington with with a magic marker. But, 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 but he's, oh my God, he's writing something. What is he writing? Die, die, die! Oh my gosh, Daisy! I don't know what you're talking about. I love Chucky as my teacher. Oh, oh my God, a man of the adventurer! That's right. <laughs> I'm going to be your classmate this year and we're going to have so much fun. Especially since my best friend, well, is gone away permanently. Your best friend? Who do you mean? Wait a minute, do you mean Wooly? Oh yeah, <laughs> he had to, well, go away. Go away where? What are, you, what are you talking about? Ah, I'm out of here! Oh my gosh, this is the worst first day ever! Amanda the Adventurer and Chucky as my, as my teacher? I need some pizza, I need some pizza. Lunch lady, I need pizza stat! Sorry, I can't give you any lunch right now. I'm busy eating all this pizza. What? Oh, where's the lunch lady? I am the lunch lady. Huggy Wuggy's the lunch lady? Ah! Worst first day ever! No! No! Huggy Wuggy, don't eat all the pizza, you pig! 
Marley, wake up. You're having a bad dream. Marley, you're going to be late for school. Come on. Wake up. Wake up. Huh? What? Where am I? Oh, I'm home. Oh, my gosh, Daisy. We can't go to school today. What? What are you talking about, Marley? Of course we're going to school today. Today is the first day of school. Of the entire school year. Very important day. No, you don't understand. Chucky is our teacher. Amanda the Adventurer is one of the students there. She sat right next to me and she killed Wooly. And, 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 and the, lunch, the lunch lady is, is none other than Huggy Wuggy. <laughs> oh, that's a real wapple of a dream, Molly. Holy guacamole, that's ridiculous. I'm not kidding. I think it was a, 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 a dream, a nightmare from watching the wrong shows, Molly. It might be an omen. It might come true. Sometimes dreams come true. That's not realistic, Molly. Now get your backpack before Mom grounds you forever. Okay, fine. But I'm telling you, watch your back. Oh, man, my stomach kind of hurts. Time to go poo-poo. Don't be late, Molly. Excuse me, I'm brushing my teethy weethies. Ha! It's, it's, it's... It's Huggy Wuggy. <laughs> I have to brush my teethy weethies so I don't get any cavity wavities. Okay guys, it is summer vacation and I'm out of school, but my mom is already talking about back to school supplies. <sighs> I went to Walmart the other day and guess what? They already had back to school supplies. So today, I thought I'd escape the back to school supplies. It's still summer people, it's still summer. Stop bombarding me with back to school supplies. I don't wanna think about going back to school. It's not time for that. Stop it. Seriously, stop. These are all the faces that I make when I go to school. <laughs> oh, except for that one. I never make that one. Okay, for gym class, you definitely need a soccer ball. Because your gym teacher is going to be like, put on your gym uniform. Toss the ball around. And you cannot forget a cheese sandwich for lunch. It's a lunch staple, people. A lunch staple. But anyway, we're trying to escape this because seriously... It's not back to school yet. I still have a month and a half. Stop rushing me. This is more like it. Oh, no. I died. Ha! This is more like it. I like the sand. Reminds me of the beach. You know, summer vacation? You know that thing that we have every summer? It's like now when you go to the store, it goes right from leaving school, summer vacation, straight to back to school. What? No, I don't think so. Ah, I keep dying. This is bad. Okay, I, ne I need to stop having a rant. <laughs> Escaping back to school, do do do. Escaping back to school. Oh yeah. Okay, I just want to say that these drinks of soda look amazing. Ew! If your sandwich looks like any of these, tell your mom to do a better job because that's disgusting, people. <laughs> you have to have a key to start the car to get to school. Or the school bus. Uh, what? No. Anyway, that's a mean notebook. I don't want that for school. And really, all of these notebooks are mean because it has to do with school. And I don't want to go back to school because it's summer vacation. Ah, I died. Let's try this again. Come here, unicorn. I have a job for you. Eat all this homework. Man, I'm just so funny today. I can't even stand how funny I am. Uh-oh. Trixie Bridges. They're my least favorite part, and this is why. Because you always, always die. They're Trixie Bridges, Trixie Bridges, Trixie Bridges. That was my little song about Trixie Bridges. If you liked it, slam that like button. <laughs> I'm having a weird day. Sorry, guys. Maybe it's all this back-to-school stuff in my brain. Making me all worried about going back to school. <laughs> okay, which way was it? I forgot. Oh, yeah, all the way to the right. And then where, guys? Where? All the way to the left? Oh! Now, this is what I'm talking about. You see this? These are remotes. That means you can watch the brightly colored unicorn all day long during summer vacation. 
You guys should go out and ride your bike, though, because that's super fun. Play hide and seek, too. That's also super fun. Go swimming in a pool. That's really fun. Go to the beach if your family goes there on vacation. That'll be fun. Ooh, french fries. Now you're talking my language. School lunch is super awesome. It's like the best part of going to school, really. That in recess. Uh, this, ah, that scared me. Okay, lunch ladies. Where's the rest of the cheese? Why is there, like, looks like a big chomp out of it? Lunch lady is chowing down on the cheese. She took a bite out of every one. That is so rude. Just eat one slice of cheese, not the whole thing. Toilet paper! I think that's a rolling pin, but... Uh, it kind of looks like a toilet paper. Very essential for the school bathroom. No toilet paper spells disaster. <laughs> this is like when you're waiting in line at school and there's like 400 cars before your mom gets to pick you up. You're like, come on. I've had the longest day ever. Can you guys tell how excited I am about going back to school? Zero percent. But you know what I do like to do? I love to read. And even in the summer, I'll still read books because books are amazing and you guys should read them. Want to know why? Because you can go anywhere you want. You can have a totally amazing adventure inside of a book. Okay, that's what I'm telling you about today. Anyway, I don't know what these are. They look like giant chalkboards. Ah, here comes the chalk. This is where the teacher goes. <coughs> down the chalkboard with the math problems. And you're like, ah, my ears. They're bleeding. Just kidding. Do, 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 do. Ba, 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 ba. I love Roblox. Yes, I do. I love Roblox. How about you? Ba, ba, ba. I just died. I had to get really quiet there for a minute, guys, because if I can't escape these school supplies, oh boy. Boing, 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 giant erasers. Because if you're like me, you make a million mistakes. I need an extra large eraser. Whoa, I tried to cheat there, and guess what happened? I died! Don't get lazy in this game, because you'll be stuck here forever. Dun, 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 dun. Okay, I need to, like, just take a break. Ugh, this was so crazy. Ugh, this is so crazy. Look at all this stuff around me. Like, look at all this! Ah, okay, guys, I'm ready to continue on. Uh, but I keep dying. <laughs> Maybe I could get out of here in, like, a million years. So many back-to-school supplies here. Like, how many can I climb over in one day? It's like when you're at Walmart and there's endless aisles of notebooks and pens. And, like, oh, my goodness. How many pens do you need? Seven million pens at Walmart. I guess there's probably seven million kids going back to school, though. Whoa! That was super close. Okay, here we go. Now I'm going on these dice because when you have an after-school like group, sometimes you'll play games or something. I don't know. I'm just making that up. <laughs> don't listen to anything I'm saying. I don't know what I'm talking about. These look like giant gumballs. Now those I'd like to see at school. <laughs> boing, boing, boing. Okay, this is the part of gym that you all love. I think these are weights. I'm not really sure though, like, they may be, or they may not be. <laughs> Let me know in the comments below what you think they are. These are definitely weights. You can pump up some iron. <laughs> Do you guys think I'm funny? I think I'm super funny. I don't know, maybe I'm just crazy. Oh no, I died. It's okay people, I respawned. I died to get in the same spot. Holy moly. Come on, Molly. You're better than this. Come on. Okay, phew. These look like post-it notes. In case you have to remind yourself to do your homework. Like me. Woo! Music class! Oh, these might be rulers. <laughs> I thought they were piano keys. <laughs> I guess they could be whatever you want. Trixie Bridges time, people! Trixie Bridges. Okay, good. 
Good. Good. Bad. <laughs> Let's try again. Good. 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 Yeah. Woohoo. Oh, no. More Trixie Bridges? You can't have two Trixie Bridges right in a row. That is completely unfair. I don't like that at all. <laughs> well, I guess you just had to jump on the red blocks. That's not so bad. Whoa, what happened there? I guess you gotta jump on these. Okay, do not jump on this, like, orange part, because you will die. Then you'll be stuck in school supply land forever! Okay, who's still watching this video? Who's with me, people? To the end, to the end. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel, okay, guys? We put out awesome videos just like this one every single day. Not even kidding, guys. Not even kidding. And I love you guys. You're the best fans ever. I mean, seriously, I couldn't ask for better fans than you guys. <laughs> these are so cute. Look at these, like, big faces. I'm going to pretend they're, like, giant erasers because that's what they kind of look like. This game is fun. Escape back to school supplies. Whoa. A really cool maze. Oh my goodness. This is going to be... Uh oh. I died. Let's try this again. <sighs> you can do this, Molly. Whoa. What happened? Okay. I just saw a giant fidget spinner. Am I inside a giant fidget spinner? Okay, wait, I am so confused right now. Whoa. Whoa! Okay, I have to do this so that I can see where I'm going. But I think the school supplies are on this giant fidget spinner world? I don't know. So weird. Hey, don't judge. I didn't make this game, okay? I'm just playing it. <laughs> Tell the guy who made it or girl that made it. Weird. Huh, made it. Good. Oh my gosh, I think I see a minion over there. Maybe it's like a minion lunchbox. That would be cool. Minions are funny. Oh my gosh, they make me laugh. Okay, what is this? I don't even know what those are, but I gotta jump over this thing. Boing. Boing. My sister, Daisy, is so excited about back to school. Like, holy moly, she loves back to school. I'm like, what is wrong with you, Daisy? It's still the summer. We can sleep until noon. Stay in our pajamas all day. Eat cupcakes. Watch TV. Play hide and seek. Ride our bikes with friends. Minion! Okay. This is a really long walk. But I guess I got out of the school supplies. And the school supplies were inside a giant fidget spinner. Okay, let's go to the playground. Do, 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 do. I love Roblox, yes I do. I love Roblox, how about you? Da -da -da -da. I love Roblox, yes I do. I love Roblox, how about you? Shout it out to me in the comments below, people. Shout it out to the comments to me. Guys, look it. I've got a few more stages to go. I'm catching up on the on the person that's ahead of me, which is Dehajes12134. Yeah, I'm coming for you, Dehajes. Here I come. Here I come. Ba -da -ba 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 I like to sing songs when I go through this part because, okay, let's just face it. These are like ridiculously long. And I don't know why these people put these in here. Just just to be annoying, I think. Like, haha, -ha, you played my entire obby and now I'm just going to torture you at the end. Whoa, looks like there's a giant comb over there. What is that? Okay, guys, more jumping. Boing, 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 wee! A boing, a boing, boing, boing. Ah, so much jumping! Let me go to the playground. <laughs> oh, a ladder maze! I like these. Whoa, my goodness! It's a conveyor belt of death. A conveyor belt of death, people! Holy moly! I made it. <laughs> That's what I call those conveyor belts of death. This is true. They try to push you off to your death. Boing. Boing. 
boing. If you guys like playing escape games on Roblox, let me know in the comments below. I love them. If you couldn't tell by me playing them all the time. Wow. It's like a treehouse maze. That was so cool. Why are you floating up there? Probably because he can. I feel like I'm almost escaped. What is this? Okay, I've got to jump on this. Got it. I feel like I've almost escaped back to school supplies. Love it! Boing. 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 Oh, so much jumping! Do I get a cupcake now? <laughs> oh my gosh, there's a huge slide at the end. <gasps> I'm so excited! Whoa! Whoa! Then you go down slow. Ah, oh, fast! Then you go down slow. Yeah, I'm skipping that. Huge ladder and a pink slide. Gonna have so much fun. Here we go, guys. Here we go. Whoa! Head first. Ugh. Ouch. That kind of hurt. Oh, I made it. Yeah, let's go swing on the swings. It's gonna be awesome. Oh, I'm so glad that it's still summer and I escaped back to school supplies. Here we go, guys. Whee! So much fun. I don't know why I'm not actually sitting on the swing. That's kind of weird, but whatever. I'll float in the air. I don't care. All right, guys. Thanks so much for playing this game with me today. I had so much fun. And if you guys want to play it, you should, because it's so much fun. What's wrong with my arms? <laughs> my arms are permanently messed up. What is wrong with my arms? They're disconnected. Anyway, guys, ooh. <laughs> don't forget to. S Your hat is really cool, but look at my arms. My arms are way cooler. My arms are coming out of my head. <laughs> don't forget to subscribe to the Toy Heroes Games, where we put out awesome videos just like this one every single day. Hit that notification bell so you can be the first one to see when we put out new videos. Because, you know, you'd be an awesome number one fan. All right, guys. I'll see you tomorrow. Bye. Here comes Brookie now. Good morning, Molly. Good morning, Daisy. Good morning. Oh, Molly, I love your um autumn scarf. That's so cute. Yeah, she's been talking about it all morning. Something about getting ready for Halloween and stuff. Yeah, I'm so excited for Halloween and for fall and stuff. I don't know. I just I like when the leaves all change colors and stuff. Yeah, me too. But, um, Molly, your scarf looks adorable, but, um, you forgot something. Oh, my gosh. You're right. I forgot to get a pumpkin spice latte from, from, from Starbucks. Oh, my gosh. My day's going to go terrible now. No, Molly, that's not what you forgot. It isn't? Oh my gosh, I forgot a, a pumpkin spice um donut from, from Starbucks. Oh man, I don't have a pumpkin spice latte or a donut. This is going to be a doubly bad day. <laughs> no, Molly, what I meant is you forgot your book bag. Wait, what? Yeah, did you forget your homework again? Oh man, I was so busy putting on this adorable scarf that I forgot my backpack. Oh, I'm definitely going to get detention now. Well, Molly, you could hurry up and do your homework right now. Yeah, it was just a handout. You could go make a copy and then do your homework really quick before the bell rings. Huh, I think it's going to be too late. It's definitely going to be too late. <laughs> Not me. I always think of the best excuses. Good morning, class. Happy fall. Molly, you took my seat rude. Uh, I'm sitting here because I want to be the best student ever. Sitting right in the front row, of course. Right, Mrs. Smith? Uh, sure, Molly. <laughs> Turning over a new leaf, huh? Yeah, <laughs> a fall leaf. Get it? Because it's fall. Oh, brother. All right, everyone. Why don't we take out our homework and uh, we can hand that in. I want to get that over with right away. We want to see who did their homework and who didn't. Well, Molly. Daisy, shh. Um, Mrs. Smith, um, you see, uh, I did my homework, but there was this stray dog that was eating out of the dumpster. 
Oh, here we go. This is going to be a good one. It always is, Daisy. I can't wait to hear her excuse today and whether or not the teacher actually buys it. You guys, be quiet. Okay, this is the truth. I did my homework, but there was a stray dog outside the diner eating from the dumpster. I felt so bad. I went over to see if he needed help. I put my backpack down, but my homework was hanging out of it. I was like, are you okay, stray dog? He ran away, and then, um, well, um, somehow we got my homework out of my backpack and ate it. But he was starving, Mrs. Smith. I had to give him my homework. He was hungry. Oh, Molly. I can't stay for detention today. I have a date, so I guess you don't have detention. A date? Ooh la la! Ugh, my stomach feels kind of... That, never mind. Molly, I'm sitting right behind you. Excuse me. Oh, no, 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 I'm not done. Uh, teacher? Teacher, 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 teacher! I have to go to the bathroom! Oh, uh, okay, Molly. Are you just trying to get out of the pop quiz? No, 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 my stomach really hurts. I have to go potty, I have to go potty, I have to go potty. Uh, yeah, trust me, I'm sitting behind her, and it stinks back here. She has to go. All right, Molly, go ahead. Ha! Ah, thank you! I knew I shouldn't have eaten that bean burrito for breakfast. Oh, boy, oh, boy, oh, boy. Ah, 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 oh, my goodness. Ah, ah. Ah, that's better. Just gonna flush the toilet. Wait, why, why, why won't the toilet flush? Oh my god, this is so embarrassing! And I'm not done. Alright, I have to go into this next bathroom because I still have to go potty and that one won't flush. Yep, definitely shouldn't eat that bean burrito. Oh my gosh, okay, I just have to flush. Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! The toilet, it, 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 it started to overflow! Okay, I'll just walk out of the bathroom casually like nothing's happening. I'm as cool as a cucumber. I didn't overflow the toilet in the bathroom. No, 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 not me. <laughs> oh, boy. Someone get some air freshener. Stop! Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. The school is flooding. What? The school is flooding? What do you mean? The school is flooding. and I think it started in the bathroom. Um, uh, the school is flooding because of the bathroom? Uh, I don't know what they're talking about. Didn't you just go to the bathroom, Molly? No. Daisy, shh. Okay, everybody wait outside the school while I clean up this giant mess. Um, okay, if you say so. Oh, boy, that's a little embarrassing. Good thing nobody knows it was me. May I have your attention, please? This is your principal speaking. There will be an early dismissal today. Oh, it must be because it's raining and we're going to get a storm. Uh, yeah, it looks like uh, we're going like, to drown in this. You're getting an early dismissal because somebody overflowed all the toilets in the girls' bathroom. And now it's flooding all of Brookhaven. Get on the school bus immediately and go home. Marty, did you eat a bean burrito for breakfast? Uh, uh. You're flooding all of Brookhaven. What are you guys talking about? Marley went poo-poo and it's flooding all of Brookhaven. Ew, gross. Um, guys. I think we better get the school bus and get out of here. Well, you guys should be thanking me. We got an early dismissal. <laughs> There's a bus. Come on, guys. Anything to get out of this doo-doo water. Gross. Yeah, you could say that again. Uh, Molly, why are you driving? I don't know. I think the school bus driver, like, quit or something. I quit, too, if I had to do all these early dismissals. Okay, Molly, well, drive us home. All right, here we go. I don't know. I don't trust Molly's driving. I don't know what you're talking about. I'm a great driver. Watch out for that sign! Oh, boy. You really are a terrible driver, Molly. Are you guys sure that your mom won't mind I come over to your house? She's probably doing lots of work. Yeah, she works from home on Mondays, so, you know, no big deal. Okay, well, maybe we should just ask her first. Don't worry. She loves you, Brookie. Everything's going to be fine. Mom, we got out of school early. Wait, what? I, what are you doing home? Um, well, uh, Molly ate a bean burrito for breakfast and flooded the toilets and all of downtown is flooded. What? Oh, yeah, you guys are kidding me, right? <laughs> what really happened? 
No, for real. She really did flood the toilet. Molly! Oh my goodness! Don't eat a bean burrito again. Is it okay if I hang out over here? Of course, Brookie! Mom, I thought you had a bunch of work to do. Uh, yeah, I'm just taking a little lunch break. I was about to watch some TV and... You eat a Hershey bar for lunch? And you're always nagging me about eating healthy. Well, uh, I'm a grown-up and you're a kid. Alright, guys. First thing we do on our um, early dismissal routine is get a delicious snack. What do you guys want? I got waffles. I got ice cream. I got pizza. Ooh, pizza sounds delicious. Mm. I am so too. Help yourself to anything you want, guys. Mm. That is some delicious pizza. What do you guys want to do? You want to, like, ride bikes or something? First, I want to, like, just chill out and watch some TV. Because, um, yeah, I don't get to watch TV during the day that much. And I really want to because there's always good shows on. No, there's not, Molly. Really? The Puppy and Kitten show is on. Who doesn't like that? I like that. I love early dismissals. Mm. You guys should have eaten an apple to my child feel. Does she even know how to be cool? Seriously. Puppies and kittens, they're so cute. Ah, I'm so glad I'm not at school right now and taking a pop quiz. Instead, my stomach is full of pizza and my brain is full of puppies and kittens. Yeah, this is fun, but like, let's go outside and ride our bikes or something. Good idea. Come on, let's go. Have fun, girls. Be safe. We will, Mom. Oh, man. School bus got, like, stuck right there. <laughs> Molly, I love your bike. Thanks. I just got it. And um, the color green is, like, it glows in the dark at night so nobody, like, runs into you or anything. Oh, that's awesome. Hey, where's Daisy? She said she was going to stay inside and do some studying. Of course she did. Whee! Uh-oh. Where's the brakes? Where's the brakes? Oh, ow. Ow, ow. Molly, are you okay? Oh, I'm underneath the bus. Ah. Uh. Well, Molly, you don't look too hurt. I mean, besides the fact that you ran into the bus and it looks like you're missing some of your teeth. What? Missing some of my teeth? Wah! It's okay, Molly. I'm sure the dentist can, like, sew them back in or something. You want to go to the park? Um, uh, yeah, okay. Ooh, Brookie, look. It's the Brookhaven Cemetery. I double dog dare you to go in. What? You didn't even say d um dare first. You just went to double dog. Well, yeah, because I definitely want you to go in there. I'm not afraid. I could go in there. There's, there's nothing in there. I gotta see this one. <laughs> right before Halloween, she goes into a graveyard. She's super brave. See, Molly, there's nothing in here to be afraid of. Not a single... Oh, my God! Is that a ghost? Molly, run! Ah! Oh, my God, oh, my God, oh, my God. <sighs> there's a ghost in the cemetery! Of course there is! There's a lot of dead people in there! <sighs> well, Molly, <laughs> this has been a pretty crazy early dismissal routine. Yeah, there was nothing routine about it. And, um, Molly, you might want to go have your teeth sewn back in. Yeah, I'll worry about that tomorrow. Right now, I just want to soak up this autumn sun while I'm not in school. So, Molly, do you want to tell me what happened to your teeth? Uh, well, uh, well, it all started at school because I had a bean burrito. Oh, boy, I can tell already this is going to be one crazy story. <laughs> Molly, Molly, our alarm went off. Molly, come on, it's time to wake up for school, lazy bones. <coughs> Seriously, Molly, I'm going to have to jump on you. Boing, 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 boing. Daisy, why are you bothering me right now? <coughs> Achoo! Whoa, Molly, you're sneezing a lot. What's wrong with you? I'm not really feeling too good. Yeah, you're fine, Molly. Come on, you don't want to miss lunch today. We're having pizza at school. No, I don't think I want any pizza. Oh, Molly, liar, liar, pants on fire. Pizza's your favorite. Now get up. Come on. Ugh, fine, Daisy. Molly, don't go that way. We just installed a diving board. Ah, there's a diving board out my room. Oh, my God.
gosh, I walked out the door, and then I fell into the pool. Oh my gosh, that would be cool on any other day but today. Today, I... Uh, achoo! Sneezy and... <coughs> coffee and... Ugh, not feeling good. Molly, don't be faking it. Come on, time for school. Okay, Daisy, I'm coming. Why are you walking so slow? I'm not. This is just as fast as I can go. Molly, do you want some breakfast? No. I can't eat any breakfast. Well, Molly, breakfast is the healthiest way to start the day. Yeah, okay, Daisy, if you say so. Ugh, I hope she doesn't come in here. Uh, maybe a nice relaxing bath will make me feel better. <coughs> uh, I think I definitely have a cold. Molly, Molly, open up. Time for school. Now I have to go to the bathroom before we go. Occupy, Daisy. Occupy. Molly, you been in there for 30 minutes. Daisy, I just got in here. Molly, open up, open up, open up. Uh, does anybody else think it's weird that there's a spotlight in the bathroom? What are we putting on a performance or something in here? La 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 la! Okay, I think that's totally weird. Okay, that's the weirdest light in a bathroom I've ever seen. Molly, open up! Can I go to the bathroom now? Boom chicka boom chicka boom boom boom. A boom chicka boom chicka boom boom boom. Whatever, Daisy. I'll just relax here till she gets back. <coughs> Achoo! <coughs> Molly, are you seriously seeping again? Huh? No, no. Well, Molly, what's wrong with you? I told you I don't feel good, Daisy. I don't believe you. You're such a fake. -o. I'm not faking, Daisy. Come on, let's go to school. Whoa! She's grumpy. She woke up on the wrong side of the bed today. How come I'm so much bigger than this car? I can't, I can't take this car anyway. He's too tiny anyway, Molly. Okay, let's see. To school we go. Molly, please seem a little cheery about it because right now you seem like the grumpiest sister in the whole world. Oh, I told you already. <coughs> Achoo! I think I'm sick. Well, you are sneezing a lot, Molly. I know. Totally. Boom, chicka, boom, chicka, boom, boom, boom. A boom, chicka, boom, chicka, boom, boom, boom. Daisy, turn that noise down. Oh, Molly, you sound like a grumpy old guy. Oh, you know who's like, turn down that racket and get off my lawn. <laughs> Santa, I know him. Ho, 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 ho! I'm on vacation until next Christmas. See, I'm in my swim trunks. Santa! I really want a pony for Christmas. Daisy, he's on vacation. Leave him alone. Jeepers creepers. Dun, da, dun, 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 dun. School. Ugh. Molly! Don't be such a grumpy Gus. I guess my first class is computer lab. Oh, let's see what's going on today. Okay, my computer doesn't seem to be working. Hello? Computer? <coughs> Molly, could you please stop coughing on um, my computer? That's not nice. Well... <coughs> It's not like I can help it, Daisy. I told you. Huh? Huh? Molly, don't you dare sneeze on my keyboard. Huh? Okay, I'm holding it in. Thank you, Molly. Achoo! Molly! Why are you sneezing on my keyboard? Rude. I had to put on this mask so I don't get sick. Seriously, Daisy? You didn't believe me that I was sick this morning, and now you're putting on a mask? Well, I thought about it, Molly, and with all your sneezing and coughing, I think you're definitely sick. Oh, funny, very funny. You should get out one of those masks, too. I don't know where they are, but I sure could use a sandwich. Molly, you can't eat a sandwich in, um, computer lab? Well, watch me. 
Yum, 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 yum. Yum, yum, yum. I don't have one of those fancy masks. Sorry, Marley. It stinks to be you, I guess. Daisy! That was rude! Oh, I don't feel so good, Daisy. Well, Marley, maybe you should go to the school nurse. No! I don't want to go to the school nurse! But Marley, she'll have you lay down and maybe you'll feel better later. Or maybe she'll send you home. Ah, uh, okay. Come on, Molly, I'll walk you down. Really? Yeah, it seems like you need a friend right now. And a good sister. Well, I'm glad you believe me that I don't feel good. Yeah, Molly, come with me. Come to the school nurse. Ugh. It's getting worse, Daisy. Ah, shoo! It's definitely getting worse. Hi, we're here to help my sister. Hey, students, how are you today? Well, not so good. Not so good at all. I'm so sorry to hear that. Um, what what seems to be the problem? It's not with me. It's with my sister, Molly. I'm just here for moral support. Yeah, she's here for moral support. Okay, well, what's what's wrong? I'm all achoo! Sneezy and <coughs> coffee and, and all that kind of stuff. Oh, man. Sounds like maybe you should go see the doctor. Oh, maybe she should go into the hospital. Um, I don't know about that. I don't know. Let me see. Oh, my gosh. Nope, definitely not going in there. Molly, maybe you need it. No, I can just see the nurse. I'll be fine. Hi, Molly. What brings you to my office? Oh, my goodness. Oh, my, my stomach is t uh, starting to hurt and... Um, well, I I have a cough, and and I have a runny, stuffy nose, and I keep sneezing. Oh, that sounds terrible, Molly, but I don't hear you sneezing or coughing now. Are you sure you're not okay? No, I'm really not okay. I think I might go lay down in one of these cribs. <sighs> Molly, you're not supposed to be in a crib. Get out of there. I just need to lay down. I don't feel good. <coughs> At you! Whoa, you do sound like maybe you have a cold. Okay, why don't you go sit right over there? Okay, I will. It's really nice to see you, Molly. I just wish it was under better circumstances. Would you like me to help heal you? Yeah, but then I think you should probably send me home. Okay, well, I'm giving you some medicine now for your cold, and then I can call your mom if you want, and she can come get you. I think that's probably best. Achoo! I definitely, I definitely don't feel good, Dr. Hart. Okay, well, I need you to go next door and lay down on the cot until your mom gets here. Okay. Molly, what did you find out? Molly! Molly, come back here. I'm talking to you. Molly! Okay, I want to lay down, but I don't, I don't understand how. Huh. Molly, what happened? When I saw the school nurse and at first she didn't believe me just like you. And then she said, um, she said, tell me how you don't feel good. And I told her, he'll take this magic healing apple, Molly. Thanks, Daisy. And then basically, um, I started coughing and sneezing and she gave me some medicine. She said she was going to call mom. I think that's probably a good idea, Molly. And I'm really sorry that... Um, basically, I didn't believe you and asked you to come to school. It's okay, Daisy. It's okay. I love you. You're the best sister. And okay, not always the best sister, but you're a pretty good sister. Hey, I think I'm the best sister. I wouldn't go that far, Molly, but, you know, seriously, I hope you feel better. Thanks, Daisy. Me too. Me too. Toy Hero fans, don't forget to subscribe to the Toy Heroes channel so basically you can see where Marley gets battle. Yeah, and we have lots of fun at this cha ah, achoo! channel too. Huh. Okay guys, if you could say get well soon in the comment section below, that would be really nice. I'll see you guys next time. Bye! Daisy, I can't believe we're on the school bus, and today is our first day of school! Hi, Amelia. Welcome to the first day of school. Oh, hey, Molly. Um, I'm not sure if I'm going to ride the school bus today or not. Why not? Aren't you going to school? Um, maybe she's not going to school. 
Molly, she has to go to school. Today's the first day. Oh, uh, maybe she forgot her backpack at home. Molly, look, she's running about in front of the bus. Amelia, get on the bus. You're going to be late for your first day of school. Holy moly, she must have forgot her shoes or her book bag or something. Molly, that's so bad. I know, Daisy, it's so bad. Um, Mr. Bernhardt, are we going to leave soon? We're leaving right now, Molly. Okay, everybody keep seated. We're already seated, Mr. Bernhardt. Whoa, Mr. Bernhardt, slow down, you're going super fast. Sorry, I was waiting for another student. Hey, anime! Oh my gosh, I haven't seen you since last year. Whoa, that guy looks kind of mean. I don't know him. I think his name is Chase. He's a he he is a a fifth grader. Wow, maybe that's why he looks mean. <laughs> uh, Doctor Bert. I mean, not Doctor. I mean, <laughs> I called you Doctor, Mister Bernhardt. Yes, Molly. Um, I was wondering if you had your eyes checked over the summer. Um, no. I think you probably should because, um, you're driving on the sidewalk. Uh, no, I'm not. I get yeah, Mr. Bernhardt, and also, um, anime is trying to get off of the bus and you're gonna run her over. Oh my gosh, be careful, Mr. Bernhardt! Um, Daisy, maybe we should walk the rest of the way. No, Molly, I'm sure it'll be fine. Here we go. Wow. Mr. Bernhardt, your driving is terrifying! Oh my gosh! We just rolled over in the bu- Ah! Mr. Bernhardt, what are you doing? Molly, I'm scared! I'm gonna go! No, Daisy, you're missing it! There's a unicorn! Oh my gosh. There was a unicorn and you missed it. Daisy! Ah! <laughs> ah! This is the craziest first day of school ever! Oh my goodness, Mr. Bernhardt, you're gonna wreck- You're gonna wreck the bus! Molly, get off before it's too late! Ah, it's too late, Daisy! I can't get out! Molly, hurry! Holy moly! Ah! Ah! He's gonna wreck the bus! Oh my gosh! That girl's picking up the bus. We gotta get out of here! Ah, crazy! Daisy! I can't believe the school bus picks us up even before the sun comes up. I know, Molly. That's way too early. Agreed, Daisy. Agreed. Wow, look at all these people running to the school. They're going to be totally late. I know, Molly. They're going to be late. Well, not really because school doesn't start till 7 a.m. Hey, watch where you're going, Chase. Jeepers creepers. These fifth graders, they can drive cars and they just get crazy. Hey, wait a minute. They didn't drop us off near the school at all. We're back in another neighborhood. I don't even know where I am right now. I don't know either, Molly. Nothing looks familiar. Oh, my gosh. Oh, there's another school bus. Maybe we can ride that one instead, Daisy. Mr. Bernhardt really needs to have his eyes examined. Daisy? I'm right here, Molly. Jeez. Don't run in the road, Daisy. Mr. Bernhardt might run us over. He needs glasses so bad. I know, Molly, he does. Well, Daisy, maybe I should drive the school bus. <laughs> Molly, don't be ridiculous. I'm not, Daisy. Somebody's got to get us to school. What? I can't drive this? Are you kidding me? Oh, hi. Um, can we ride this school bus because... Whoa, I'm floating. <laughs> because I... Oh my gosh! This is the craziest first day of school ever! Oh my gosh! Daisy, where are those school buses? Molly, this is so weird. Are you sure we're not dreaming right now? Yeah, Daisy, I'm sure. This is just... It's insane! Ugh, I've been running forever. I haven't even gotten to school yet. Guys, did you have the same problem as us at school? Uh, with this school bus? Yeah, Molly, we all did. Oh, we made it, Daisy! Welcome to the first day of school. Yeah, Molly, this is going to be the best school you revel. Hey, cool monster shirt. First day of school clothes are so cool. Well, Daisy, should we go inside? 
No, Molly, I don't think it's open yet. See, the stars are still out. You wanted to leave too early. Five o'clock in the morning is too early, Molly. Uh, I don't know. Let's check the doors. Maybe they're open. They're open, Daisy. Okay, Molly, you're just being crazy. Okay, well, I've got to go pick up my schedule from the main office. Hi, uh, Molly and Daisy, please. We need our schedules for the school year. Okay, thanks. Wow, everybody's coming in here for their school schedules. Daisy, I gotta go to the bathroom really quick before classes start. Do, 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 ba, 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 do. Molly, I'm right next door. <laughs> I wonder why they give you a fishing rod in here. <laughs> go fishing at the lake. I'm not supposed to fish in here. <laughs> Molly, you're crazy. <laughs> Come on, Molly. We're going to be late. Oh, got to avoid that room. It's detention. Okay, let's see. What's my first subject? It's, it's math class, Molly. Mine too. Okay, let's go. Man, we're so early. Not even the teacher is here yet. Good morning. I am your new teacher, Mr. Shootamaker. Today, we're going to learn about addition and subtraction. Oh boy, I love addition and subtraction. It's easy. But we're only learning about it today so that we can have it as a refresher because tomorrow we're going to start multiplication. Multiplication? Are you crazy? We're still little kids. We must think that we're ready, Molly. Please take the assessment that is on your desk so I can see where you are with your math skills. Most of it is just addition and subtraction. Okay, okay, okay. Let's see. What's it say? Um, One plus one. Okay, that's super easy. Two. Two plus two. Um, let's see. Four. Molly, these problems are really easy so far. Shh! There's no talking during this assessment. Uh, okay. Uh, five plus five is ten. Excuse me, can I go to the bathroom? You had time to go to the bathroom in between classes. No, I really didn't. I, I have to go again. Okay, but make it quick. Oh my goodness. Uh, math class. Phew. Just needed a little breather. Uh, uh. Molly, come back and finish your assessment. Hey, there's a motorcycle in the hallway. Okay, um, that's crazy. I'm going to get run over. Ah! Holy moly. Okay, I'm going back to finish my assessment now. Just needed a little break. Oh, wow. I only have two more problems. Seven plus seven. 7 plus 7. Uh oh, I can't remember this one. I can't remember this one. I'm going to fail. Molly, please be quiet. Oh, sorry. 7 plus 7. 14. Molly, please stop yelling out the answers. Molly, you're going to get detention. Okay, class. I need you to leave your assessments on the uh, desk that you're at, and you're dismissed. Ah, phew. I made it through class number one on my first day of school. Ah. <sighs> Math class. Whoa, school uniforms? When did that become, like, a thing? I don't know, Molly. Holy moly, I can't believe it. Oh, you have to buy it. Well, good thing, because I don't even want to wear it. <laughs> Daisy, are you wearing that? No way, Molly. Okay, let's see. Which class do I have next? Is it time for lunch yet? Oh, I wish it was time for lunch right about now. The library? No. Art class! Do, 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 ba, 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 do. Daisy, I don't have art class yet. Come on. We have to go to computer class next. Let's see. <laughs> Roblox. Good morning, class. Now there's no playing Roblox on your computers. Oh, man. Today, we're going to see how fast you can type. 
type? Who wants to do that? Of course I can type fast. Not me, Miley. I'm kind of slow at typing. I need to learn how to type battle. Uh, okay, Daisy. First, I'd like you to type this sentence into the chat box, please. Um, I can't. It won't let me type in there. I think my computer might be broken. Oh, no, Molly. Well, I guess you're just going to have to watch today. Oh, no. I like to, I like to t type. I, d I don't understand why it won't work. Oh, oh, wait. No, that didn't work. Never mind. These computers are all broken, Daisy. Where's our tax dollars going? I don't mind you, right? <laughs> okay, well, since I can't work on the computer, I guess this class is over. Do, 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 ba, 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 do. Okay, I'm just going to close my chat pad. Since it won't even work. Ah, it won't close either. I'm getting out of this class. This is ridiculous. Molly, next we have art. Okay, let's go. Molly, someone's sleeping in class. Oh my gosh. They're totally going to fail. Azuria, you better wake up, Azuria. Wake up, Azuria. The teacher's going to come and you're going to fail. Azuria. Oh my gosh. Who sleeps in art class? This place is awesome. I know, Molly. It is awesome. Okay, class, everybody take a paintbrush, please. Okay, check. Got it. Now I'm going to paint a beautiful painting. I don't know what I'm going to paint. Do you, Daisy? No, Molly, I don't know yet. Just paint what you feel. Oh, this is a cool teacher. She's telling us to paint what we feel. I feel like my paintbrush is too thick to paint what I want. Okay, there's tons of bikes falling on me. Ow! Oh, Chew through a bike at me in art class! Holy moly, who is throwing bikes? Are you kidding me right now? There's a ghost in this school. Okay, my paint's not working all of a sudden. What is going on? What? I used up all my available paint? Are you kidding me? And there's another bike in here! Why is... Oh, it's Molly! The bike fell on me! <laughs> Daisy! Come on! Daisy! What? Where? Daisy, where are you going? Daisy! Molly, the school is haunted! Oh! Oh, Daisy, come on. I was I was doing a palm tree at a beach, but come on. I'll take you to the school nurse. Follow me, Daisy. Put your paintbrush away. Molly, the haunted bike is back. It's following us. Okay, this is weird. Come on, Daisy, this way. I think this is the right way. Molly, that was so scary. Okay, I don't know my way around this school, Daisy. Molly, I just need to go to the nurse because I think I need a band-aid. It'll be okay, Daisy. It'll be okay. Forgot to put my paintbrush away. Whoops. Come on, Daisy. Go in there. That's the way to the nurse's office. It'll be okay. Just you sit down right there, and I'm going to get some potion over here to help you. Okay. I'm going to paint it on your leg. Molly, no, you're not. Yeah, I am, Daisy. You need it, okay? You definitely need it. Okay, here we go. Well, Molly, that, that get better potion really helped. I'm glad, Daisy. I'm glad. Ugh, are you okay now? I can't believe that. This place is haunted. The, there was there was a bike going everywhere. I know, Molly. It was crazy. Ugh, well, at least it's over now. Daisy, don't go down there. That's detention. 
Okay, we better get to our next class. It's English. I'm gonna sit up front. Whoa, Molly, really? Like a good student? Yeah, like a good student. Good morning, class. Good morning. I hope you don't have a haunted bicycle in here. Um, what are you talking about, Molly? Ah, well, you see that there was a haunted... There was a haunted bicycle in our class. Oh, Molly, we don't... We don't like fibbers in the, this English class. She's not lying. Look at the band-aid on my knee. There was a haunted bicycle. Okay, you're both going to detention because you're lying. What? This is so ridiculous. There really was a haunted bicycle. No, I have to go to detention. Haha, <laughs> Daisy, we ran into each other. So crazy, I gotta go to detention. Excuse me, I have to go to detention. Daisy, you're being so naughty right now. Well, Molly, we don't even deserve to be in here, so I'm gonna sit here. Okay, everybody, take a seat in detention. I'm Daisy. <laughs> boing, 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 boing. Did, 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 did. I'm out of here. I'm not sitting in detention. This is ridiculous. Besides, school's almost over. This school is haunted. I'm going outside. It's so seriously ridiculous. I'm going home or fishing in the lake or something. Come on, Daisy. Get in this really bad car over here. What? Ouch! Kicked me out. Is the car haunted too? Uh, help! I've fallen on the ground! Daisy, can you drive? Daisy? Molly, I'm jumping! Yeah, I saw that, Daisy. Okay, can you drive? I don't have the keys, Molly. Daisy, drive us somewhere! I can't, Molly! I don't have the keys! Oh, my goodness! Okay, well, I guess we don't have a car. What a crazy first day of school! Aren't the first days of school always crazy, though? Yeah, Molly, I think that they are! Oh, guys, if your first day of school is crazy, too, let us know in the comments below! Now I have to remember which way to get home. Ah, oh, soccer practice! That looks like so much fun to play. Yeah, Molly, I thought it looked fun too. How do we get in, Daisy? Do you know? Not really, Molly. Maybe you gotta be a part of the soccer team. Oh my gosh! That girl just died. That was terrible. What's that over there? That looks crazy. Well, somebody's camping over there. <gasps> Maybe we should go camping too, Daisy! Alright, Toy Hero fans, thanks so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel. Yeah, don't forget to subscribe. You guys are the best fans ever. Yeah, it would make us so happy if you subscribed. We'll see you guys next time. Bye!